Blockbuster. 007. Everything or nothing. Read it T for T. Yeah, Avalanches, rock slides, and more in 1080 Avalanche. This time, the mountain hits back. Rated everyone. Catch you. This is Dragonius Crazy Legius. I should know. I created him. Are you ready to create a monster? Amazing Island lets you make millions of them. Download them to your Game Boy Advance and compete with your friends. Amazing Island. We made the game. You make the monsters. Rated everyone. This week on Animal Crossing for Nintendo GameCube. All Rob does is fish. Fish and see his pals. I'm the one getting the job, attending the... Welcome to Animal Crossing, the live game that's happening every minute of every day, whether you're playing or not. Rated everyone. Here's the true story. The four friends pick to live in a video game. And find out what happens when they stop being themselves. And start being someone else. Animal, Animal Crossing. For Nintendo GameCube. Today I was like, let's redecorate the house. And I was like, maybe we should buy some furniture first. Nice outfit. Where'd you get it? A garbage dump? Uh, yeah. Welcome to Animal Crossing. The live game that's happening every minute of every day, whether you're playing or not. Winter's coming soon. Should I make pants for that? Rated E for everyone. Here is a true story. Of four friends pick to live in a video game. And find out what happens when they stop being themselves. And start being someone else. Animal, Animal Crossing. Crossing. Turn into the GameCube. A sheep moved into the village today. Sweet. Why am I always the one organizing the treasure hunts? Maybe I'd like to sit around blasting techno music all day. Welcome to Animal Crossing, the live game that's happening every minute of every day, whether you're playing or not. I'll trade you some wallpaper for your UFO. You think I'm a chump? Try the raccoon. Where did he eat for everyone? Here is a true story. Of four friends pick to live in a video game. And find out what happens when they stop being themselves. And start being someone else. Animal, Animal Crossing for Nintendo, Nintendo GameCube. A walrus moved into the village today. Hot. I've just been fishing, you know, seeing some pals. All Rob does is fish. Fish and see his pals. I'm the one getting the job, attending the go- Welcome to Animal Crossing, the light game that's happening every minute of every day, whether you're playing or not. Hey, it's called the lawnmower. Other people have to live here too, you know. Ready to eat for everyone. Here's the true story. The four friends pick to live in a video game. And find out what happens when they stop being themselves. And start being someone else. Animal, Animal Crossing. Crossing for Nintendo, Nintendo GameCube. GameCube. Nobody wants to trade insects with me, no matter how many notes I leave them. Why am I always the one cleaning the house and picking the peaches? Where's my big fat hammock time? So tense. Welcome to Animal Crossing, the life game that's happening every minute of every day, whether you're playing or not. So do you want to swap fossils with me later, or...? Ready to eat for everyone. Do you have what it takes to be the next Beyblade World Champion? This is your chance to prove it! Super Tournament Battle! Available now for your Nintendo GameCube system. Or let it rip on your Nintendo Game Boy Advance with Ultimate Blader Jam! Rated everyone! Each sold separately! Hey! Nice try. Dance off. You can get the moves to school the Goombas with Dance Dance Revolution Mario Mix. Bring it. Ready, everyone. Introducing Disney's Magical Mirror, only for Nintendo GameCube. Ready to for everyone. Now you can connect with Disney's Magical Quest on Game Boy Advance. Go away! Let's do this.
traps. Let's go, traps. Yeah. 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 Woo, woo. Okay, I'm gonna work on that. Let's go. Plug it in. Two, yeah. three, four. Can they play without smiling? Game us ready! Bongo! You must not smile, idiot! What doggy doing? Little man smile! What is that? Donkey Kong away the bangles! 39 quid 99! Only on Nintendo GameCube! All right, I'm here for your consideration today. We have Super Monkey Ball on the Nintendo GameCube. And this will be my first time ever playing it. I never played it even for two minutes or just never played it. But over the years, I heard Joe, and I'm going to connect the, uh, the GameCube here. And if you heard that, that's because the commercials are being played by... Uh, an Xbox 360, actually. So, over the years I heard I'm a big fan of GameSack. Joe and Dave, now just Joe. And uh, over the years I heard him talking about this game quite fondly. Okay? And uh, I've always be been curious about... See the monitor starting off now. I've always been very curious about the game. It looks fun. I'm not going to promise I'm going to 100% and none of that. I'm starting quite late today. Usually I start earlier, a bunch of shenanigans, and I wasn't sure how I was going to play commercials on this here monitor because this is a VGA monitor, a CRT monitor. This is not uh, a consumer television. So as a result, it's 480p and above. So even a GameCube, if you were to start a 480i mode, you're going to get no signal. Um, and I'm going to reduce this to 14. I tested all the audio earlier. Okay. I'll start this. There we go. Now, it's actually quite a, quite a noisy console. But I, I, uh, I put a theater here to turn off the, you know, reduce the noise. Because, yes, it was quite loud. I thought it was something wrong with my audio line first, but it's just uh, the GameCube. Uh, all right, so we're connected via VGA. How's that possible? Well, hang until the end of this here play playthrough and I will show you uh, where the treasure's hidden and how is that possible. But it is pretty much a VGA, a Wii VGA cable going to the back going to the back of a gchd mk2 uh component slash hdmi adapter that goes on the back of the gamecube which is awesome similar to carby but you know the Wii port for components for the suite and offers something more uh okay i'm not sure why the uh why the image didn't come on. I think I know why. Because it turns out if you connect um, your GameCube to your Xbox VGA, it doesn't work, wouldn't you know? There we are. <laughs> okay. And the sound, my good sir. It's a massive cable. It's all real footage here. There's no overlays. It's all real cables, real analog cables. There we go. Okay, so this here Swiss. It's uh, if you're not familiar with it, with this here is uh, awesome. It's uh, one of the best pieces of home brew ever conceived by man mankind. You just it's you can do so much with it from GBI for your uh, and you might have noticed a Game Boy player uh, when I play on the GameCube before I disconnected it but I I don't feel like doing that every time it's usually under it I think it matches quite well and I like the looks in fact so much so 
that I'm used to it that's in the uh, GameCube without it. It's kind of weird to me. So, another show of power here that you can do with the uh, custom homebrew and all modded consoles is that Super Monkey Ball is 480i only. So in other words, if my console was unmodded, which I do have a few stock GameCubes laying around, if I was just to come in and pop the disc in and plug it in, it would not work because this monitor, or not with this monitor, it shuts down whenever it gets 15 kilohertz, which is 480i, 240p, and all that. Uh, so by having for, Swiss can force a game to 480p. There's also widescreen patches, but 480p, uh, 4x3, that's what I'm into right now. Looks amazing here in person, this monitor. Let me make sure everything's in the shot here and everything's focused and we should, uh, should get started. I never played this game. I don't know anything about it other than game sack. So, okay. Make sure everything is working. Okay, let's go. So basically, yeah, and obviously uh, I got, if you've seen it here, I have the GC loader. Now the GC loader is an ODE. And I bought two of them, one for my PAL GameCube, which does RGB. That's why I have a PAL GameCube. And you can still play NTSCU and NTSCJ games on it. Uh, and I got one for this one here, which is a Japanese GameCube. Uh, they recently, they recently um, talk a, a little, tiny, tiny, tiny bit about it. If you, I don't think there's anybody here anyway. So the GC Loader... It's an ODE, replace your disk drive, your disk reader, reader, and you can insert, you know, um, SD cards and just play your backups and do a bunch of amazing uh, homebrew. Homebrew, for example, my memory card was full with Resident Evil 4 saves, and it was giving me a hard time. So I use an app here that is called, a program here that's called um, Memory Card Backup Loader or something and backed everything up formatted it it's, it's awesome and i can put it back again if i want to it's just great and uh yeah i'm a bit disappointed with the gc loader because they did not ship ship to the uk which is where i live i've been here for 13 years five in scotland seven in england and has been good to me uh no i will not move out of the country because i don't like the pal system that's not how it works uh, you know you can like a lot about a place and not one thing or another and that's still fine you know don't have to be everything or nothing but uh yeah they ship everywhere on earth but the uk so they have a redistributor which is games connection but it's never in fucking stock i don't think they have notifications just sell it away already stop the bullshit brexit happened a long time ago you know let's find ways around it for fuck's sake so as a result, I'm not going to bother with it again because I want it for some of my other game cubes. It's my dream here to play Mario Kart Double Dash with my family on our own game cubes and monitors via LAN with a broadband adapter. It's going to hurt my wallet, but I want that happening. And uh, now there's Pico Boot because GC Loader was out of stock for like a gazillion years. I was a young man last time they had the damn thing in stock. And unfortunately, uh, you know, well, fortunately, actually, because competition is good, uh, a lot more competitors came up, and one of them is the Pika Boot, which is a lot cheaper, okay? And so, if you want to mod your GameCube and have all this, I would suggest the Pika Boot. Look up Macho Nacho Connections, Macho Nacho Productions, uh, on YouTube, Tito, yeah, Tito, and he has, um, he has a video on the Pika boot, and you find other people too. Enough horse shit. I don't have the little pixel art thing for the monitor. Sorry, I didn't have the time. I, I've been streaming here every day, so I'll, I'll take care of it. And this is the first time I ever use a known uh, Trinitron in my channel. So this has been in storage, has been wrapped up in film protector on the screen, and I love it. I, you know, took it out of the wrapper here, and it worked right away. So another thing you can do, yeah, like I was saying, monkey ball, and there you go, that's what the games look like. Yeah, so for example, let's just take a look here. So if you go, let's say Luigi's Mansion, and you go to Cheats, 
look at that. You have widescreen and I have the cheats. I don't care for cheats, but the, what I'm interested in here is the widescreen. True widescreen expands your field of view. Obviously, that's going to be useful for this uh, this monitor here. But if you have a widescreen monitor, uh, or a, you know, it doesn't matter if you CRT, LCD, OLED, then you can take advantage of that. And of course, we're outputting the 480p right now. This game has native 480p support. So all you have to do is hold B once you boot the game, even on a normal, regular uh, GameCube, as long as you have the, you know, the component cables or a solution. The, the official component ca cables are like, I don't know, man, 300, Dr. Evil money, past $300 is, is ludicrous. You can find a little cheaper sometimes. I don't have that. Buy the modern solutions and save yourself the money, unless you're a collector and need to have the cable. Your money, do whatever you want with it. Uh... And I'm going to show you what's on the monkey ball here. There's super monkey ball. Monkey ball, monkey ball alone is the um, the arcade original an arcade game. So let's see here. Mm, uh, so no cheats, but settings. And if you see it up there, force video mode, and this is of course the American version. Uh, force video mode 480p. This game originally is 480i only, but with the magic of UC Loader or similar solutions in Swiss, you can do that, and it's going to be 480p. Obviously, a test of the game. You might see there's a bit of overscan here because the 480p on the GameCube is actually, well, a lot, so far the games I played is 448. So I stretch a tiny bit here. In CRTs, there's no fixed pixels. You can do whatever you want as far as stretching. That's one of the beautiful things about this monitor is you can go here. And you can look at all the options. CRT, VGA CRT monitors are awesome. Do you want a PVM, but you don't want to spend the money on a fucking PVM, which is kind of expensive? Uh, get a VGA monitor. Listen, I'm not going to bore you to tears here. Watch Retro RGB game in on VGA monitor, something to that effect, and he'll explain everything you need to know. All you need is a VGA monitor and an OSSC, which is, you know, consider all the solutions came up is still good. I have one, I have two, and you will do the trick with the scan lines. Scan lines, in my opinion, they look kind of crap. I still use them on a regular, uh, you know, flat screen, flat panel, the modern flat panels. Uh, but, man, this here looks good. You know, although, let's face it, the, the uh, Retro Tank 4K coming up now, and the, it will have a lot of awesome scan lines. It's, it's getting closer to uh, retro arch and stuff like that. Uh, so yeah, you can come here with those VGA monitors. That's another thing you can do. Yeah, you can with the service menus. That noise will happen sometimes. There's a giant machine. This is a construct. I'm in a shed, so this is a construction site. So okay, so yeah, you can adjust here the size and do whatever you want. You know, position the size. It's so easy. It's convenient. All right. So yeah. Let's boot it. Just taking a look at it. It looks beautiful here. Hope it comes across that way for you there at home. Need that thumbnail? <laughs> I'll put this on YouTube later. Holy shit. What the fuck happened to my sound here? I'm crying out loud. Just a minute. Of course, of course, this glitch didn't. <laughs> so it's live. What do you want from me? This glitch didn't happen earlier, so I don't know if it came across to you there, but it went. 
Okay. <laughs> don't know what that was, pal. I don't know what that was. Am I fucked now? Is the GameCube that I, uh, I've been using for one gazillion years all of a sudden decided to not work? Is that what I'm... Because uh, I'll pick another fucking console immediately. I'm... Okay, so I came here. I tested and retested the hardware. And now I'm having a hard time here for no reason whatsoever. Thank you. Please don't... Don't ever do that again. I came here earlier, and this thing was on forever. Come off it. I swear to God, I come to stream. And CRT Rajan says it's very beautiful. Thank you. Just too bad about the fucking glitch a minute ago. Let's, uh, let's, let's head on back, and let's try it again. Yeah, uh, as soon as I decide to go live, the, the Internet goes out the window. Hardware start acting up. I can find cables. It's fucked. We get there, though. Let's n no more bullshit, please. It was on here forever. Let's try this again. Music is awesome, and there's a thumbnail. Okay, so I never played this game before, so I reckon it's main, main game. And if there's any problem with the volume or uh, the game volume is too loud, my, you know, let me know as compared to my voice. Go normal mode first. One player, just me here, just a man in the shed. We'll stick with the main feller. Well, I'm a beginner, so let's not beat around the, you know, the bush here. So, is that like, does that mean like, no, I start beginner and then I move on up to, to advance, yeah? I think that'll be the same thing to do, I'm not. Oh, there we go. Now I'm gonna play monkey ball for the first time ever. See how the... Oh. Well, how do I jump here? There's even a replay. The music is excellent. It reminds me of that stage on, uh, how do I jump? What the hell? I don't know how to jump here. Is that death? Okay. CRT Rajna says the sound is balanced for me. Thank you. Thank you for your feedback, my dear. I appreciate it. So how am I to... Oh, this just butterflies. God damn it, there was a banana in there. It looks amazing here in person, This on, on this here VGA monitor. It looks absolutely mind-blowing. You can't beat the collars on a CRT. I haven't seen an OLED in person. But, man... This here looks good. All right, well, I'm going to need to learn the jump now. 
Oh, don't need. Oh, so there's no jump. Oh, I can tell this game is going to be a lot of fun. So maybe I can have one playthrough without losing my mind here and raging. And I, I, I heard. I know it's going to be hard later, but we'll see. Sure, come on. It wasn't perfect. Come on. There was <laughs> crap in there. The music is wow. I like this type of music here. I seen Joe here doing all kind of crazy shenanigans and <laughs> just jumping over and getting to the goal immediately. He's very good at the game. Ooh. <laughs> this is one motherfucking cool game, let me tell you, Joe. You you are a man of good taste. I can see why you like this game. And the GameCube controller is just... Oh! Oh! <laughs> the GameCube controller is just excellent. He was very anal about this. I continue. So five containers, what, that, what does that mean? I go all the way back to the beginning? I wonder... And goddamn the shad is, you know, we had a bit of a drizzle earlier, so I thought it was going to be a... Ah, what the fuck? Okay. I thought it was going to be a... I'm going to reduce my volume here. I... No, no, no. No, no, I'm not ready. I'm not ready. Hold on. I'm screaming here. My volume is still loud. There we go. Continue. I like the sparks when you're going, going fast. Ah. Ah. <laughs> oh, I wonder about the continues though. What is that about? Because I heard Joe, Joe say in one of the remakes, which he was not—he was not liking the controls. So, apparently, apparent for him who who plays a lot of this game, he says that only the uh, GameCube controls feels good for him. Ah, ah. Stop. Okay, just gotta be. Go. Yeah, this is gonna be a lot of fun. What an interesting concept this game. Just pure fun. So here I backtrack. Oh, I back backtrack a tiny bit. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh. the time. No! Monkey, come on. <laughs> Continue. I think I'll probably fail a lot here first to, um, until I get used to things, how, how things work. Remember, please, my first time playing this. I never played, well, the closest I got, come on. The clothes I got was the uh, Mario Galaxy thing, which probably they got it from this here, right? Ah, oh, no, no, no. It's made by Sega. Isn't that awesome? Tell me as a kid that Sega will be making games for Nintendo consoles. I'll tell you you're insane. Can I go? Ah, no, 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 no. Ah, no, no. Get it? All right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> oh shit. Pie up top. He's in the chat saying, Hello everyone, I love Sega. Welcome to the chat, buddy. Yeah, Sega's awesome. I grew up in Nintendo stuff, but oh, also Sega, because my best friends all had a, you know, had they had Sega console, so 
I grew up playing the master system a lot at a friend's house. I didn't have the NES. And then later on, the same friend of mine, he, I got, uh, I got a Super Nintendo, and he had a Sega Genesis, so play a lot of his place too. Yeah, I did very poorly here. So this this year is my my first time playing this game here, buddy. So brace yourself. No, maybe I go. Oh, holy shit! Okay, I need to I, I need to learn a bit more about the brakes. Breaker, breaker. Yeah, I gotta learn. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. No, no. <laughs> gotta learn about the brakes here, kind of bit. Maybe I should. Wonder if I should just go. Ah, well. That was a dumb way to die. So if I die, it's all the way to the beginning. It's, all, it's okay. I reckon I'll get good at the game as I go along. All right, let's, uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Right. Stay, stay here, stay quiet, stay quiet. Ah, ah, ah. But the timer, my timer. Ah, <laughs> Top says, I love velocity on the Sega Genesis games, shoot them up, etc. 100% action. You know, I didn't usually care until recently, very recently. I, uh, two genres I don't like, uh, shmups and an RPG, turn-based RPG, but then I'm coming around shmups, I'm beginning to appreciate them, and I want to play shmups here as well, and the Sega Genesis has a, oh, 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 has a lot of good shmups, so sometimes it, you know, pays off to, no, 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 oh, oh, oh. pay off to give things a second, no, all right, I got greedy. But I play a lot of uh, good games on the Genesis. The one that I played, I'd say recently, that really stayed with me as a Castlevania fan was Bloodlines. Absolutely love that game. I think I need to be, no, 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 no. Not, oh. Yeah, those containers are, uh, they're kind of pouring like wine here. Oh man, I, I sure hope I'm prepared for the, uh, let's go, for the profession or whatever. Oh man, it's all about knowing the control here. Typo Top said the bloodline is in incredible, yes. I prefer it over Castlevania 4. Even though, like I said, I, I grew up with a sub Super Nintendo, but don't, it don't matter. You know, it's not good to be a fanboy of anything. So I play both of them, and both are great games, but I prefer Bloodlines. I, I was very amazed by Bloodlines, no, 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 by Bloodlines, very amazed by it. Nah, 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 oh fuck, 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 nah, nah. Come on, come on, come on. No, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, it looks like I'm gonna need some practice on this here stage, that's for sure. I love the looks and idea of this game, it's just fucking incredible. Maybe I'll take it easy here, like, how much time is the timer does getting to me? I'm not sure, you know, whoa, whoa, whoa. No! Nah. I should have gone a tiny bit more there. I hesitated. Typo Top says Bloodline is shorter, so we tend to want to play it more since we finished him last time. Shorter on Castlevania 4. But yeah, but you have two characters. You can get, uh, what's his name? Eric Lacard or something? What happened? Oh, it's my name. CRT Rack. There's a, t a timer for the name. It's a very cool way of entering the name, that's for sure.
Yeah, but I find I find Castlevania 4 a lot easier. Thanks. Like in a detrimental way. Like the there's a guy that made a video on YouTube about why he thinks Bloodlines is better than uh, Castlevania 4. Even though I don't like that kind of argument, but he's like showing more appreciation to the uh, Bloodlines uh, entry. And um, and he, he had a lot of very good points that I, I couldn't understand why I liked it better, but once I watched his video, it was like, that's why. Uh, the whip feels a bit overpowered on the uh, Castlevania 4 to the point that the, the uh, sub-weapons don't, don't matter as much, you know? And Bloodlines has a lot of crazy ideas, even though Castlevania 4 also has it. They're both great games, obviously. And most 2D Castlevanias are... I think I like all of them so far that I've played. I don't think there's been a Castlevania... 2D Castlevania that I didn't like... so far. Let me drink some Coke here because it is inferno in the shed. It is horrific. Got beads of sweat running down to my ass crack. It's fucking horrible here. To think there was a drizzle and the skies were gray earlier. And now the sun is out full force and just horrific. Typo Top says, I like the old Castlevania, not the Metroidvania. Well, yeah, some people don't like the Metro. I like both. I really, uh, really like the Metroidvanias. I play it, played them a lot. And I like the, uh, the linear ones as well. My favorite ones tend to be the linear, but I was very impressed by all the Metroidvanias I played, uh, personally speaking. You know, we all have different tastes. When I played Castlevania Symphony of the Night, I was lost in that world. It was incredible. But some people don't care for it, wouldn't you know? Which is fine, you know? Ah, good shit. All right, let's go. So yeah, as limited continues here, so I don't know how far I'll be able to go as a noob. But I'll, I'll try my best. I'll be, uh, it's all for fun, you know, I'll be, uh, streaming for a while anyways. Yeah, I'm going with beginner because that's what I am, just in case anybody, you know, <laughs> bitches about that. If I'm playing like an old retro game, and a, the, the GameCube is not retro for me, it never will be. I'm a 40-year-old man. So, if I play a, a retro game and it has easy mode, I always go for normal. But on, like modern games, also. But on this case here, because it really is a very different game, and uh, I think the stages are different, right? So I will check beginner first. I feel so easy, but it, 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 has, it hasn't been so far. I just started, but still. <laughs> oh, there we go. Typo Top says, I go away. Your stream is very well. Take a good day. I got what you mean. Yeah, you have you have yourself a fine day too, sir, and I appreciate you stopping by. Thank you. Anytime you want to come in, oh shit. Anytime you want to come in, I'll be here. I, I'm here most days from now on, I think. Can I restart a level without? No, I can't. Can I get? Wonder if I can get those nanners back there. This is a fun game. This is a very unique game. I never played nothing like it. Again, just that one one part on. Uh, go 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 go. I got it. Jesus, I wasn't waking up. Oh, I'm born red. Let's go, let's go, 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 go. Why well, pass here before? Do I need to mash a button to make it go faster or something? Oh no, just need to be quick, quicker. That's all. This one I just gotta try to fight. 
No, 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 no. It's, it's, it's the problem is leaving the little bananas here. Come on, man. Get, get in the zone, dude. There we go. Ah, I'm fucking up. I'm leaving. See, you leaving, and then you gotta go. You gotta go out of your. Oh, gotta go out of your way to get him. Wow, uh, we're gonna suck into this one. Yeah, sure, let's call it that. <laughs> Super monkey ball, god damn it, it's hot in here. It's very, oh! Very cool when it goes very quick. I think Sonic is a secret character here, one of them. My thumb slip. There's no excuse, my thumb really did slip. Yeah. Yes. Maybe it's time to change, change them gloves. Okay. Alright, just focus in here, so bear with me. I like it does. Ah! Get. Ooh! <laughs> Damn it. Alright, 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 alright. I like how he flips inside the ball, it's pretty cool. Like that. You'll really convey the sense of speed here. I think we'll we'll get it this time. Whoa, 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 whoa! <laughs> ah! No! <laughs> I bounced! Bouncy, bouncy. That's a lot of fun. We have fun around oh, around here. Oh. Okay. <laughs> All right, no, no, none of that bouncy stuff. Come on. There we go. <laughs> it's very cool. Yeah, okay, Roger says, do you want a fan? I'll bring it for you. No, thank you, my dear, because uh, the noise. Yeah. Every which way I think about having a solution here it doesn't really work. I mean, I could have the fan, but the, the sound will be horrific. I don't want to deal with it. So I'll, I'll just suffer here. It's okay. I'm, I'm from Mississippi. I can I can take it. Thank you, though. I, I really appreciate it. Ah. You're watching out for me. If you don't know, that's my wife. Ah! ah. <laughs> Damn it, Janet! I don't. I, it. You know, it doesn't piss me off here at all. Here's you. You're in control here. The controls are, are fucking good, unlike some some other games I played recently. Responsive, you know. When you fuck up, is you. There we go. Oh! So you got it. It's all about controlling the, the damn brake. No, no, no. Ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Out of control. Let's get in there. Whoa, whoa. Let's get in there. There we go. God damn it. Again, I didn't have time <laughs> to learn how to raid today. <coughs> Fuck. There's a feller friend of the channel here called Theater House, also a, a Sopranos connoisseur, and he raids me here, and I, I really want to, when I have viewers, like yesterday would have been good, I would have raided, oh man, I should have gone for that thing. I would like to raid other folks if they're online, you know? I'm having a hell of a, I'm having a hell of a time learning Twitch stuff. Ah, no! Twitch stuff. <laughs> It's a lot of things, there's a lot of take in with the Twitch. I'm a, you know, sort of a boomer here. I'm not, sometimes I don't know what's going on. Let's go. All right, we'll try to. Nah! Okay, I should have, if I stop here, don't touch the monitor, you suck a shit. 
If I had stopped there. <laughs> it's very fun, this game. It's a shame about the limited continues, though, but... No, oh, I went the wrong way. Kind of waste of time there. No, 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 no. I've been mean, improving a tiny bit, you know. Stop, stop. No, 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 no. <laughs> Hesitation, I hesitated. See, it's all your fault here when you lose. But it's a ball to keep trying again. It's just it's the sort of game you, you just want to keep trying. I just started playing this game, never played before. I'm already addicted to it. Try to come. Ah! I was gonna say try to come up with ways to be faster around the corner and just felt like a bag of shit. I don't even mind repeating them other stages, it's just pure fun here. I should have played this game a long time ago. Okay. I'm, I'm afraid to turn around. There it is. Ah. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, I need this here, you know, banana bunch. Come on. Okay, where to go? Careful. Come on. Stop, stop, don't hesitate. Oh. Damn it, I should have been on that thing. Try to get them and then come back. Nah! Jesus, fucking crazy! Right. Oh, I went out of control there. The music is, uh, hot. Let me see here. Maybe go this way first. Right here. I don't know, I think, I'm assuming you have to get all the nanners, right? Try to go. Try to get the, the, the bunch first. Go, 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 go back, head on back, buddy. Head on back. Okay, so this way. No, 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 no. I wanna, I wanna turn around carefully. Don't go out of control, don't go out of control, don't go out of control. I want to turn around, but it's scary. Okay. And da -da -da. Oh my god, the time! No! No! You wasn't ready. <laughs> Came closer, though. I'm improving a tiny bit. I have a smoke here. I'm improving a tiny bit. That's what's all about, isn't it? Original. You've been improving, I see. I have Cecil. Super, super monkey ball. You didn't get into the play points. Now we have a total of 393 play points. You piece of shit. You good. It's incredibly sharp here. It's just so good. Some people don't like the jaggies, as they say. I love them. I, I like my image sharp. Unless I'm playing RF or something. <laughs> Which I do sometimes. JRT Razor says it's a fun game and the music's so nice you can actually control the ball very well. Well, that's that's yet to be determined. The jury is still out on this one. Ah, fuck. Burping here. I try not to burp loudly, you know, on the mic because uh, it's kind of rude. Although I, I find funny when other folks do it though. Trying to, I'm trying to keep calm here and get them nanners first, and then let, let me st oh, let me study here. So, I think I took too long. Okay, here we go. Oh, whoa, 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 calm down, dude. And head on back, head on back, head on back, head on back. <laughs> nah, nah, I should have stopped there. Damn it! Your T Ranger says I like the way you say it, nanner. Banana is very southern. Yeah, we call it nanners. I don't I hope people understand. I think they'll I think they'll get it by contacts. Good old nanners. Get in there. It's my favorite fruit, as a matter of fact. Followed by bo whoa, whoa, blueberry. But bananas the favorite thing ever. Whoa, 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 whoa. Come now. Go, go. I, no. 
no, 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 no. Okay. Go, go. Ah, I should have been on that one. Is there still time? Damn it, Janet. You're fucking up. Yeah, no, I think I might make it this time. Let's go. There we go. Hey, oh, you got cage, bitch. Floor nine. Oh, I'm born right. Let's go. <laughs> oh, brother. Did I go the wrong way on that one? Well, follow the arrow here, right? I mean... <laughs> okay, I got you. <laughs> Bouncers, you're back. <laughs> uh, okay, where do I start? Oh, that's my last continue. But it's okay, I think. I got the last stage there that I was having a lot of problem with. A little, a little time a bit better than what I was. No, 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 no. No, there was, oh, there was one in there. Uh, it's a bit slippery this year. I got to do something about it when I have a break. Final floor. Yeah. Just focus, focus in it. <laughs> oh, there's steps. <laughs> oh, it was a lot, it was a lot of fun. Okay, let's. Try to, you can't be too easy though, because otherwise, you know, the, t oh, no, whoa, whoa, the timer, ah, damn, I went you, I went you, I was too thirsty there. Get wrecked, son. Come on. Now. Okay, those are steps. So you got. I done goofed. Okay, uh, but I got a slightly better at that last stage, so maybe I don't lose as many lives there. You know. You're welcome. Get that there thumbnail. I don't think I left it for enough times. For enough time last time. Check the internet here. I gotta check it because if it fucks up, I have to go and fix that router. Oh, hey, this is, a, this is a cool game. GameCube is an awesome console. I didn't play it back in the day. I missed out. I, was, uh, I wasn't playing video games for like 15 years. Then I got back to it full force. I wonder here it says ten, 10 stage. So 10 stages, right? So maybe that was the last one of the beginner mode. So soon I'll be joining the pro league here. Become VIP man. There we go. All right. We got it, boys. Oh, the first one or anything in introduction. I wonder if I leave, uh, I left a banana there last time. I wonder if that has any bearing on the outcome of this game. So this one here, I start here. So I think, yeah, I have to go both ways. He goes both ways. <laughs> like a bisexual. Yes, Tad, that was the joke. Family guy. Show you should be good, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There we go. Unbelievably, usually, you know, a lot of 3D games are not very colorful, I find sometimes. This one here, I fucked up, I fucked up, I fucked up, I fucked up! I don't think I can get that nanner that was left. It was one lap there, I saw it. 
Hey, hey. Setson's here. Say what kind of new thing of Marble Madness? Oh, God damn it, I forgot completely about Marble Madness. Yeah, that'll be the perfect comparison. This here's Monkey Ball. First time playing. I heard Joe from Game Sack talking about this game for years, Setson, and today I took the plunge. And it is a lot of fun. I'm on the beginner level here. So basically, just... Oh, no, 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 wait. I don't know why the fuck is it doing this shit. Oh, look. So I didn't have to reset the console earlier. The sound went nuts. Will you knock it off and leave me alone to play my games? There's always some hardware bullshit here. Come off it. Play monkey ball here, my good sir. Don't you, don't you see that? The sound went nuts before when I started stream. Of course, after testing the damn hardware for an hour. I had to restart the console, but turns out it's just the cables here. Take it easy, take it easy, take it easy. Yeah, that's pretty much what this is here, ain't it? This Marble Madness, but 3D. I love Marble Madness. Awesome game. Satson said a friend had this. I only watched him play a bit. It looks fun. It is. It really is a lot of fun. I didn't know how fun, you know, until you pick up the controller and try it for yourself. But, uh, man, I'm hooked already on it. I'm hooked on Monkey Phonics here. This is... Oh, oh, oh. It's a good game. So, technically, kind of controlling the stage. And the monkey rolls with it. It is fucking awesome. Oh. And from what uh, Joe said, the, the GameCube OG is still the best in the control department. The controls are excellent. He had a whole review of it of the... No, no, no. Of the remakes. And turns out this here is still the king. As far as controller. The GameCube controller is immaculate. You know, the pad is not all there, but... CRT Roger says, yeah, Marble Madness is very... Like Marble Madness of a 3D, yeah. Now, this stage here was giving me, and probably still will, give me a lot of trouble. So, let's see. Let's see if, how much how much I improve here. Let's go. And then I, whoa, got one up. That's good. It has limited continues, though, this game, which surprised me a bit. But, hey, a little bit of challenge here. Nah! Okay, so you, you get too excited and go too far. Okay, got to be careful. And you gotta have a plan of action here, so kind of going nuts, nuts on that last bit. Just want to take it easy to get the banana bunch here. Get back, oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. and then do this, and let's do this here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Okay, and let's see. Oh. No, stop, 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 stop. Nah! I just want to turn around, my good sir. This went a lot better than last time. There we go. So you can break, break or just keep rolling until you negate the moment about tilting the stage. Yeah, tilting the stage backwards, I think, as far as I know. I mean, if there's a break here, I haven't found it, but I think it's just... So to slow down, just gotta go like this and and slow it down by going the other way, like like so. <laughs> there we go. Ah, that one. So pretty much just uh, just going back the other way to slow down a tiny bit. Ready? Nah, I went too far. Sometimes I forget and I just keep going, and you, you just can't do that. Have to, oh, oh, yeah. I didn't pass here last time. Those are steps, so gotta take it. What? Oh, 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 oh. Ha, ha. Ha, ha. You can do it, go on. Go on, careful. <laughs> no. No, we're getting that one. We're not We're not leaving things behind here like a pussy. There, there. Come on. No, I'm trying to. There we go. hey
Yum, 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 yum. So what happens now? So I got 1686 points. 1686 points should left you unlock the next mini game. <clears throat> Your you ready to see I play Marvel Madras hook right away, but can't pass the level four. It, it can be hard. Oh, what's that about? Oh, oh that's pretty cool. <laughs> Does it count getting bananas here? Oh, you can only go forward. Look at even the goddamn. Uh, ah, no, even the goddamn credits. Are fucking awesome. I never seen Kratos. Oh. Shit, shit, shit. Whoa, 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 whoa. I never seen Kratos. Like, I'm on minus here. All right. <laughs> there we go. Just pay attention to the ladder. Just spoke. Darn it. Look at this, this is the credits. How the fuck? No, no, stop. Well, I'm gonna come out here uh, in in that. I'm owning a lot of, on a lot of bananas here. I wonder if that has any bear in the game or is just a fun, I, <laughs> mine is starting to look like my overdraft, my bank account. All right. There we go. We're getting out of debt now. Probably not for long, though. There we go. Stealing that. That's how fucked I got up there. There we go. Look at that. They make you play the credits. It's fucking awesome. Kind of weaseling your way here to the left and right, huh? A little, tiny bit. Tiny bit. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We are doing slightly better. I don't want to go in the corner. I got to be able to. Uh, nah, I got to be able to what now? Holy dog! Holy dog! Shit! There goes all my nanners. I strongly, from the little I just played now, I would strongly recommend this here. Oh, no. No, no, no. Stop. Strongly recommend this game. It's very good. It's, oh, man. It's, Jesus. It's a lot of fun. I wonder what the pro is. The, you know, the pro, uh, what the normal mode is going to be. Probably very, very interesting. No, 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 stop. Mm. Oh, shit. Okay. Stop, stop. Fucking bouncing all over the place, man. Publicity. Yeah, you can kind of cheese your way to the left or right, but what's the fun on that? No cheese in here. Just every now and then. Holy dog. The problem once you start getting hit is if I get hit, then I go to the uh, left or holy shit. Got hit by Alabama. That's a lot of letters. Let me go ahead and not do that, sir. Or you still got me anyways. Damn, he's like attracted, attracted to the damn ladders. See? <laughs> There's the end. It's a coming. Do I get anything? Cotton top tamarind? CRT Raider says this is the most creative way to show credits. Yeah, very cool. I never seen nothing like it.
What the fuck? <laughs> well, that woke me up. Yeah, even the way you enter the name here, they they made everything cool. Oh, oh, oh. See? There we go. Thanks for playing. You're welcome. This was fun. Now we're going to move on to the uh, next challenge. Choose the normal mode. I am having a little problem this year being, uh, kind of slipping. Yeah, it is slipping. Uh, I think it's time to change those gloves. I think they're, they're going to be retired. Yeah. So give me a second. I'm going to go home and get some gloves, and I need to cut the uh, yellow part that's, that's out here because it shows. Or not, I'll see how much, it, how bad it looks on the screen. So if you just, uh, I'll leave the demo here. Oh, I'm not going to bother with the commercials. I have to turn on the, uh, the Xbox uh, 360 for that. So I'll just put here that I'm on break, so if anybody comes in. But it'll be very quick. It'll be just a couple of minutes. I know where the gloves are. So I'll be right back.
Okay, I'm back. I got some new gloves. So I, I wear those gloves for one. The first reason is I don't like special. Imagine here how hot it is. I mean, most people don't wear gloves, and that's fine. I'm not saying you should wear, start wearing gloves. And me personally, I don't like touching the controllers. I you should collect controllers. I used to, no, I, I do. I stopped buying them for a while now. Uh, but I have a lot of them, and some of those are quite rare, you know. And I don't want to touch them, and they get fucked. The sweat, sweat in the palm of your hands just fucks everything up over time, you know. Um, not every control over some of them, and it gunks up. And so I, I use gloves before anyways. But the problem, uh, the other thing that is sort of a bonus is with uh, CRTs. Sometimes, a lot of times, my hand will reflect on the tube. This tube is not very reflective, but some of them are quite reflective. You can clearly see my, my hands reflecting. And, uh, and that's it. So even if I didn't wear gloves, I'll probably have two here because of the way I shoot things. My hand is right here and the lights are bouncing all over the place. So I got new gloves. So the problem with them though, is that this, you know, gets degraded over time, the rubber, as you play and play. I play a lot of games here and then it becomes worse than your your actual thumb the grip in this game you definitely don't want to be out of grip the problem is they come with this yellow ugly border here i'm not sure how much that is going to show but if it does i quickly cut it and burn it with a lighter so it's not you know the little glint hanging all over the breath all over the, all over the place kind of slurred my speech here today what the fuck? It's too damn hot let me see if the yellow shows up on the screen. That's all that matters. So I'm going to go on full screen here and just make sure that the yellow bands here don't reflect on the CRT. That's the big off. Oh, got, got one of those uh, tags. So I'm going to just cut this and we'll go back to the game. Cut yourself with this shit. Man. There we are. If they're reflecting on the CRT, no, it doesn't look like it. Oh, the grip is real. Good. All right, shit. Bring some more coke here. We'll move on up to the next challenge. Yeah, uh, Satson says I've only noticed a reflection when there's nothing on the screen. Maybe the camera doesn't pick up as much as you see there. The, the thing is depend on the game sets and some games like let me tell you Resident Evil 4 I play on the BVM D14 H5V which is very reflective that was uh, playing that without gloves would be a nightmare because the game is so dark and not colorful this one here this monitor is not very reflective and it's bright still you know and this game is very colorful so the problem is when it gets you uh, dark games like I'd say Oddworld which monitor I use for that Oh yeah, that 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 is reflective. That will show. I'm a bit of a perfectionist. I, even if you show a tiny bit, I don't like it. And besides, I st I'm a, like I said, I'm a bit of a freak. So I'll probably still use them even if it did anyways because I don't like touching the controllers. By now, I've been using them for so many years that by now, I'm so used to it that playing without it feels weird. Uh, and I think I don't know. It kind of doesn't call attention too much in my hands. But it's good to know it doesn't show that much. You let me know if, it, if you see, well, I don't think you'll be seeing this time. But the yellow band, I think I'm gonna, yeah, cause I, I even go as far as cutting this here yellow band. So I hope that's, you know, we'll see with some of the more reflective monitors. It's usually a combination. Reflective monitor, some of them are quite shiny in uh, dark games. Like, I don't know, like when I play Resident Evil here soon, soon enough. I'm surprised the monitor looks as good as it does. I, it worked, I worked for Dell for 15 years ago. We had those monitors everywhere and they were beat to hell. Yeah, this one here, I got it. I remember how I got it. At the time, I, Dodge Ram was still on the road and I went to an office. It was an office monitor, so it must have been used quite a bit. But holy shit, it's bright and beautiful. Maybe they put it aside and didn't use it as much. And it was very cheap too. It's, it's not, I have I have four more VGA, I think. The Sony I feature on my YouTube before, but not on stream yet. I have a, a E400, I think. 
Uh, it goes all the way up to 1440 p. It's pretty amazing. And then I have most of the other ones are 1200 p. Uh, you know, to recommend a resolution of 60 hertz. And this one here's the, the the last of them is 768. Very typical. I think 768 by 1084. Something to that effect. I know it's 768p, but good enough for a 480p game, you know. Of of those monitors I have, in fact, is a Sony uh, Yamaha. I have another Dell, but a higher caliber Dell with a 1200p. Uh, but they've been used, and you can tell. The Trinitron needs a Windass. I don't think it's Windass. It's a thing that you need to do to correct the. Uh, a lot of people throw those monitors away, the Trinitrons, because the image, image is washed out, and sometimes you just need to do the wind ass adjustment. And then, wow, I've seen it done. There's a video on YouTube, a short video of a guy doing it. He got, he got the damn monitor out of the trash can, did the wind ass adjustment, and it was fucking day and night the difference, you know? So I think mine's a bit washed out. Back when I didn't, I didn't know about the wind ass, but now I'm thinking it's just a wind ass adjustment because it's on that, it's on the list. But this one here looks amazing, yeah. Just make some coke here because it's, it's fucking hot in here, man. All right, moving on up. The moon and the pro league, let me feel. Oh, yes, the grip is a lot better. Day and night. So I wonder, does this, does it save or does it matter saving? Oh, it doesn't say if I save, if I bid it or not. Well, we know. So I'm go, going to go for the uh, advanced mode. That's, I think that's the correct one. Oh, the grip is a lot better here. Now that, that other glove is done. It is done. <laughs> I fucking gained too much on it. Take those shoes off and just be barefoot here. There we go. Oh, that's a lot better. Wearing fucking shoes here for no reason. I'm like Carl from Sling Blade with the shed thing, but with video games. He had lawnmowers. Oh, so here I think you need to you need to go quick here. I would say. Rah, rah. Oh. This here looks like that road in San Francisco. Oh, ho, oh, oh. ho. Oh, so it's like pinball. Oh, I see it. <laughs> Stuttering Stick is here, says. Yo, buddy. Let me pause because there's a time of curling at work remodeling a mobile home. I wish you'd come here to rem remodel my mobile home. It's falling apart. Just wanted to say hello and stay Thursday, my friends. I prefer dos secos. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Thank you for stopping by, and I hope you have I hope you have a good shift out there with a mobile home. You know what I wouldn't do for a mobile home with a good old Ah, oh, damn it! I didn't. Okay, so I really need to go back with the uh, old wooden panels. You know. Here we go. Oh, I see interesting things in here. Down there, you saw that. Look at this. We were gonna miss out, so. Oh, I realized it was a bit too late. <laughs> it was a bit too late, and it died of a broken heart. There we go. So let's not fart around here. We go straight from here for the banana bunch here. Mm. Oh, damn it, not enough. Picky, are we? <laughs> Come off it. Okay, so I gotta be careful with the last one there. Do it all over the place. Take it easy. You gotta take it easy. Ah, oh, no, no. Fuck off. There we go. We got it. We got it, Chief. Don't fuck around here. Although there's a border, but it's quite. Oh. 
Come on, dude. Don't you push me. All right, here carefully. I don't think it's... Oh, there we go. Oh, it's moving platforms. Should have gone the other way, you doofus. Oh, no. What did you do? No, 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 no. Can I, can I reach? Oh. Is that it? Is that all of them? Yeah, yeah. I wish I had some fucking beer here. Why the hell am I wearing a hat? It's fucking horrible here. I feel naked without a hat. Just trucker hats. No. Holy shit, that's a tight one. Advanced mode. Continue. Bum, 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 bum. Killer instinct. Okay, uh, I think straight up, go, 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 go. See, I think I'm already too late there. Too late, you have to be quick here. Being too late to react to that platform. Can't mess around here, like right, right away, go, 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 go. Wow, it's a straight one. How in the hell? <laughs> Quickest fucking game over I ever had here. I'm gonna have a drag my cigarette. This one is a tricky one here, my friend. You didn't collect shit? I sure hope that I am playing the game and then find out I have a jump or something. I don't think there's jumps in here. Okay, I'm trying to be as quick as I can, but that was a little bit, a bit too much. Come on, come on, let me in. No! <laughs> you piece of shit. That was a close one, though. That's gonna eat my containers quicker than anything. No, too late. Too late already. You're done. Ain't, ain't got no time to mess around here. You have to be quick. Right now. Too late. Too late. Too late. Is that strict? Too late. <laughs> Monkey, come on. This is it. Give it to me. There we go. Bonus. I think the times will be. I think just don't leave Nanner's ear. Nah, like this. Don't, don't do this shit, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh no. Oh, I thought I still had to go to a goal or something. Motherfucking goal or something. Set, 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 have found something. I, I didn't even know he was looking. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> wow. I thought it was going to move a tiny bit, but I didn't realize it was going to be that much. Yeah, this is going to be a game over for sure, but that's okay. Ooh, I got to do 30 stages that are harder. Okay, what if I slow down? Like, oh, that. Ain't no. Are we sure there ain't no breaks here? What the hell? Also, if you wait. No, no. I ain't what the hell's down there? I've seen a thing down there. 
Oh, so if you go past a certain a certain degree of inclination here, you're gonna fall. So do I need to wait then? Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. What the hell is this here down here? I don't know. Let's. Go, 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 go. I wonder what that is down there. There's a thing. I need to be quicker than I'm being here. Try to risk it a tiny bit. Oh. Sure. You're a madman. Get in there. Beautiful. Look at his stages, they're awesome. Awesome game. I reckon I have to avoid those things. The slalom, the old driver thing. Slalom. Oh. Ah. Fatality. It's all right, we're having fun here. That's the last stage, uh, the last. Well, I gotta do 30 stages. This is gonna be something. It's gonna be something. Okay, do I need to slow down? Maybe I need to. Maybe I need to slow down just a tiny bit. Let's try that and see. Maybe, the, maybe I'm thinking the time is stricter than than what it is. Yeah, see, I'm thinking the time is a lot stricter than what it actually is. It is. It doesn't require that much perfection. Look, it's pretty lax here. I was thinking I was gonna barely make it even if I go full force, so it's not quite that hard. <laughs> Push it. Nah. Those are the stages I had the most trouble with, that's for sure. All right. All right, all right. Ah, will you fuck off? I don't know what the hell's doing this, fucking digital farts. What are you doing? Okay, uh, I need to sort out. There's some problem with it, with the audio here. Yeah, what the fuck, man? Leave me the hell alone. Let me see what's happening here. I don't understand what's happening. Right? Just give me a second. I'm having some hardware problems. There's a problem with the audio. I don't know what this is. It's not going away. Uh, that's the last thing I fucking need today. Okay, give me a second. I gotta... Uh, fuck your couch. Where the fuck is this cable going? It's madness here with the cables. It is madness. Absolute madness. Try to change this here. Try to cut the middleman. Let me see. Just give me a second. Cut the middleman, I think. I think. Let me see here. Put it here. You piece of shit. Get out! Fucking cables. God damn it! There's a cable here fucking me over. Come on, you sack of crap, get out. I never want to see your fucking face here again. You know. The cable! Unnecessary. Every now and then I'm here having time, a good time, and I gotta get fucked by hard cables, useless cables. Cheap motherfucking cables. This one, there's the culprit. Wait, is the image? And now the image is frozen. Awesome. 
we're experiencing technical problems. So you're gonna have a, a dark screen for just a second. I'm gonna have to reinsert, oh man, fucking hell. Okay, just give me a second. Uh, just give me a second. I'm having some some technical problems here. 17. Let me write this down. Sorry, I have some problem. The image you won't notice now because I'm paused, but the image is actually frozen. So I have to re-add the source. I'm sweating like a whore in church here. It's fucking horrific. Just give me a second, please. Wish I had a holding screen here. I need to make, uh, we're experiencing technical problems. Uh, screen. Brightness, just writing down some settings here so that I come back to the very same. Contrast. 148. Hue zero. And saturation. So I have the audio problem, and then all of a sudden the video problem. Fuck me. I don't even know, can, can y'all still hear me? I hope so. Fuck out of my face, if he's a shit. Damn you. Okay, what you do here then? Um, okay. Okay, sorry about that. Having some, some your audio, I can't tell. No, the video, yeah, the video. Oh, you can't tell the video's frozen because the lights aren't changing, which is a good way. I like the, the lights, they have that effect. So let me just, uh, just see what I do here. Okay, I'm just gonna delete this thing. There you go, and this get, it will be a black screen there for you for just a second as I will re-add my camera here. Video capture device, get in there, and then uh, configure video, that's fine. I'll save my settings, and that, there you go. Holy shit, will you leave me the fuck alone with this crap? The audio, then the video, what's next? A goblin's gonna come out here in the shed and rape me? Well, fuck off, come off it here. I mean, it's fucking, it's already hot in here. I'm having a good, I'm trying to have a good time and it's like demons here. Fucking hell, and I'm sweating like a motherfucker. Jesus, put those fucking glasses off. Oh, man. It's down my fucking face, it's horrible here. Mm. I mean, at least the fucking videos where I learned that the other day. You see, before that happened, I didn't know how to go back to it. Because you, you, you can't restart the camera. And I was done. You lose this contact. So you can't get out of OBS because it just, uh, it doesn't pick up again. Uh, well, sorry, if you close it, it ends the stream. So it's going to be 100 degrees here for the next couple of days. I can't imagine being a shed in the summer. It is horrible. It is like you you enter in here, but I have no other option you know, for now. So you come in here, it is like an oven. It's not actually that bad outside. But you come in here, and holy dog shit, is it hot. It's like a fucking 110 degrees here. It's disgusting. Fucking, I'm so, it's horrible. It is very, it is very bad nearly unbearable I, it's not human man say so CRT Regent says you can't open a little bit of the door I don't like it you know I, I tell you why I mean that you get some breeze in here but we have that pig farm next to us and they have a problem with rats and they I see they're scratching around the the uh, shed here sometimes 
in that. Yeah, so I think if I leave the door open, I can see what's going on. There's going to be rats that are going to sneak in. And Satson says, I never see people in the UK wear shorts on TV, so I assume it's not very hot there. It is here where we at. It is. It is. I mean, it's not Arizona hot, but it's, it is, it's, it's hot enough, you know. I, I lost touch, but it, it, it gets you uh, 30 degrees here, past that, way past that sometimes. 30 degrees Celsius, because the news all here is in Celsius. So I got to convert that in. Uh, got to convert that in uh, Fahrenheit. So, but it, it's fucking hot. Yeah, it's very hot. And then you you, you come in the shed here, so you know the the Celsius. Because I, I I got used to it. I got used to Celsius. But uh, the shed here must be 40, at least 40. There's that is de there's no fucking way it's not 40 here. I don't have a thermometer here. This is 40 here for fucking sure. There's no fucking way this is less. Oh, what the f Look, the sound again. I was blaming the cable. I'm not having a good time here today with this, those problems. I'm not I'm not sure I'm not understanding what's taking place with the sound try to connect it again well it has nothing to do with it right I'm not having a good time here today yeah still this will ruin my stream isn't it just gonna ruin it let me see if I can get rid of those two adapters then let me see I don't know it's all sorts of problems here today I didn't I tested and retested everything was fine yeah, I'm not sure what's happening. You hear that? Must be nasty in there, the sound. Yep, I'm not sure what's taking place here. It stopped. Maybe there's something wrong with the cable. Will you fuck off and let me fucking work? Playing monkey ball. Yeah, but is our, is, uh, let me see. It is on RCA. Everything's RCA here. I'm not sure there is one is a, a big chain of command here is a lot of splitting and I'm trying to eliminate as much as possible so hopefully that'll be it for a while but it, it could be it's just I'm not seeing uh, between this and let me see here maybe I'll unplug this here maybe I'll unplug everything that is three and a half millimeter just get the fuck out even though the source is is not active I want to get rid of it there we go it's so many fucking cables here and then you're dealing with the fucking horrible horrible weather okay are we on yeah can I play some other fucking mon monkey ball if you, if you don't mind my good sir with the, with the problems here He said, I guess being surrounded by... Yeah, uh, oh, and that wintertime mold everywhere. We go mold on everything. Mold on top of the mold. It's fucking horrible. Ah, fuck. Threw off my timing with those fucking problems. Yeah, the mold here is horrific. The mold problems. Fucking dealing with cables here. I forgot even where the fuck I was. Thanks for You're welcome. I, I, I'm trying to play, but the hardware is disagreeing, my good sir. So I had sound problem, and then the video froze, and then the sound problem again. Mm-hmm. I'm not, no, 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 I'm not impressed. Let's see if we can play. I just, there was some three and a half millimeter sources that were inactive, that were connected, I disconnected them. Maybe they're uh, having some kind of effect. Oh no. There you go. Is that a banana? No. Fucking butterflies. Could it make a, di a different fucking collar? Keep thinking they're bananas here. Probably a rat's name in the cable. Thank goodness they're right next to me, the cables. And outside they're, uh, they're in a cor corrugated tube. So no, they haven't made it in the shed yet. There hasn't been a single rat. I used to have traps here all over the place, but they've been trying to get, and I've been I've been denying them. Damn, they're out there. They're not coming in here at all. 
Because the minute I have a rat in this shed, I'm out. I'm freezing the channel, and I'm taking everything there is from inside the shed until I kill the motherfucker. There's no way I can coexist with a rat. With, it, the shed is too small for me and a rat. Or a mouse, it don't matter. Oh, I thought it was more here. No, I think it's probably a three and a half millimeter. No, the cables are fine, they're here. They're right, like literally right next to me, and then they go inside the tube right away. Rat proof. Well, unless they get inside the shed, then I'm fucked, and there's no... And the only way is uh, cleaning everything. But so far, yeah, I, what I do is anytime I go in the shed, I never leave... Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! I never leave the uh, door unattended. So, and them scratching here, well, it's a good sign. No, no. It's a good sign because that means they, they can't get in yet. Can I go? They're edibles. As long as they're not cigarettes. Yeah, just like that movie, what was it called? Demolition Man. What's this here burger? Rat burger. Rat burger? Yeah. He's like, ah, fuck. He's like, well, it's good. <laughs> down in the rat burger with a beer. Come on, man! Fucking straight this one. A little bit too far, I would say. Just a tiny bit. Jesus fucking Christ with this one. Now they're farm rats. There's a big pig farm here. Pig farms, they have a lot of rats. Sometimes they go with them tractors and dogs and get them out and the dogs just tearing to pieces. It's fucking awesome. I don't like rats. Oh, but I have a pet rat. Well, it's not the same fucking thing, is it? Pet rat is something else. Oh, man. Come on. I'm not getting this one. Oh my god. Having a bit of a problem with this one. Yeah, shut your mouth. Oh fuck, I waited too long. It's not even point. Go hit the beanstalk. I, I waited too long. There was no point in there. I fell asleep here. There we go. Fuck off! Come on! Ah. Wow. By the time I get you the harder bits, I'm already fucking vanquished here. Yeah, but I lost a lot of continues. Sats and say, can you jump? No, as far as I know, you cannot. You only can sort of jump by bouncing on things, but you can't really jump. In fact, I think Joe said the whole, you can't control the whole game with uh, the analog, that's it. There's not even point for the buttons as far as it, you see it. Oh no. Yeah, the whole game is just pretty much the, uh, the analog. This stage was kind of weak, kind of a weird one. I think I have to wait a, just a tiny bit, and then I can go, right? Fuck! What are you doing? No, no, we got, we got the gist of it. No, I want to. Oh, damn you! There's a thing down there. I wonder what that is. Oh, this one was fun. Ready? There we go. I gotta focus on this one here. Sorry. Really gotta focus. Whoa, whoa, whoa.
This one requires some focus. Let's go. There we go. Hey, oh. I'm frozen again. Ah, fuck off. What's happening? No, I'm not ready to fucking. I'm ready. My camera is not. What the hell, man? Leave me the fuck alone today. How come I streamed for like a gazillion hours a couple of days ago and none of this shit was a problem? Is that the heat? Maybe it's the fucking heat. All right, going on black here in a second. Jesus fucking Christ, leave me alone. Need to capture device. Oh, fuck off already. Shut up! None of this shit. This fucking work. Fucking expensive piece of shit, Kim. What are you doing? Who's doing this? Is this the Elgato? You fuck off already. My back. It's frozen again. It's the Elgato. It has to be. The fucking thing is fucked. My God, man. You fuck off. Shut up out there! What the fuck is going on here? Fucking thing worked for like two seconds. What the fuck is going on here today in this motherfucking shed? Huh? Fucking fuck off with the problems already. Jesus fucking Christ. No, it's fine now, I can't see, but fucking it's twice I had to fucking. Yeah, I, I, well, I learned one thing today. I definitely need a. Need a we're experiencing technical difficulties screen that plays a music or something. That are just cutting the black. Like, you know? Yeah, let me know if it's frozen again, because I, I do look at the chat more than I look at the uh, at the screen. But I did notice this time. I would I would love to know what's the actual temperature here. It's crazy. Alright. So this one here, I went too fast last time thinking the, the timer is really crazy, but it's not. So it's pretty reasonable actually. You don't need to go nuts here. Plenty of time. Don't need to go, maybe on the expert mode will be, be some of the crazy shit. I'm frozen again, what the fuck? All right, I don't know what's happening. I don't know, let's pause, pause, shut up, shut up. I don't know what's going on today. Is that the Elgato? Okay, gotta delete it again. I don't know how many times I'm gonna do that. How... How many times I'm gonna do that? How many fucking times today do I need to do this shit? Can you fucking leave me the fuck alone? I think maybe it has to, maybe it's the temperature here. Could it be? I know it's back, but it's just, it keeps locking up. It just keeps locking up. A fan on what, on the Elgato? I can, because there'll be a lot, a lot of noise here. Motherfucking thing, I can be here suffering without a fucking fan and, and the man up and deal with it and the fucking devices can. You're made of plastic and metal. I'm the one who's made of fucking flesh and bones. Sweating here like an idiot. I've got to wait here, see if it's gonna just freeze again. I don't know what's going on. I, I got a fucking tent. I'm I'm not using a fan, the human. And the, I got to fucking worry about this hunk of junk here. Okay, let's wait a tiny bit. And s 30, feels more, feels... Do you have a thermometer? I would like to know what's the temperature here. My wife is saying this. 
It's gotta be it's gonna be more than just than eight to six. This feels like a hundred here. This feels like a past hundred. It's horrific. But I, 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 I'm, I'm pushing through, but the, it seems like either the Elgato or the camera, they're having a little trouble here. Got to bring him, got to bring him a, you know, some milkshake. Some amenities here. Fucking, fucking devices can take the heat. It feels, it does feel warm, but again, it always has felt warm. It's not frozen. Okay, let's see. Bring over a thermometer. Yes, I want to. I want my wife to bring a thermometer. Bring, bring, bring it over. I just saw it. It's the El your mother. I just saw it. I just saw who's doing it. It's the Elgato. You fucking piece of shit. Okay, I'm gonna replace the El mother. Okay, I'm gonna replace the Elgato. I have, I have, I have something here. Different. You unbelievable piece of shit. I'm gonna use the uh, Cam Link 4K. I have a backup. I have a backup in here. It's smaller. Maybe it'll be less. It's in a bag here. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go fetch it. I'm gonna go fetch. Just give me a second. Fucking Vitas, bro. I saw it. It's the Elgato. Uh, I saw the lights went on and the fucking Vita went frozen. Well, good job, Elgato. Fucking disposable piece of shit. You have the Camlink 4K, it's smaller. I used to use the Camlink 4K before, so maybe it'll do, it's fine. Sorry, sorry about the technical problems, y'all. I'm deeply sorry about that. So I don't know if this is gonna work. Oh my God, okay. Man, what's your problem? Like, what am I to do with this shit? I don't know if this will fuck up the stream. I'd expect the device to be able to run a 6 to C, but maybe the shed temperature is making it much hotter. It feels hot, but not that, that much more than the usual. You know, it, it, it does feel hot though. I'm afraid of using the Cam Link 4K and, and the camera not being frozen, not being able to do it. Uh, but I'm gonna have to risk it because I can continue like this. It's just. Yeah, I'm coming. Just a minute. My wife is bringing a thermometer here because now I'm fucking curious. Yeah, it's here, but it doesn't stay in that. I uh, hold on. Get the thermometer. Here. Fucking shit, fucking up my screen. Okay, well, we got a thermometer here now. The old fashioned one. So, uh, put, it, put it here, I guess. Pull it anywhere. You fuck off. Just fucking go somewhere. Know where to put this shit. Just fucking get the fuck away from me. Get in there. Okay. Um. I'll try to unplug and then plug it in again. Yeah, let's see. Unplugged it, unplugged it in again. And delete it and start again. Let's see, I'm very sorry about that. Having some technical problems here. You, I never had this bullshit happen. I never had this freeze every now and then, I guess, but nothing like this. I undid my settings for whatever fucking reason. Separate shit. My fucking notebook, if you don't mind. Thank you. Good thing I wrote this out so you can throw us anything. Motherfucker. And they're 48. Just a minute. And then 30. Okay. I unplugged it, I plugged it, and I'm unplugged it. Uh, let's see if that will do, will do anything. That's the problem. 
Okay, we'll try them one more time. If the thing doesn't work, the Elgato is an Elgato HD 60S Plus. I'll use this here. I just use a Kim Link 4K. Yeah. Uh, did the job before, so it maybe runs less hot. I I used to use the Elgato for uh, game capture only. You know? Now I know how to do game capture, by the way. But uh, but you know my thing is this this style of stream here. This last video. My wife left the, uh, let me make sure it's really wrapped through. Okay. No can do. Afraid of the rats coming in. See, let's keep going for a little while longer here and see if it holds up. Maybe just needed a the, the old plug unplug routine, you know? Play some other fucking monkey ball here in peace. Leave me alone. All right. Jesus. You got a nicotine pouch here, because now I done got upset. Monkey ball! Leave me alone, hardware. Let me do my thing. CRT and the GameCube are holding up. What's going on? Fucking new Elgato here can keep up. Can keep up with the heat. Look at that, this fucking thing here, shooting electrons at a phosphor. Fucking screen is holding up. Shut up out there. And the GameCube here, fucking what? Going? Uh, yeah, 23 years old. They're holding up. Elgato here. In a little sour puss. Can I play my fucking game? Dealing with this shit. Like, hey. Fucking loud trucks out there. I hate them. Okay. No, no, no. Oh. No! Now I'm fucked. Shouldn't have forgotten this one. I didn't forget, I saw it, I just... The camera now is fucking with me, I come on. You just hear, yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know if there's gonna be enough time here. No, 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 no. Come on, come on, man. Come on, man, no it! Don't you dare, Gatto. Just hold up, you sack of shit. Come on, dude. Be dramatic. No, 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 no. Yeah, if you're stuck in the middle, you're done. <laughs> Is that a game over? No, still. Huh? Fuck you doing? <laughs> Maybe do this. Come on, dude. Go this, go, go, go this way this time. Just why not? You're, you're already here. No, no. We'll get your bitch ass in there. Yeah, oh, shit. Turn around. I want to turn around. Need to turn around, bud. Can't leave this one here behind. Come on, Fed. Oh, my God. You're kidding me. Stop, stop, stop. We're gonna make it. She tell me to hurry up. There you go. Hey ho! The hype is real! Hype for it. There's ripples. Nah, nah, I don't like it. <laughs> she, this is crazy. Dead Island, Riptide. 
See that game? The game is stopping. This motherfucker won't shut up about the hurry up. Damn it! Oh, look at this. It reminds me of Donkey Kong. I got a positive timer. Let me make this here bigger. Mr. Leaper is here. Hello there. Didn't even notice you were live. You don't get them uh, notifications? I thought, you know, I don't know how it works. Oh, sorry. You miss a lot of fucking problems. That's what I miss. The Vita's freezing up here every now and then. It looks like stop with the shenanigans now, but got a thermometer here. It's climbing. It's climbing up to, uh, it's past 80. See what I got here. It's already up to 84. Mm-hmm. Or 29, but it's going up. It's going up. Uh, Satson said, I'm assuming you need the phone app for the notifications. I'm exclusively desktop, so I'm not sure how it works. If you need to be on a... I assume they'll send you a notification. Oh, yeah, how would that work on desktop? Since I have my new phone, I never hear the vibration somehow. Oh, there you have it. It's all right. Do you, uh, if you come in the middle, I'm still going to be. I've been streaming for two hours only, so it's okay. I did a beginner part of this game, getting sort of issue it. And this is the expert, I guess, like the medium. And then there's an advanced. I'm not going to promise I'm going to 100% this game here. I mean, if it goes up all the way to the night time and I'm tired, I'm just going to call it a day. You know, we'll play some monkey ball and that's it. Not going to be fucking 100% in every fucking game or, you know, beaten, yes. But I, this one is more of a, you can't, you came from the arcade, you know. So it was an arcade game and then turn into the, uh, the GameCube here. So... So yeah, because this, I think if I beat the normal mode, I'm happy beat, beating the normal mode if, if I can't even get that done. But it is a lot of fun. It is Sega, yes, it is Sega. That's awesome, they are very good with that. My favorite is game over, yeah. So I'm locked in, I'm dead, is that it? Or is it moving around? Oh, 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 I got you. Did I? You got nothing. I'm locked. Seven, I'm locked up in six, here. Ah. Ah. <laughs> what are them numbers? So, what? This is like the hardest thing ever. This one. That's why they. No, the other one is the same way. Can I? I was foolish enough to think I could climb those things. I mean, I knew before this, the Sega anyway, but you just can't tell it so fast. So yeah, Sega has that unique vibe. I want to play some Sega Rally here on the Saturn soon. I like the looks of that game, but I never dove deep into it. I wonder what that number... Oh, can I... No, you just fall here. I'm not... Uh, so far, the stages haven't been like puzzles, but this one, I'm... I think... No! I think I have to bounce there and kind of do a do a thing. Now, I don't think what I'm doing here is the right thing to do. But, hmm, I expect kind of... Let me see. Maybe I'm... Okay, I got you. I don't need to go there right now. Oh, it gets harder and harder here, and this this being the pinnacle. Now that's too hard, that one. All right. I don't know, Mr. Lefra. First time playing the game, so I'll find out as I go along. I'll find out. I don't. I don't know yet, but uh, we're getting there. There's, there's different ways to do things here. Apparently, the time is very short, so they don't want you. I'm trying to. I think it's. You can't. You can risk going to the, the. The. The harder ones will give you more bananas. 
right here. And the easy, like if you go on the easiest one, you're gonna get very little banana. Nah, oh man, very little bananas. Let me see. I'll go on the easiest one first and see if that's. Okay, this one is is easy, right? But you get no rewards. See if you go here. Well. <laughs> Uh, this is this one was not as fun as the other ones because I don't know yet what to do okay that's it well we'll get to repeat the other ones which is a lot of fun anyways at least we'll try stuff we we kind of rather know what to do there we go oh shit I still need to go on the thing it's harder than our world well it's more fun though it's, it's, uh, yeah, it's, it's very different. It, they do have uh, limited continues, but it's fine. So, yeah, you go here. Let me see. You ever play Mr. Lee for, uh, Super Mario Galaxy? So there's a part in there with a ball that is sort of similar to this if you play that game. Or another reference that I know you haven't probably is uh, Marble Madness. It feels like Marble Madness pretty much. I had completely forgotten about this. So yeah, I probably will do my very best to do the, the, the normal mode and then I dwell on an expert and see how it goes. Yeah? If I, first I need to clear this is hard enough. Never play in a 3D Mario besides 64. Yeah, uh, uh, Galaxy has a part that is very similar to this. So you gotta control Mario in a, on top of a ball and it sort of feels like this. But I think Marble Madness, for an hour Mario Odyssey? Why did you play Mario Odyssey for just an hour? That game was awesome. I felt a sense of wonder I haven't, I haven't had since the Mario 64 game when I played that game. I loved it. I completed it. Really like, oh, really like that game. I did a good job on that one. Keep coming up with new mechanics and the, the possession thing is, was awesome. No, 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 no. There we go. No, 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 no. And here, kind of have to sort of take it easy. That's just the way it is. Go. Wasn't in the mood for it. Galaxy 1 I do own for the Wii. Well, when you play Galaxy 1, it's on Galaxy 1 because I haven't played the second one. So there's a part that's sort of like... Some bonus stages are like this. No, man, come on. Yeah. Parking around here, whatever. Okay, and then here and then haul ass. Alcohol and ash. Any other bananas here? No, that's it. I don't own Galaxy 2. Yeah, I do. I, that's why I hack everything. Like, if, if you didn't ha if this was a stock GameCube, uh, I was talking about when I started, you wouldn't even work with this fucking monitor here at all. Uh, because this monitor is a VGA monitor. It's not a CRT TV. It's a computer monitor. And it's a VGA, so it's at 31 kilohertz, so 480p and above. And this game is only available at 480i. So it won't even accept it. So the monitor will literally shut down and not read anything, 15 kilohertz. So that's the beauty of hacks and mods and things. See, thanks you to the hack in the homebrew community, I'm able to play Super Monkey Ball at 480p. So my advice to you, just, you know, stop with the, I, oh, I can't have the game, just hack the fucking Wii like everybody else already and just play the game, you know? It's real hardware. You know, maybe buy a second Wii and just hack it. If you ever need help hacking it, I'll point you to the right direction. Cause I, I sure as fuck am buying a damn disc to play a game. I mean, if you have a game is like, like a collection, yes, but them old games, fuck that. I go a step further, say, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Fuck. I remember being with the ladder bombing and stuff. It, it was a bit tricky. It wasn't like, it was touch and go for me as well for a while when I did it a few years ago. 
Wow, come on. Fuck. Uh... So, but is your Wii not break, right? It is the same as it was when uh, when you got it? Because if so, then uh, I can get on a Discord with you someday and help you out with that. Because, yeah, you got to do a certain few steps here and there. As long as it's not break and it's the same as it once was, you'll be fine. And you can try it again. I know it. I know of a video, so I know I did it before, so I think I'll probably get a video for you that is good and it doesn't beat around a bush or waste your time and it has all the steps, also not skipping steps, so that you can you can hack it easily. I mean why hack the Wii? They say why mean why hack the Wii if the Wii U can do the same? The Wii U cannot do the same. Sorry. Uh, the, Wii, the Wii U play a lot of the games uh, a lot darker. Uh, Virtual Console is terrible on the Wii U. It's blurry and it's darker when compared to the Wii. Uh, yeah, you wouldn't think so, but it is. Uh, again, I breathe this shit. So if you go watch my Life in Gaming episode on the Wii U Virtual Console, uh, you see the difference, so it, it doesn't. But then at that point, they say, why hack the Wii if the Wii U can do the same? Then why, why even have a Wii then? <laughs> What's... Why, why even bother? Why, you know? And then you could go further and say, why have the Wii U if you can just emulate with SAMU emulation and have more enhancements look better? Then why even have Wii U the Wii U? Why have anything, if you think of it? Like, for example, why have the GameCube if I can go right now on uh, Dolphin and fucking run this game with HD textures and, you know? You have the Wii because... Ah, uh, fuck this shit again! Listen to that, Mr. Dapper. And the Wii U is a pain in the ass, yeah, a lot. Okay, so today's the day of hardware bullshit. I don't know, it's a problem with one of them cables here. Sorry about that, y'all. It's been horrible today. It has been horrible. It has been horrific. Let me see what I can do. Can I discard more? Just give me a second here. I'm trying to... I play the Wii games on the Wii U because I can capture them with the Elgato. I can capture my, my Wii U with the Elgato because I have I have the OSSE. So, and, uh, you know, I don't have the, the HDMI mod, but as a matter of, like, OSSE is so cheap nowadays. And I, I never had a problem capture, capturing my Wii U. It's just a matter of having a real hardware. If you mean directly, uh, without having to buy anything, then yes. But... The Wii U doesn't doesn't do everything that Wii does, sadly. But if you if you're talking about everything, yeah, the OSSE is not fancy, Mr. Lefer. It's very cheap nowadays. Uh, it was fancy a gazillion years ago, but it's like it's a lot cheaper now. It's like a base fucking thing to have. I mean, if you're interested in capturing stuff, then you should invest on the hardware. I mean, I have to invest on a lot of shit to do all this here. So if you want to capture the Wii, is just all you need to do is buy the OSSE component cables and you're done. OSSC is less than 100 pounds nowadays, I think. You should be more expensive. But uh, if you want to capture the Wii, is just buy that. And not only that, when you buy an OSSC, because you're talking about buying the retro tank, but if you buy the OSSC, it's a lot cheaper and you'll be able to capture an array of consoles, only a few that you won't be able to. And it looks amazing. The OSSC is the sharpest. It looks way sh I, I always prefer, prefer the OSSC over the uh, now outdated Frame Meister. You know, but the OSSC is cheap. You can you can even buy fucking is uh, an open source project, so you can buy it on fucking AliExpress and shit. It's very cheap. It's very cheap. Like if you wanna if you wanna capture stuff, RGB, YPPPR, and VGA, OSSC is the best thing you ever do, and you get to play a game sharp on a on a flat screen if you want to, for a very reasonable price. I mean, like a hundred a hundred pounds for a scaler that can do all that. It has filters, it has. Uh, it has everything that you need, really. I personally don't... I like the Retro Tank 5X and all that, and I want to buy for the downscaling and for composite support and all that, but I'm not in a hurry. The OSSC, it just does everything that the body needs. The CIT Regina says, the test console for the Switch, I played a Wii U game, the design of the control. It, is, it insists upon itself with the... Uh, it, is my, it is my least favorite console uh, by far, as far as hardware speaking. It forces you to use... Uh, it didn't do a good job with the Wii Pad. Only a couple of games like uh, Nintendo Land, you play the... 
you play the uh, the ghost that's awesome and fatal frame they use it perfectly is the camera obscura but most game is just look at this don't look away from the tv and look at the gamepad i don't want to look at the fucking gamepad you know i don't like it i don't like i don't like it and holy shit it's like more cables than a sega cd1 you know <laughs> for fucking i uh, get a thing going is the wee bar sometimes if you need it is it then some games don't accept the controller uh, and the gamepad never fucks off I, I, every time I go touch a Wii U, I, I have two of them. One is modded, one is stock with a lot of games, legit games. And I don't know, I'm not, 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 I will play it here, you know, but I'm not into it. For me, the best use of the, the Wii U has been, I played Nintendo DS. Let me have a smoke here. I played Nintendo DS. That was awesome. And that's something only the Wii U can, can do. Uh, I played Nintendo DS emulation on the Wii U via the, their official virtual console, right? But on a hack console. And you can play, you can have the main, any of you can, you can download uh, profiles and you can have the second screen on your TV and the, the second, the first screen on your TV and the second screen on your gamepad. You can have, yeah, two PSUs. I mean, what the fuck, you know? And yeah, you can have uh, the DS is awesome on it until a DS consoleizer come, comes out. But it is when I'm setting up the Wii U because I don't have anything plugged in right now because I'm doing this thing, so I got to bring consoles here. But when I have to plug in the Wii U, it's a lot. It's a headache. It is a headache with the two PSUs. Two PSUs is already annoying enough. By God, you know a PSU for the gamepad. I'm gonna die. Get down there. What's? I wanna know. I want to know what's down there. There's some secret. Oh, I'm gonna die if I stay here. My Wii isn't even plugged in. Only the Wii U is. Don't know what to tell you now. Why'd you buy a Wii if you're not gonna use it? Honestly. Like I get it, the Wii U, but. Then there's no point in modding the Wii U. The Wii, if you're not interested in playing on the console, then there's no point in modding it. Oh, man. I did use the Wii before I had the Wii U. All right. Then you don't need to mod your Wii. I mean, you're not going to use it. Why Why? Why would you be bothered modding it? And Oh, and here's another thing. That the Wii destroys the Wii U as a console for me, for my personal use. And a lot of people are like that. The Wii can do 240p. You can plug it in a CRT and you can run emulation on games. This is fucking awesome with a virtual console. And the Wii U cannot do that ever. So immediately right there, right as far as I'm concerned, the Wii U is, uh, it, it, it has analog out, but it can't do 240p, can it? Yeah? Uh, if you plug in on a CRT and the games are not not uh so yeah and i have a lot of consoles here but a lot of people don't before i had for example before i had the nes when i bought the nes uh you know how you should play my my nes on the wii 240p on a crt looks exactly the same perfectly it's fucking awesome so yeah the wii u are we on luck as i say the problem about the wii u the wii u is extreme today you should have to buy this brain age or something. Today that we use the easiest shit ever to mod. It took me like, I don't know, 20 minutes. Okay, not that, like an hour, because I have to back up the NIN. It is very easy. It's a something called tiramisu. Just uh, think about the, uh... no, I'm going to get out of here. That's a uh, uh, gunkle. But uh, I, I prefer the Wii over the Wii U a lot more, a lot more. I'm not crazy about the Wii, though. I, I don't like the motion controls. I don't like motion controls. I don't like gimmick controls. I don't like motion controls, and I don't like the gamepad. I don't like I don't like how shove down my throat when I don't want to fucking use a damn thing. I'm more of a OG here with a plug a controller and play the fucking game. I don't really care for any ass or stuff like that. Well, <laughs> everybody's entitled to their own opinion, I suppose. 
and plus, I guess it's before your time. But, but do know this, yeah, that the majority of games that you like and play, it was all started there, started on the NES. Is the OG. If it wasn't for the NES, there'll be no fucking Wii U, that's for sure. You're free to not like the console. I met people that don't like the NES. Well, did, did I make the damn thing? No. You're, you're free to uh, dislike it. Not care for it, it's fine. I care for it a whole lot. What? It is my top favorite console along with the PS1. And I, I played more than the PS1, truth should be told. So in a, in a sense, it's probably then my favorite console. I don't like picking favors, there's no need there. I like most consoles. I like a lot of the Wii U games, but not their hardware. I think the hardware is shoddy. Don't care for it. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, got it. No, 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 no. My God. There we go. Yeah, I am. I'm hurting up. There we go. Yeah, but then, um, Mr. Levy, you said I would use uh, uh, the Wii U. How is the Wii U, if you think about it, how many games haven't been ported to the Switch yet? If you think about it, what is the point of the Wii U then? On that, if you go on the same entail. Well, the majority of thing I can do on the Wii, I can do on the Wii U. Yeah? And keep in mind, I'm not irritated or nothing. I just, I, I like pushing people with their opinions, and I'm opinionated, and I like to uh, play devil's advocate, just so you know. So, if, if the Wii... Is, is kind of useless because you have the Wii U and you can do whatever the Wii can, but on that vein, the Wii U doesn't do much that the Switch can do. Most of the games have been ported to the Switch, which is a far more successful console, and there's only a few things you can do on the, on the Switch because of the dual screen design, right? For example, Mario Maker, it's, it's harder to do, you know, make your levels because you know, if you have a second screen, it's obviously superior. Uh, but but the switch is uh, it has it has everything, and then they have Super Mario Maker 2 anyways. So if you think about it, the Wii U ah fuck, the the Wii U will be pretty fucking redundant by now, having a Wii U. I mean I don't think that, but I, I think most people have moved on to to that. And I don't know I don't know what's going on with the audio today. This is really disturbing. I wonder if there's a problem with the VGA cable. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Maybe this is damage here. Da you knew your damaged goods? I'm just saying I would mod the Wii U for Wii games because at least I can capture them easier. Well, that's a valid reason. Nothing wrong with that. It is easier to capture with consoles that have H HDMI. That's a fact. But if you want to, if you want to get into the business of capture, and if you want to play anything that is not an HDMI, then uh, you gotta invest on a scaler. Uh, but if you don't, then you don't. Then all you all you need is your uh, HDMI consoles. Okay, I'm gonna try to. I don't know what's happening here. This is really fucked. Uh, sorry, uh, we're we're having a lot of technical problems today. I don't have the money for all that stuff currently, Mr. Leeper says. Well, I, it's for the future. You don't have to buy to buy stuff right now. Other ways should do it. Yeah, the, the, then that. Well, then the other way should do it is. I mean, what do you want to do that is not able to be done on on HDMI? That what do you want to capture that you can't right now? What is it that you're after capturing? What what console? Okay, I left this alone for a while now. There's a lot of things I want and I can afford right now, just the way life works, isn't it? Half of the time I can afford whatever the fuck I'm, I'm after. I wanted a Sony FW. Oh, I wanted a Sony FW900. That never. That's never gonna happen. Ah, 
Fuck. I can't close last time. I had. Right? Yeah! Right, right, right. Mr. Lipper says, I love to capture PS2. I would, then I would tell you, wow, you need the scaler. No, not really. How about a PS3? Do you have a PS3? You have a PS3, right? Why would I deviate from this? I don't... Is this like a maze? Wow, the time here is... Yeah, but I got... Fuck it, fuck it. Oh, damn. oh yeah. And I actually don't know. You said I have a PS3 camera. And, I'm, uh, and when I don't know something, I just said I don't know. I have to look it up again. Because I look, you forget some of the stuff over time. But like, PS2 plays PS1 games in 240p. Now PS3, do they play the games in 480i? Because the PS3 has 480i. So if it does, and it doesn't do progressive, they have 480p. If it just plays PS2 games backwards compatible, that, that's not going to help you with, uh, with capturing. So I, I'm afraid that uh, unless there's some other option I'm not a, you know, aware of, if you want to capture for uh, PS2, you need a scaler, and that's not even the OSSC. The OSSC uh, it specializes on 240p. 480i is not good on the OSSC. You need a better. You need a. The cheapest one you can get is a GBS control. GBS dash C, and that can do uh, adaptive inter de interlacing on 480i and it looks good so you can capture PSU. I can't, I don't think mine can either, but again I have the PS, the actual PSUs as well in addition. Uh, yeah, because uh, PS, the PSU is the 480i king, nearly everything there is 480i. Green Charisma runs at 1080p. Well, again, everything, mostly everything is in 480i. Because before somebody tells some things run in 480 Yeah, very little when compared to the... Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, no, no, no. Don't fuck around, dude. I am, sir. There we go. Say so the OSSE isn't worth you buying that case. No. I would say no. If you if you after PS2, no. I would say no. Not worth it, no. Uh, but there's the GBSC. Look that up. You can find them quite cheap, actually cheaper than the OSSC because a lot of them are like homemade. You can even build one yourself. I have two of them. I have two because the first one that the guy sent me works with the internet and I don't like that shit. So he sent me one that has a, its own menu and stuff and you don't need the internet. And that does 480i beautifully. <laughs> and, uh, as, uh, cheaper than it was even. And I know you don't have the money, but you know, and it's for the future. When you do, you know, at some point you will have money. Ah, you fucking knew it. <laughs> Should have been Should have gone a bit quicker there. There we go. No, 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 no. We're not doing this shit. Come on, man. Get me up there. The time. There we go. Yeah, but it. Whoa. What we're looking at here, bud? I wonder if those things are gonna squash me. Do they squash me? Stop, so I guess I. I can't touch them? Okay. <laughs> I just did. What am I looking at? Fucking hell. Squeeze it. I mean, you could, but it's still a lot of time, so I want to get the nan. Oh! <laughs> I want to get the nanners here. Uh, Mr. Leifer, I got to pause here, y'all, when I talk because there's timer, so it's a different, you know, ball game here. Uh, what consoles work with the uh, GBSC? Uh, all of them. 
All of them, I get, sir. It does 240p, it does 480i, it does 480p. Uh, it does everything. So, and it's cheap. So, it's it's a good, especially 480i is good. Uh, the guy that sold me, as a matter of fact, he was, he made a, I was in touch with him for a long time. I use it on my Tenshu playthrough. So, that's, okay. If you want to see what it looks like, if you go to my Tenshu playthrough on YouTube, and it doesn't matter if you don't like YouTube, it is this for your own benefit, if you want to see what it looks like. Go to my Tenshu playthrough on my channel on YouTube, and on the description, there's an unlisted video of the capture. And you will see that is the GBSC. So, on eBay, I see those things for 70 euros. That's about right, that's the price, yeah. It's cheaper than LSSC, like I said. LSSC, uh, I don't know, it's about 100 now. Probably went down in price a tiny bit. There's nothing uh, below that, no. What the fuck? Uh, however, every now and then, it's uh, there's there's people that make it. I paid, now nah, I paid 60 on mine, so it sounds about right, eh? Sounds about that price. That's about, ah, fuck. It's about the price they go, they go for. So it would be that perfect solution for someone that doesn't have a retro tank, I guess. That's correct. I for, sorry, I didn't reply to that one earlier. That's correct because a retro tank, let's face it, is very, it's a very good device. It does a lot of things, but it's very expensive, yeah. So it's worth it, I would say. It's you know because it's quite. You get what you paid for, you know. You can always not buy a device if you don't want it. Nobody makes you buy things. But uh, for what you. Until you get one, the, the GBS C is, is, is very good. Come on, let me through here. So those things push you out. Gotta be careful. Yeah, we, this is this is madness. So sometimes they don't let you through. Sometimes that it. You have to find another way. When they stop, they stop. Let me in, you fuck. There we go. Uh, yeah, so uh, tension video, but the tension video is because I used, I used before uh, a long time ago. Uh, I used to do cap. I used to. Do, it was madness. I used to do this style of video here, all the same playthrough, just recorded with different sources, right? I used to do this. I used to do put another video, no commentary, because I thought some people don't like commentary, so they just want to see the CRT. And I used to have a capture commentary and capture no commentary. But once I started decided to just do this, I unlisted all the videos so they wouldn't clutter the channel. So what you do is you go to the Tenshu video, and then you uh, go in the description and you see the link to the unlisted video that is capture, and that'll be the GB. Uh, GBC, fuck me. The GBC control, GBS control. I invert the C and the S quite a bit, but you know what I mean. And NASCAR 316, rated with a party of three. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Hey, Rex, bro. Hey, how's it going, man? We're doing some monkey ball here today for uh, with the GameCube. 480p VGA monitor. <laughs> uh, VGA cable. And it's a hell of a game. Ah, when you're better at it. Says, I'm doing good, how are you? I'm doing good, doing all right. It's very hot here in the shed. It's, it's been difficult. It's having some hardware problems here and there. The sound started to crap out on me. But other than that, uh, doing fine and dandy. And I hope you're doing, ah, ah, ah. I hope you're doing fine too. Uh, oh, oh, and I forgot, I don't know if you don't care about this, uh, Mr. Leifer, but it also, if that wasn't good enough, it also downscales. It doesn't downscale 720p like, uh, uh, but it, uh, it downscales you, uh, you, I have a bit of money, by the way, I could even order in that one. It's worth it. If you order one, I'll, I'll help you uh, with the setup. Now, can you pay attention, please, if that's uh, online mode? There's some of them that's online. You have to go to a browser to set things up, right? And some of them are offline. So the... I've got a... Fucking... Hold it up! 
I always love the CRT stream, bro. Thank you. Yeah, they're always on the internet, Mr. Leaper, so you can order them whenever you want. When you order them, if you're having trouble with it, but uh, I'll send you a picture of both of mine. And uh, I appreciate an NASCAR 316. Thank you. Yeah, just send me the link. That's right, Mr. Leaper, and I'll uh, I'll look at it and I'll tell you. I would. Sorry, I'll strongly suggest you not get the online one unless you're not bothered by it. I am. You know what, Mr. Leifer? If you can find something reasonable there, I'll sell you. If you don't mind the online thing, I can explain to you later on, not now. Uh, I can sell you mine for peanuts. I, I'm not going to use it. I just I just sell it to you for uh, for very cheap. But that one you have to go online. But if you if you always around your house and you have Wi-Fi, then it don't matter. Yeah. Retro Retro Tank 2X Pro, very good solution. I mean, how is it with 480i? Does it do? Yeah, the retro. Problem is the motherfucking thing is never on stock. I don't know if it changed now. I tried to get a few times because I wanted something simple, and it was never in stock again unless he changed it. Because Mike, she has been busy with that. Ah, fuck. It's been busy with other stuff. Yeah, then if sometimes it's working, sometimes it's not your Wi-Fi, then I wouldn't bother. Then don't worry about mine then, because then I won't, I won't, I won't send you something that's going to be trouble. Because then if your Wi-Fi is not working, you can't capture it. That's fucking shit, you know? It's just that if you, if you wouldn't bother, then I'll send it to you for... Damn it, this is hard. I'll send it to you for cheap... Because I'm not... I, oh, man. <laughs> I'm gonna hit that uh, game over, ain't I? I still. It's very fun, this game. Very, very fun. Just. Can be tricky. What's not fun is the shed here now. I'm gonna check that thermometer, I'm curious. So here you gotta really slow that. Go, oh, it's right there, man. Uh, not this time. Not. No! Uh, uh, uh. Fucking hell. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, no, oh my god. Check this here. Eight to six. About eight to six Fahrenheit. About 30 Celsius. I wonder if it's climbing. It feels like a, a, a hell here. Drink some coke here, so it's a oh, it's a continuous. All right, right. I can. Yeah, now. I, oh, I got, I got. Hey, hey, I got a few more tries left here. That's awesome. Hoo, hoo, hoo. That's gonna be cool. That's gonna be. I thought it was a game over already. You see, I just need to drink some coke here. Again, I'm streaming from a shed, which cannot have windows open. A wooden shed in the dead of summer and I cannot have a fan here because the because the sound will be horrific so I'm hurting I'm hurting here but we'll, 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 even my devices were overheating here my Elgato capture card because yeah I'm still using an Elgato for all this connected with a camera and even that was squeaking on me gosh darn it this game is fun it's fun. It's, it's so fun. Like uh, even if you fail, you just—it's the sort of game you fail. You're not. You're trying again. You, you, uh, you want to try again? As, and when you fuck up, it's usually you. You're the culprit. Well, usually it's always you because you have the controller. But you know what I mean with bad controls and shit like that. This is very. Ah! <laughs> Missed my foot in there. Just a tiny bit. Ready? And if you, and whoever's watching this, I hope you're having fun watching the stream. I sincerely do. I put a lot of work to make those streams as good as it can. I don't want it. Oh man, I'm ready. Let's go. Okay, get good, get good. Stop, stop fooling around. No fooling. No, no fooling. There we go. 
got to keep an eye on the bounce here. Like here, for example, you come in too hot. No, no, like here. Stop, 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 stop. The whole thing is taking it easy, taking it easy, taking it easy. Camera, help me, please. No, 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 no going out of control. 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 Thank you. Don't, don't go crazy. No, no. You need to go. You need to be a... <laughs> Fatality! Monkey wins. Holy shit, man. That was a battle. That was a battle of wheels. But I still have more containers here. Chase! How's it going, man? Yo, how you doing, brother? Playing some monkey ball here today. No monkey business, just monkey balling. Take it easy, take it easy, monkey. Monker. Here we go. This is a lot of fun. Right, the, the thing is in, oh, brutally insane here. What if I don't adventure too far near the edge? How about that? I, I would appreciate if the camera would turn around there. Kind of be it, you know? You'll be, you'll be sweat. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. The camera. The camera! Ah. Chase has just got off work. I hope everyone is doing good. It's just fucking hot as hell in here, Chase. It's horrific. The shed, the summer's full force here. Stay out of the, stay out of the, stay out of the cat box. Huh, huh. Nah. There we go. No, no, no. Tight corners, huh? That's it. No, 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 you demon. Go, 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 go. No. There we go. <laughs> Leaper says, can tell if the GBSC, I'm looking online, think it would Wi-Fi. Send me the uh, send me the link to Discord after the stream. I'll make sure to remember to check it. Sometimes I do go a few days without going on Discord. I barely go there, to be honest with you. I'm not a, not a big social media guy. It's about... Sometimes it goes once a week, but uh, I'll, I'll go, I'll see if I remember. Chad says, Chase says, Arizona somehow 83 degrees. Lucky it's not 110. He said, uh, we are that here right now, but I don't know, man. It feels fucking, it's 86 here now. I brought a thermometer, that's how miserable it's been here. Don't bother me, come on, fucking cable. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, gotta gotta keep on the truck and go, go, go. You can't, I, ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I thought I'd been here, but, oh, deja vu. Thought I'd been to this stage, but, oh, no. This. this We go. Fuck. Now, fucking, I look at the fucking time. I'm worried about the time. Nah. Chase says I love the game music. It is awesome. It is excellent. It's an excellent game. The music is beautiful. It is, it really is. Ha! Ah. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Shit. All right, no distractions. I look. I, I swear to God, I looked at the uh, timer because I'm, you know, there's a, oh, there's a timer. So I lost my foot in there. Ah, now this was me just fucking around. It's kind of loud. It's louder than you. Well, let, let me do the thing here. Just a minute. Oh, game over. <laughs> Time to have a break. Uh. Chase saying that the music is louder. Does everybody else feel the same way? The, the music is too loud when compared to me. 
I'll wait and have a smoke here while y'all. I can just turn a slide here. Thank you. If you ever come in here and you feel that way, just tell me immediately. No ceremonies, please, for your own enjoyment because it's, it's incredibly easy. I just need to grab the mouse. There's a slider, pull it down, done. The game audio is separate from my commentary as a track here. So I will reduce to minus 20. Is it good? All right. I'll talk a little bit. Yada, yada, blah, blah, blah. Something, something, dark side. Something, something, something complete. Does that sound good still? So it's down to a minus 20. Let me go ahead and write that down. Write it down, boy. Minus 20. It's fucked, though, because it goes to YouTube. I don't want to adjust the fucking audio. I'll write down the timestamp. Yeah, there you go. should just write down the timestamp. What time? Two hours and 47 minutes. Two hours, four to seven minutes. Let's change the sound from 20. From 14 decibels to 20, minus 20. <clears throat> yeah, when I got the, uh, got the only, the Elgato HD 6S Plus, what's the difference really? I mean, I tried to go for the highest one they have in there, but I'm not sure what's the difference with that Plus and the, the regular one. I'm using it right now, but there's no need. Before I use this here, the great success, Cam Link 4K for what I for capturing games straight from the console is good for this. What I'm doing here, it worked perfectly. Uh, so I have this a backup. It does the same fucking job for me for this style of video here. Uh, I went with the uh, with the Elgato that I used for game capture because I thought it was more reliable. But today it was overheating, so not sure about that there. Bam, bam, bam. I I revel in the fucking heat though. Fuck it. I don't like it, but I get used. I I adapt. It reminds me of home. All right, let's go. No ceremony. Let's go head back to it here. Uh, 2166 the output. That would be good if I was doing capture. I can't see if doing capture a PS5 and shit like that. But for me, yeah, not a lot of use because I don't I don't use those functions. Maybe someday it'll come useful. So so they ask the normal one stops at what resolution? 2160 30? 1080p 60? Just just curious. Because uh, I heard of the Elgato's failing, so there'll be a time that I might need to buy a new one. And if if the S Plus doesn't have the fun functions that I need, such as 2160, uh, then there's no reason for me to shell out the money for it. At the time when I bought it, I was doing uh, hardware capture, like a uh, raw capture, right? No, 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 you're not doing that. You're not giving up on this this year. So if I don't need it, uh, all I need is 1060, uh, 1080. Ow, oh, fuck. Ah, 20, blah, 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 blah. I need 1080, uh, 1086, so that's all. So if the ass, the Elgato ass does that and it'll be cheaper, that's what I'll get next time. Then if this here kicks the bucket. Oh, shit. Don't forget the, the your banana cash. Let's go. Just a little bit more careful. There we go. Mm-hmm. We're cooking. We oh whoa 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 whoa. Sega has a thing with pinball mechanics, don't they? They love it. And there we go. 1080 1080 60. Let me just read it real quick. Four calm down. 480p 60, 720 480p only, 640 by 480 not supported. Can I ignore this with the GPS, I guess? I gotta digest what you just said there, so. It doesn't 
640 by 480. So it doesn't support 640 by 480. Mm, no, that might be an issue. I mean, what? Uh, the GameCube is 640 by 480. Pretty sure that's what that is. I mean, I can't check it right now, right? Where's my remote? Man is remembering this shit now. I can't remember. Does this even have a... There's no batteries in it. What good is a remote with no batteries? Fucking hell. Because this thing, the thing on the back, I'll show it later, has a manual and everything. Yeah, I'll look into it because I, well, look into it now. I think, uh, I'm pretty sure the GameCube, uh, when I booted the console here, the, it gives me the resolution is, uh, I think it was 640 by 4, uh, 448, which is pretty much 480p, but not quite. You know, it's for, we call it 480p, but it's less, tiny bit, but it's stretch here to fill up the, the screen. So, yeah. Ah, what are you doing? What do you hear? What'd you say? Damn it! Go, go, go! Ah! The hell you? You're losing it. God, I feel like I felt like I, I was drunk now. That's such a weird thing. Doesn't support 640 by 480. What? But support 720. Yeah, 720 is like DVDs and stuff like that. My God, I'm a sweating here. Wait, I gotta I literally wipe the sweat off my face. It's fucking horrible. Damn this heat. Fuck off her. That's why I love fall. It's my favorite season of all time. Chase says, I'm sure you would like Marvel Blast Ultra. It's kind of like this. Is Marble Blast related to Marble Madness? I know Marble Madness on the NES. I love that shit. That, I find that game incredible. Marble Blast Ultra. Thank God I saved the chat so I can see all the recommendations. I save as a PDF. Let's go. Go, 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 go. Ah, ah, ah. Three six a game. Sitting right here. Today I'm playing commercials from the on the 360. It's down here. I got a 360 slam. Uh, it's on PC. Ah, I don't play on PC. I used to. Just lost with it. I do appreciate the Steam doesn't charge for your online gaming though. Like the others. 360 game. They took it off the 360 store. Uh, I'll be hacking the 360 soon enough, so I'll get it right back through illicit means, as it should. I do have a lot of discs, that's why I haven't bought her. But if there's a game that is good, you know, uh, on an old console, I'll just hack it then, I suppose. I do want to hack it, because there's a lot of things you can do with a console. Ah, oh, fuck, I fell asleep here. Wait, what, what am I doing? Wait. Gentlemen, I've been doing this all wrong. There's no reason to rush here like an idiot. Look at this, the thing just go back. And here I was, my NES wire game, gamer mind, that if you fuck up, you're done, forget it. No, plenty of time. Look at that, how many lives I lost here? Trying to get it first. Wow, leave it and learning. Yeah, a lot of the digital games that take it off, like for example, Let me see here. For example, because uh, we we're talking earlier about the Wii versus the Wii U with uh, Mr. Liffer. Mr. Liffer, I can't remember. Does, can the, uh, I think, oh, can the, uh, nah, I think it can. Uh, I wonder. If you can run WiiWare, WiiWare, the yeah, from the Wii on the Wii, on a modded Wii U. I know you can do V Wii, right? Virtual Wii on the Wii U. But I'm wondering if you can, because a very special case, the, the WiiWare, the WADS, W-A-D. Can you run, run WiiWare on the Wii U? Can you look that up? It's 
six, six, six forty interlace. So what are those packs you're giving there? Six six forty by four eighty at six hundred. That means he can he can do. Now let's digest one thing at a time. What what is the numbers you gave me? The specs or GameCube? Okay. Well, it says here. It's fucking useless for me to go. Okay. Yeah. Well, like I said, I did tell you 640 by 480, but it's an approximation. For example, this game here, uh, Resident Evil, a lot of them are technically, we call it 480. It's just approximation. Like Just like we say 480p, seldom games are actually 480p. So, sorry, 240p. We round it up, so... You know what I mean? Actually, <laughs> it, I don't want to be that guy, but it's uh, 448. Uh, then some games might run at 480p, actual 480p. Uh, but I knew that. But I mean, and, and I want to say in about, I don't know what you mean right now. Well, I explain what I mean. I said, we wear, we wear. Can you run that? You're talking about the Wii U and the things that Wii U can do that the Wii can, you know, can do everything that we can. I'm curious, and it matters, because I'll tell you later why. Can the Wii, a modded Wii U run WiiWare Wii games? There was WiiWare, WiiWare. Are you familiar with the WiiWare games? I don't know if it would work. It's very weird that you wouldn't do 640 by 480. That's a standard 480 uh, res. Ah, fuck. Standard 480 resolution. I don't know why that. Why exclude that and then have 720, which is actually higher? You know? fucking weird that would be a problem for me if I'm capturing because a lot of a lot of games are 640 no it wouldn't work 640 by 480 said it doesn't support it Ready? Go. what are you saying there It's fucking impossible for me to go up here on the chat. It's disgusting. The GameCube standard output resolution is 720 by 480. Was it because the GameCube was born of the CRT era? I had raw footage of the of Resident Evil 4 that I, I capture and I capture some GameCube. I uh, I don't recall 720. I could be wrong, but yeah, I don't, I don't recall 720 on it. I, gotta, I, I have to look that up, to be honest. I, I pressed out on that. But uh, see if you uh, if you can run WiiWare games. I look it up. But if you looked it up in the internet, it says it does 720. I'm just surprised. I'm very familiar with the with the resolution because as I work with it, a lot of the ads that you see on uh, on the channel here are no 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 no. Ah, fuck! <laughs> a lot of the ads you see around on our channel depend on the source of what I'm using is 720, which is standard like DVD resolution. Okay, let me concentrate on this here, and then I'll look at the chat in a bit. Yeah, get in there. So it's 596 by 448, 446, 448. If I looked it right up, you can run WiiWare again. That's good. Uh, that's very good then, because the WiiWare has uh, some good games that are lost forever. For me, the one that comes to mind immediately is Castlevania The Adventure Rebirth. The Rebirth. It's fucking awesome. It's an awesome game. It's an awesome 2D Castlevania and it's gone forever. So the people that go, I've never mod my Wii and I never do that or this, and you never play such games. Because Nintendo doesn't give a shit. Or Konami, none of them do. That game is gone forever. But not really, if you mod your Wii, you play it. I played, awesome game. Fucking awesome. Jerome came in and said it's capable. Hi Jerome. Of 72480, like the Dreamcast. A problem. Then you're all set for the Mr. Liffer. Then, then if that's it, then you will have no problems with the with the Elgato, right? That they're talking about. 
I would probably mod the Wii one day too, maybe. I don't know. Uh, well, if you want to play on a CRT, maybe, uh, like related to your capture, no, but I'll, I'll, I'll just invest on a capture. I mean, if you're in the, if you're in the business of uh, capturing stuff, eventually you're gonna, you're gonna invest on a, sorry, not capture a scaler, you know? If you're gonna capture older stuff, that you can run on an HDMI console. Nah. But I don't understand how the Elgato, I know they're listed, but why Why in the hell? I know you asked in Jerome, but I'm, I'm just curious. Why in the hell would you support 720 but not 640, which is a lower resolution? That is, I would have never expected that. I expect it to be like 1080p60, no 4K, okay, that, that's all right. But a lower resolution that they don't like is weird. Must, I wonder what, the, what, what would cause that to be the case. Maybe Geron will chime in on that. Why, why a device would be able to capture 720 by 480, but not 640 by 480? Is this something to do with a chip? Ah, 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 ah. Uh -huh. hey, 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 stop, stop, stop. And see, you think, this is games, right? You think I had a major problem with this level here before. And now it's, it's not that bad. Ah, uh, and then I say that and I die. Whoa, whoa, turn around. I need to know where we're going here, monkey. Monker. Yeah, not getting me here in the car. Now, I fuck, I fucked up. Turn around. Three, two, one. Yeah! Jerome, he's looking for he's looking for a scaler on the cheap that can do 480i for the PS2, Jerome. So I suggested maybe the GBS control. I have it here, and he said the the Retro Tank 2X Pro for you know the interlacing because the OSSC is not good for that. The, the Bob the interlacing sucks. So I wonder if you can chime in on something that would help him out that, that, that I, might, I might not know about. For me, I think the cheapest, if you want to like go all the way to 1080p, is the GPS control, right? Jerome is the guy, he knows a lot about this shit, so he'll, he'll, he'll hook you up. Like I said, if if your Wi-Fi wasn't a problem, I'll send you my second unit for peanuts just for like shipping money. I'm not using it. I would I would gladly give it to you if you needed. I got no use for it, you know. But the problem is that with the Wi-Fi thing, you know. Ah, ah, ah. And the shipping is only because you're in a different country. If you're here, I would just send it to you myself. I don't know, maybe the ship in a ship there. Ah, fuck! Ready? Mr. Leifer says, I would try with the Wi-Fi. I hope that it's not custom then. I don't know, I will, I'll send it to you. I got no problem sending that to you. If you want it, you know. I, I, would, I would love to know that if you actually use it, I don't want to send it to you if you're not gonna, it's not gonna work then then I would rather not do it. But if if it's gonna send to you, tell you what, then I'll send it to you. Let's do it that way. When I have time here, I'll send the device to you. And, uh, you see what you, The issue with scalers on the chip, it doesn't really exist. I would really recommend skipping on scalers unless you're ready to spend between 300, 700. I can't afford to give. Well, I don't get that, Jerome. You're talking well. The price you're talking about is like retro tank stuff. I really, I really admire you and your opinion, but I mean the OSSC is a hell of a scaler. Uh, 
the GBS control does a, does a good job. You know, I, I did my Tanshu, I showed him the Tanshu one. It's not perfect, it's a bit soft, but the, that amount of money there, holy shit. That's like, uh, yeah, that's like Retro Tank 5X. And I, I've been quite happy with the OSSC. I mean, not for 480i, that's for sure. But just wonder what the price you mentioned there on the on the scalers. I mean, I know you get what you paid for, but I'm just wondering how 300 pounds. I mean, that's like 365 pounds you get the the, the retro tank. Yeah, five uh, five X. You know, then yeah, that'll be the top of the line, but. I think, yeah. I don't know. I do think that you spend, you get quality, but sometimes, uh, like for example, if I if I waited for 300 pounds to do my Tenshu Vita, the time I cared about the capture, you would have never been done, you know? Ah, la, la, la. But I end up, Come on, come on, come on. In a perfect world, I would like to have the Retro Tank 5X for sure. For me, it's the downscaling. That's what I want. Obviously, I play on CRTs here, so there'll be times that I want to downscale, and it, and that can take 720 and downscale. It's so awesome. Although the GB, the GBS control can downscale to 480p, but not everything can be on 480p. So if I want to downscale like the PS5, that's not going to fucking work, is it? Nah. I am, my good sir. I am iron it. Come on! What are you doing? Let's see what your arm has to say here. No, Mike, for 360 pounds, you get a useless box and a plan to buy high quality. RGB cables, you have sent correct to appear on the screen. Oh, so you mean like, uh, oh, you mean like uh, the whole package? You mean like the console, the retro gaming cable stuff? Cause cart, yeah, you do have to have high quality by God. Even here, when I use high, uh, low quality, the buzzing is fuck. I have to fucking go on OBS and mute it. And before I didn't know how to do that. So a lot of my fucking shit got buzzed. And uh, 30 bucks a pop, that's true. At least I have component cables for PS2 and Wii. Not sure if they're good, but they look better than composite. Scalers are a rabbit hole unless you already have the cables. The true price tag is a lie. That's true. Yeah, because you do have to consider. Yeah, because what's the fuck? Yeah, that's true, Mr. Rick. What the fuck is the point? Like what he's saying, that you buy, you buy a fucking retro tank uh, 5X or the upcoming 4K, and then you go on and you use a shitty ass cable. That you bought for f some people are like that. They'll sh they'll shell out the money for the scaler. I need to drink some coke here. They shell out the money for a for the scaler, like very expensive, right? And then they go and uh, they don't want to they don't want to pay 30, 30 bucks on a cable because that's too much. And then they got a buzzing shitty ass cable going on a very expensive scaler, and then they complain that it, that it doesn't work well. And actually, as they have consoles, you have capacitors sometimes, you have to do things, you have to mod things and do stuff. Like, for example, I got a one cheap old 3 Super Nintendo. If you just plug that in uh, and don't worry about anything, you're not even going to get C Sync, so, but you can get the Luma. Then there's a lot of problems. The brightness is wrong, ghost, and there's a lot of fixes you have to do. Yeah. I agree. If you're, if you're going to shell out money on a retro tank, uh, 5x and 4k and all that you ought to get the best cables there is because otherwise what's the point uh, fucking is hot here and stinky and fucking it stinks in here and it's not me by the way incidentally we live next to a pig farm and whenever the wind blows this way huh, Holy, it's like somebody's here farting on my face. And the shed is, is like pretty aerated, it's like there's gaps. So right now it's hot, 
and it's like there's a guy farting in my fucking ear. It's horrific. I hope you're fucking enjoying the stream. Let me tell. <laughs> let me tell you, I'm enjoying the game though. Oh man, the smell has like I didn't need this shit now. Mr. Lifter says I want to capture and stream the stuff. What's the problem? Ask Mike why it's a bad idea. It's just, it's a lot of work. It's be ready to add it a lot. And uh, like I said, I used to do this. It's, you reach a point, I was doing this, this same stream that you're seeing here on YouTube, for YouTube. I didn't have the internet for streaming. So I used to do this here. And then a second video at 1080p, 60, and a second video, no commentary, and then a capture at the same time. And then capture no commentary. Then I went to, I think I went to leave the commentary, but then a capture. But it was so much work in the uploading times, you know? So, yeah. Gotta upgrade the shed. Should not play, be playing under this condition, Chase said. Chase, I'm on a race against time. Because when winter comes, there's zero fucking way I'll be able to stream here. So what I, I need to do here is this section of the shed. I need to I need to put a wall here in between to section it so it'll be easier. And I gotta start fucking insulating the shed. I gotta start insulating this and insulate the top and insulate the fuck out of everything so I can bring a heater in here. I have a heater here that will do the job. But as it is the winter time here, it is fucking horrific. See, I wasn't streaming at the time when it was last winter here, but it delayed my videos at the time I was only making videos. So there's no fucking way I can do this winter. So I, I'm on, I, I need to start within a paycheck or two. I need to start getting, uh, getting insulated here because you know, otherwise you'll kill my channel. You know, I want to be able to come here and do my stream. The shed is, the shed fucking literally freezes sometimes. You know, it freezes, like I can't open, I can't open the door. Okay, I'm gonna try to take the medium way. Not, fuck, you know, I'm taking the coward way out. Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Can you imagine going here? Joe from Game Set could probably do it, not me. Look, I'm a coward. I'm a coward. I'm taking a coward way as a taking the easy way out. I see. Nope, not not fucking with that. Sorry, not not on this stage. I don't get this stage. <laughs> uh, Jerome says Mike wants to send me a freaking PowerPoint of his setup. is is ludicrous. Just there's about a dozen devices and just as many adapters. It's fucked up. It's so much easier to just do the fucking uh, CRT now, I gotta tell you. Whoa, whoa, so much easier. I mean, it's still a lot of fucking cables, but it's, it's nowhere near, it's, it's insane. Doing the, uh, I can't believe I did it for that long. What the fuck was wrong with me? It's like I, I relish now. I'm trying, you. Let me in, you cunt. No. Ah, there we go. Yeah, it was insane. It was a crazy scheme I had going on. And for very little benefit, you know. What, you please people that don't like my fucking voice? Fuck them. Now think about it. Think about what I'm doing there. What are you doing? What is this? Okay. There we go. Please don't push me. There we go. And oh, this has got to be... Hey yo, you got cage, bitch. Give me a motherfucking second here. Holy fucking shit. Alright. Need a smoke here. What was that motherfucking bang outside? What the fuckers doing out there? This is madness. Say this one. This is I, I, this one is so weird. No, you're not pushing me, you piece of shit. Fuck off. They don't move if you're around them. They're gun. Don't push me into the goal. I need more bananas here. I need the nanners. Get out of my way. This is unsettling. Oh, oh, uh, you want me to go in the corner so you can push me the fuck out? Like, oh, whoa, whoa. 
Nah, no, we're not doing this yet. Not, not today. Not after the things I've seen. Come on! What is this? Get... This is... It's awkward. Get in there. This <laughs> is fucking weird, that one. <laughs> Confetti! Oh my god, this one. That's where I died last time, wasn't it? Did I pass? I think I passed this one. This one, I think the secret was... Quick turns here and not go too far. I will continue, my good sir, after I have a smoke. Please, give me a, give me a rest here. I'm not even taking a break. Just I need a smoke. And drink some more coke, because it's fucking brutal here. It is brutal, my good sir. I have... I have four continues, so that's not too bad. I got here before I was hurting pretty bad. So this one, it ain't too bad. I'm gonna bump this shit up. I'm not feeling a fucking thing here. Where's the flavor? There we go! That one hit the spot, Doc. Let's go. Fucking awesome! The hype is real! I'm gonna. Ooh, you gotta be, yeah, just gotta be, gotta be quicker here. Gotta be, don't, don't go into that. This one keeps fucking me up. This, is this banana here for me? Ah, no! Man. And the Vita froze again. Shut up, stop, stop. So this has been happening here today. The Vita's frozen, I'm aware. So I gotta go and delete the source. Can you leave me the fuck alone? For Christ. Fucking Elgato, do your job. Is the Elgato, by the way. It shuts down the piece of shit. Stop now. Video capture, sorry, is a black screen for just a tiny bit. I have to configure the video because it's shit the way the, 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 the Elgato gives it. So there you go. You got something to look at. Am I back? I'm back. But I need to adjust the picture here to my liking. I'm very picky with the way things are. I'm not even gonna bother dragging out here. Okay, give me a second. Let's adjust the video. And I wrote down the, the numbers. Please hold on while we going through those uh, technical difficulties. Brightness, minus 17. Contrast, 148. Get up there. Just watch that one, they give it to me here. I don't like it. 138. Apply. And then it's, I got a message here that says, welcome to the chat room. So that looks like now, so the chat is hot. The sound was fucking up by the way, and it will do again probably very soon. And now, uh, the Elgato's quitting on me. And now the internet is dog shit. Right? So it, it kicked me out of the stream. Wonderful. Okay, so it looks, it looks like it's about time for a commercial break to go. Did I lose all my viewers shoe as well? I wish you could see me here. I'm a mess. Sats and say, consider your stream from my chat. You're doing all right. It is fucking, it is, is hell. I would never, I wouldn't spend two minutes in the chat here if I wasn't doing this. Because I came here before to, like, when it's like this, to get something out of the shed, right? There's a bunch of boxes here. And I open that door and go like, woof, holy fuck, get me out of here. And now here I am simmering. And now the internet is, is giving me the, it's fucking up here. They all get, 
I've been attacked for, from every angle. So according to the internet here, I'm at, let me see, very low is fucked. I'm going to have to go in the house and move the router. I'm at 4.6 megabytes per second, unacceptable. <laughs> Still more or less here working on the side, don't tell my stream. I don't mind. Uh, I'm honored people are watching at all and uh, have me on the background. That's fine. I have sometimes people in the background. It's okay. And <laughs> don't worry about that. I, I totally get it. Uh, and now this is the fun part here. So I obviously need to go. Not the, get, get off me, piece of shit. I need to go into the house. And I need to. Will you? Not the fuck. Trying to get a thing here. I need to uh, touch the router there, but I don't want to leave you here with a pause screen. So I go through a lot of trouble. And yes, an Xbox 360 controller. So this is going to be fun. So I have the Xbox here, 360, which has a thumbstick drive on it because I can't use my usual tiny DVD player to play my commercials here that I like to play when I'm away because they're kind of fun and I like them. Because this here is a VGA monitor, so it's 480p only. It won't accept 30, uh, 15 hertz, kilohertz, sorry. So I need to do with the Xbox, but at the same time, I don't want to fucking change to the Xbox and you see the screen. So I actually wrote down blindly, and this should be fun. I'm curious about that. How to get to the, the video app. So to the actual video, I'm curious to see if this is going to work. Right, right, A, wait. Down, A. Up, forward, 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 down, A. Forward, forward, A. A. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, A. Wait. This is crazy. Down, A. And then A. And then A. And let's see if we have a video here, my good sir. And I'll just I'll just swap the VGA cable from the GameCube. So just give me a second. And basically I'm, I'm trying, I have to go to the house and caress the router, change the position a tiny bit. Otherwise, it will not freaking work. And there you go. It worked. The system worked. And now the sound. I don't know what the fuck is going on, bitch. Fucking bitch ass. Stop goofing off. Just get in there. There we go. You got your commercials. What is real? Or, or, or. Oh, and the video froze again, wouldn't you know? Wonderful. Absolutely fantastic. I'm glad I went through all the trouble. Motherfucker, I'm sick of you. I think I'm gonna go back to using the the cam link. So I'm gonna raise the volume here on the commercials to dirt your low. So I'm gonna go in the house and change the router. Please bear with me. And I need to walk a tiny bit anyways. It's been three hours and 25 minutes of no break. So let me see here, if you don't mind, my good sir. Minus 20. What the fuck are you doing, man? Did I write it down? The value. <sighs> Fuck off! I wrote it here. There we go. Go to six decibels for the ads. And let me know if that's too loud, anyone? Don't hate him because he's beautiful. 
Beautiful Joe, rated teen only for Nintendo GameCube. GameCube. I'll take it that it's not your loud then. Oh, sound is perfect. Thank you. All right, I'll be right back. Get into the game with Beautiful Joe for GameCube. Available now at Target. This game is rated T for Teen. Sorry, if the video freezes while I'm gone, don't freak out, I'll, I'll fix it, okay? I'll be back. player into your Nintendo GameCube and play your favorite Game Boy games. On the big screen, only for Nintendo GameCube.
you play for you. Great team for team. For a limited time, buy the Nintendo GameCube for only $149.95 and receive Metroid Prime for one of three of the great games free. Can I get a price check? Nintendo GameCube. Now $79.99. Woohoo! Time has come to play the sport of witches and wizards. Quidditch! Master your game at Hogwarts. You need skill, speed, and a little magic to win the ultimate prize, the Quidditch World Cup. Take on the world. Harry Potter Quidditch World Cup. Rated E for everyone. EA Games. Nothing comes between a man and his game. Fork and play with Wayburn Wireless Controller, new for Nintendo GameCube. Nothing comes between a man and his game. Play from far away with Wayburn Wireless Controller, new for Nintendo GameCube. Beat him, eat him. Chew up the competition with Kirby as he jets across 20 gut busting race courses in Kirby Air Ride. Only on Nintendo GameCube. Rated E for everyone. GameCube. Thank <laughs> you. 
All right, I'm back here. Uh, so the internet is completely, I'm plugging back in the VGA from the GameCube. Just give me a second. So the internet here is just, uh, is very unstable. So I think is the router picking up the signal. You win, it was down to four, and then I was moving there, went down, all the way down to one, as I keep retesting, one megabyte per second upload speed, so ludicrous. So you need about, I think it's 5.5, uh, for a 720p60, which is what I do here uh, around that area, and uh, I'll turn this down to where it was minus 20. There we go. And the internet went all the way up to a ludicrous 26 megabytes per second, 29 even on the test. Insane, it's very unstable. All because I went there and touched the router and move it move it around a tiny bit. So I'm thinking an external antenna is just going to solve all my problems. And I wonder if there's anybody left here. And the Vita still working? Yeah. So I find I can go ahead and hopefully play a tiny bit. For crying out loud. Nothing but problems here today. The game is awesome though. Having a lot of fun playing this game. All right. Well, the internet's fast now, so I hope it remains that way. All right. Where were we? No, oh my god, it just goes so far, dude. You push your far, monkey, come on. Don't look like you can't stop here too much. No, 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 no. Fuck, Ken, how is fuck? No, that's it, I'm dead. Right? Fuck off! What are you doing? Clipper's back, so am I. I was away. Nah. The internet problems. I just came back as well. Welcome back anyways. No, 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 no. No, 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 try. Oh, whoa, 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 what are you doing? <laughs> Fucking hell. The music is awesome. Harry, I like to stop the music. Oh, my God. Come on, dude. Get your head out of your ass here. Okay, remember the, the short curve, that sharp turn deal you had? Oh, it's hard to judge sometimes, my boy. Damn. No, 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 no. No, 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 Calm down. God damn it, it's inferno. Ah! Get in, get in. Fucking hell. I think I touched this tripod, haven't I? Calm down, calm down. I think I touched the tripod here. Did I? Is that the way it was? And whatever. Have I been here before? No, I oh yeah, I have. No, dude, fuck. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You can do it, don't fuck around. 
Yeah, what are you doing? What is this camera doing? Shut up, you big bozo. I'm getting there. Jesus. Oh yeah, we've been here. We've been in this. We've been here in this mother before. Uh, quick, quick! I can't be, be, don't be around a bush here. Oh yeah, I got distracted last time looking at a fucking stupid ass time. Ended up falling like a bag of shit. This thing is tricky here. We're getting the bananas. We're getting all the bananas here. Shoot, fucking, not all of them, but you know. I'm not gonna ignore him, ignore him like the drunk chick at the party, like Family Guy said. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. the time, the time. Whoa, 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 whoa! What are you doing? Calm down, dude. Fuck! I look at the time. Shut up! Shut up! Mother! Let's see what. Leaper says, okay to refresh my mind, GB. SC control, but for the meantime, we can buy the retro tank. Fucking heat, just go downstairs, make food. As soon as the GBS has better Wi Fi reach or the fucking switch, I'll be fine, but it has a small reach like that, it'll be a problem, I guess. I think if you have problems with the Wi Fi, I wouldn't recommend the Wi Fi model. Just save save up the money and get the, the real one. I'll show you the difference later. No, it's if you have problems with the Wi Fi, it's not going to be good because it's going to be a headache. It's, it's gonna, you're gonna drop and it's not gonna come back. I would, I would not recommend it at all. If you have a, the slightest problem with the Wi-Fi, I would say is definitely avoid it like the plague. Nah! Avoid it like the plague. Let's see here. Oh, that part is pumping, huh? Part two. No, 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 dude. Come on. Come on, come on. You can. We need to. I don't. I'm not. I'm nowhere near close, though, because you gotta. Uh, you gotta. Close. You gotta do 30 stages, right? I'm trying to be quick on this area here. Ah, my God. Ah, he fucking. The fucking sparks coming out of this motherfucker. Yeah, but you see, only the Switch has zero Wi-Fi reach in general. Then the device might also have Wi-Fi, zero Wi-Fi. Then it'll be useless. Whereas if you get a if you get a unit without the Wi-Fi, then you never have to worry about this shit. Hence why I, I asked the guy to send me. Uh, I helped him with it. He was asking him all sorts of opinions on the what connections should have, and since I breathe this shit. You know, retro gaming. I, I told him what I, I knew that people are into. And, uh, oh, come on, man. And then he made the uh, the one without the Wi Fi with the dials. Uh, he put SCART in. Didn't, the, the original one didn't even have SCART, so that he was making in particular. And the device is a lot better. So I'll say if you have any problems. Any problems with any device with the Wi-Fi? I, I would say it's not. It's not ideal. It's, in fact, it's less than ideal. Nah! My fucking volume is too high here. I can hear it shouting in the microphone. And you know, outside is not too hot here. It's just the shed is infernal. I went outside. It was literally a breath of fresh air. It is so fucking hot here. My wife tells me that the forecast says, No, you fuck. Come on, man. What are you doing? Then there's no time to waste. My wife tells me that in two days you'll be cool here again. Had a little bit of a fuck off, you fuck. What are you doing? I know you can do shortcuts, but I'm not. I don't have the experience that Joe from GameSack does. No, don't do the spark shit. What the fuck? Why would I need that? Think about it, monkey. This is... No, I can't. I can't... No, man! Fucking leave me alone! Jesus.
Mr. Davis said it could have we have a Wi-Fi repeater. If you want a device, I'll send you the device. You know, we organize that. If it doesn't work, then just uh, do me the courtesy of sending back then. I'll send you the device, that's no problem. If you want to try it, why not? It might work, you know. I have to, uh, I wrote it down somewhere probably how to use it, I forgot. I didn't like it, I, I don't like Wi-Fi things. Unless it's like, you know, like the Mem Card Pro, you can't, oh, well, no, 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 you can't, fuck. You can You can use uh don't do the fuck off. Just fucking slow the fuck down. Uh, okay, I'm feeling this run here. No, I'm taking my time. I'm not looking at the time, I'm just shut up. I know the people can do this here run and I can't. Sorry, I'm new at the game. I'm gonna take my time here. Shut the fuck up, man! We have time, we have time. There we go. Hey-o! Motherfucker hurrying me up here. And the fucking sound is still high. What, what's going on? It's creeping here. It's real loud. I can hear myself think here. You're crazy. Yeah, we got better. Jesus fucking raping my ear hole here. What are those things? The goals are moving? There's multiple goals here moving. Oops. That was a weird one. That was a hell of a weird one. Oh, those. I think I have to go full force, yeah? <laughs> Maybe a little less force would be, you know, wise. Says this mere observer. How much force? How, how much we're talking here? Not enough. Too much. The finesse. Okay, there we go. Now we're now. We're, what? All oh, the things are moving. Okay. So you you make a sort of a ramp. How many continues I have? I would prefer unlimited continues to be honest. Ah, oh, it's over. Yeah, I'll be lucky if I complete the regular part here. Oh my God, I'm getting dizzy looking at this. Come on. Where's the timer? Why do we need a fucking timer for this shit? Let me put my name in here. Alright, so that's back to the beginning. That's uh, kind of brutal. I know the uh, some of the older ones, from according to Joe from GameSec, they do have unlimited containers. This one is a, it's a bit brutal in that regard. I mean, the, uh, the beginner place, beginner mode, it's not that bad, but uh, once you get you the... You know, with a pro league here, things get a little bit more complex. They get a bit more complicated. So, but I'll try my best here in this fucking hellhole of a shed. So, because this year was, I mean, it's kind of hard at first when I first started a game if you never played it. But this is triple the the trouble here, and that the levels are hard. This year is oh, <laughs> I'm sweating here, my goodness. Okay. We'll do it again, it's fine. The GPSC hard to set up? No, as long as you have the right cables and you know what you're doing is not, I'll give you the instructions. You you just have to repeat what I'm telling you to do. That's all. You do as you're told, Mr. Lifford, and you'll be fine. Okay, let's go, 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 let's I'm not gonna send you the unit so you get it and you have all the cables missing. So I'll probably I'll probably send you the cables that you need. Yeah, you're gonna need I'm gonna see if it's gonna work for you anyways, because I, I haven't touched that thing in forever. So just to make sure 100 percent it'll work in your application. And it should. 
Oh, come on. Look at this motherfucker. Yeah, because uh, there's some kinks with the first one. The first design that this guy made. Because it's, it's open source, so people do different designs, right? The first one it, he had, it, it, it was, I think, it was only VGA, but he could use RGB. I can't fucking remember. If he has component. I'll take a look at the unit. In fact, I tell you what, next time I go for a break, if I can find it, I would just, uh, no sense in doing, fuck off, what the fuck, no sense in doing this now, so I'm going to be dying here. Uh, okay, this is X again, uh, thank you, thanks but no thanks. I mean, if I'm losing all this on, I was, what is this, the first fucking stage, what's the point of going all, all the way to the hard ones on this, it's limited continues here, this is NES rules. God damn, am I sweating. Fucking hell. You see here, Jerome says, if you need to send stuff to Leaper, check. Check in the boxes I gave you. You should have some Xbox PSU. Maybe you have one that could save his. I think... I think it's powered the first edition that Feller made. Uh, has I think it's I can't remember if it's powered by five volt USB, so you won't need a PSU with it. Um, and Mr. Leifer says, oh, so it doesn't have HDMI output? No, it doesn't. That's the Achilles heel with it. Uh, it's pretty much you have to have a, a and that's the one of the parts I don't like. It's doable, but you have to convert VGI to HDMI. Now, there's devices that do that very well, and there's devices that do that very badly. The guy, he was he was really into the cheap adapter stuff, and I had an array of problems here, and, and the problem was not his device, but the goddamn cheap adapters. So I, with the advice I gave to him to find one in the middle, and we did, uh, like I should do, the opposite, for example, HDMI to VGA, I use the HD Fury, it's good quality device. It's kind of bullshit with the power requirements, a fucking center negative barrel 2.5 2 millimeter PSU come off it. Just put a, for, for five fucking volts, just put a fucking USB there like everybody else. You just don't get me started on that shit. Uh, Mr. Leifer says, so do I need a device? No, you need an adapter. You need a pass-through adapter that does, they're very cheap and a lot of times they work. I have a gazillion of them here. They do um, VGA to HDMI. So that's all. And uh, it's, it's, not, it's not that hard. It's not that, it's not, it's not that much of a deal breaker, you know. I mean, it could be for you, then I won't send you the device if you don't want it, of course. But uh, yeah, you do have to go through the VGA out to uh, HDMI step. So I'm gonna look all that up later then. Yep, yeah, that's fine. Ah, fuck off. Look at this shit. It's like a fucking digital fart here every now and then. What the hell is this shit? The problem's here today, man. Like, the, I, I think I pick a chill game. Is this side here? What are you doing? Is this to do with this? It is, you fucking piece of shit. I, I knew it. This fucking box here. Why do I need this box? It's in between the headphones. Cause all sorts of problems here. It's constantly. Once I gotta open this shit. There's something wrong with it. This is causing the trouble. I just. You fuck. I knew. Well, at least I found the problem. It's this fucking box. So the reason it was working is because the box was moving, and I was thinking I was moving the cables. Sack of trash, you. Okay, go on and put the things back here then. Where are they? Before I lose them. I was thinking it was all sorts of problems here with this stuff here, man. It's not. It's a fucking little box. You're gonna lose sound momentarily. Sound of one ear. Come on, fuck. There we go. And now gonna lose the other ear just for a second. And the other year again quickly. Found the culprit. It was the fucking box. So you can't leave the Xbox here. If I need to cut the commercials again, they can be.
Just wait. What the? I gotta go in the fucking house again. You cocksucking motherfucking piece of shit! Leave me alone! All right, this is the sound back. For fuck, what's happening here? Maybe it's not even, you know, I walked outside, it's not even that hot. Who's the demon here? Maybe there's a fucking satanic demon here in a corner so somewhere, heating up the, the room with his own farts and fucking up my devices here today. Okay, am I on? <laughs> here, this time it's not inside my head, but the sound is fine, yeah, we, we, we cool. We happy, Vincent? Holy oh, dog shit, man. Should they hear? What the fuck is happening? It's Zay because it's, you see to finally get sent and chill. I love that ending to that game. I have it on tape. I will pleasure myself to it every now and then. Abe shit crazy. Fucking Abe. Motherfucking Abe. They say white men can jump. I say Mudokans can jump. That's my take on it. <laughs> yeah, let me know. Let me know if there's any more problems. There will be. The way things are going today. I've been attacked left and right here. I'm under attack. Don't you tell me not to worry about Bin Laden. All right, let's go. Just trying to play a game here, my good sir, and, uh, you know. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And now this fucking thing keeps kicking me out. Don't touch, don't you fucking touch, don't touch me. D don't touch me! I don't need vibrations, dude. I know I know I fail. I don't can I turn the shit off? I'm not a big vibration fan. Come on. Come on. We can... If I keep I don't know what that was. That that made zero fucking sense. You just You just Just doing shit for the hell of it now. Yeah, no, I can tell this game is gonna amp up the difficulty here quite dramatically. I think it's the limited containers that get me here. I mean, I can see maybe the game will be a lot shorter without it. Don't fucking touch me. Don't touch me. Don't fucking touch me. Don't ever, don't you ever touch me again. Just here to get my nanners and get the fuck out of here. Leave me alone. Throw me a bone. Come on, come on. That's it. All right. I hate vibration. I always turn them off. Playing without vibration is weird to me. I can do without a fucking vibration. I don't care for it. Dumb modern shit. Any asses I have any fucking vibration. Don't need them. And the games are good. Mr. Leaf, I don't understand you said earlier, and I'm not picking on you, but you said you don't care about the NES, so why are you looking at Castlevanias then, like the NES ones? Or you're not interested in them? Just just out of curiosity. Is that it? Uh, is that it? That Why so much time here? You mean, I think what you, what you try to say is you don't need to capture it, is that what you mean? I'm just trying to see what it, what it is. Yeah, no, I got you. So, no, I thought it was that. So here I was rushing before like an idiot, and you don't need to. You can, you can actually just... So I, I was doing this here. Oh, I was doing this here in one go. And dying a lot because it's nearly impossible, but I was doing it. But it's not what the game wants. Oh! Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's not what the game wants, you know? Yeah, because I did think it was weird, I mean, when I thought of it, because, oh, whoa, whoa, because he wanted to, 
You said, sadly, I don't have an NES, so that implies you like the NES. So, that's what I, th I thought it was about the, the capture. I just, I just want to make sure. That's all. Yeah. No, you'll be happy with NES. I really love the NES. Oh, yeah, some people don't like it. It's like uh, some younger people, they don't get it. I have a friend of mine that came here, and, and he said he don't get the NES. So I was like, well, well that's fine, you know. Would you expect me to get angry with you? Kick you out of my house? Listen, uh, Mike, I don't like, I don't like, I don't like the NES. Oh, yeah? Get out. Get out of my fucking house. Pack your, get, never come back here again. You lucky I don't kill you where you stand right now. No, I'm not gonna fucking. Yeah. You know? Don't like. I don't like the NES. Well, I did. I didn't make the damn thing. And what do you want from me? I like it, but you know, people like different stuff. Yeah. I will try to get this banana, but I think it's foolishness. No, they give you plenty of time. There you go. Ah, no, 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 oh, you son of a bitch, you cheap motherfucker. Come on, no, 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 I, I'm fucked. Ah! Xbox is better in a way because that's American. Bingo. Now you're getting, now you're getting the, you're getting the whole picture there, Mr. Liffer. It is, it is kind of weird if you think about it. In Japan, they don't, they don't like the Xbox. They never did. They like their, I mean, talk about America, me being patriotic and all that, but I buy their stuff. Here I am playing a Japanese console. They don't want to play our consoles. They don't, they really don't. They don't like our shit. Mortal Kombat, none of that crap. It's, it's here scrap for them, apparently. A few things. They like, but uh, it's funny. We like their stuff, you know. Like they—they they don't drive our cars, you know. They're into their shit. They're into their own, own stuff. Which nothing wrong with that, you know. I admire it. You gotta look after your own. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Big money, big money. Yeah, yeah. They're patriotic, so I don't see what uh, nothing wrong with me. I'm paid. I love America, you know. Because you say, oh, yesterday you did say, I know you're joking around, but you said, like, if I don't like power, I move it. But <laughs> you're, you're, you're okay to live in a place and I like a couple of things. I don't like everything about America. You, know? you got to be able to criticize your yourself you know, and your own, the things that you like. I've always been that way. But I, I just don't like rabid anti-Americanism because that's nonsense. Like, why the fuck are you here watching me if you hate me, you know? I'm not going to put up with it. I think it's stupid. I think I'm blindly hating something too, stupid. Like you judge a whole nation of people because of some fucking politics or something. I see this. Spend most of my time on Xbox. I can't stand the PS2 controllers. <laughs> Me and Jerome had back and forth on that. And now I said if I'm patriotic in my country, I'll be a nice, but it's nonsense. You should be able to love you. I hate that. You know, uh, I, uh, a little political again, I don't like to get on that, but there's a, a, that famous scene with An Angela Merkel, or Angela Merkel, whatever the fuck is the, her name. I don't like her. And she, there's a guy waving a German flag, and she goes in, <laughs> in and pulls the flag away from me. Fuck you, bitch. Let the guy fucking wave his fucking flag. If you hate your fucking country, fuck you. Hate your fucking country if you must, but don't go bother other people that that are not into fucking little nonsense, you know? I lived in Germany. That's, I met patriots in there. You don't have to be a nut. You don't have to be negative. A lot of people, they are like patriot. And like, for example, I met Canadians. and, and Like, some Canadians, let's face it, a lot of Canadians are anti-American. I mean, if you go look at the opinion of on America, Canada is right after China. I was surprised when I heard that, but then I remember some Canadians I met, and then I, I was like, not surprised. And I like Canada, sad, you know, but uh, it seems like some people make an identity of the, their patriotism on how much they hate their neighbors. Like China is the same way. Like the, the stronger you hate the Japanese, the more patriotic you are. And it's like I love America, but there's other things. I like Britain. I like a lot of things. I'm here, and I. 
Uh, there's a lot of good things in here, a lot of good people here. There's a lot of pe good people when I was in Germany. There's a lot of good people, people uh, everywhere, you know. And then some people, they lose track. Like, there was a guy one time when I was in Germany. It was a guy from Bavaria. He was anti-American. I read it straight up to the George Bush. George Bush, the time was George Bush. And I was like, dude, you know, you're here, Taylor, because they're saying America's the, the police, world police. And, well, who, who you want to be the world police, you know? Who would you rather pick then, I guess? You? I don't know. And, and then talking about world wars, I mean... <laughs> In Germany, do you remember who was uh, on the other side back then? <laughs> you know, and the whole thing about being superior. I don't think America is superior. I prefer America. I think, in my opinion, it is, but that is not a fact, is my opinion. You know, uh, it's it's okay to uh, CRT Rajan says Canada's free. Like, oh, we is it there? We have Canadian viewers. You know, and we care. We do. We do have. We do have a Canadian leader. So, uh, uh, listen, I met, you can't, it's hard. You can't judge everyone. I met Canadians or assholes, but let me tell a story one time. I will start, let me tell a story time. Let me have a fucking, let me have a fucking sanity break here. Yeah, and y'all talk about it, talk. Listen, I was one time working the bar in Scotland. It was a travel lodge. So it's like a, I don't know, like a, like a, think a Motel 8 or something. I don't know, I was working there. And then serving, I served drinks. And this guy came in and said, and it says, a lady heard me saying a word or she says, uh, are you, she, she, she just heard me quickly. She said, oh, are you, oh, you're not from here, are you Irish? And then I started talking, oh, you're American. And the guy said, better be Irish. Okay, well, that's your opinion. And then I went on and they said, came more people and they came like talking a bunch of shit about America in front of me and going on and on about it. And there was some Canadian oil workers that work in the oil industry because that was in Aberdeen. And uh, they were listening to all this shit. You know, I did take a lot in. I'm serving. You know, I was <laughs> not being a pussy. You know, I would tell them how it was, you know, when they're talking nonsense. Uh, but, you know, I couldn't do much because I'm working. You know, I can't be, I don't want to, I can't be engaged in fucking political arguments when I'm working. And then, uh, so in essence, they, they try their best there to keep humiliating me at every step of the way. The Canadians are drinking, having a good time, and it came time for them to leave. They gave me a $100 a pound tip. 100 pounds. 100 pounds is the biggest tip I ever had in my life. I never had somebody, just give me, 100 pounds. They're Canadian, you know. There's good people everywhere, let me tell you, you know. Got to be careful, but you meet, like, if somebody comes in here and they hate Americans, no, you know, like, banter is one thing, but you, like, you hate me, and you, you're gonna, you know, I'm not gonna fucking, I don't want to be around you, I don't want to be around anyone that hates anyone, personally, you, you can do whatever you want, just don't, don't I don't want to be around you, that's all, you know. Uh, but yeah, and then I met some Canadians that were kind of assholes. You, you, you understand the, the, the Bible, and I, I went there, and it was like, it's the South, what do you want? You know, it's our culture. I don't know what, what the problem is. I don't go to fucking Canada and bitch about everything there, you know? Uh, oh, but you're, you know, you're in Britain bitching about the PAL. I will. I don't think mo most, the average British person doesn't care about PAL, because guess what? It's outdated. It's, nobody cares about that shit. The only people playing in CRTs here like I do. So, but I think it's sad in Germany, that bullshit, the, the white guilt shit from World War, World War II happened, and it was sad, and, the, you know, the genocide, the Holocaust, and all that, but the people of today have nothing to do with it. They should be able to be proud of their country if, if they choose to do so. If you don't, that's fine. I don't, don't impose your views on anyone. That's what I'm trying to say. Stop imposing your fucking views on other people. Shut the fuck up with your fucking views on other people. Think what you want to think, but respect other folks. We're not a bunch of fucking automaton drones ro running around, you know? If I meet somebody who says they hate America, it's your fucking problem. I, I, I'm not going to fucking stop you. Just stop fucking annoying me with it. You know? That's what I'm saying. And you have a lot of that. Every time there's a fucking president, usually when it happens to be a conservative and things don't go as well for them here, the relationship, you, you hear, you got to hear a lot of shit. And it, it, gets, it gets annoying sometimes, you know? So that's my little rant of, of today. 
but I, I believe that uh, you know there's good people everywhere and there's there's bad people everywhere. I mean, what are you gonna do? You know? He says, I think if someone comes in here and hates anyone that is from another country here because he is from that country, my head is going to explode if we're reading that, to be honest. Just just don't hate people for no reason. That's simple as that. And if you if you hate, you're allowed to hate people. You, I, I think you're allowed to be, listen, I got to say something controversial here. Some people are prejudiced and that's just the way it is. If they're not harassing you, they keep their opinion to themselves. Don't be also shoving down their throats. They gotta love everyone. That, that, that stuff doesn't exist. The love in everyone. That, that every country has problems. If you go to India, the Hindus will hate the Muslims. The Muslims. There's problems everywhere. If you take race out, then you have religion. You have Ireland, the troubles, uh, which goes deeper. So there's always problem around. It's not. There's never gonna be this. Everyone loves everyone. Utopia. That's not what I'm saying. I just think you should. Uh, you should. You should just respect other people. That's simple. Let's say you're prejudiced against a certain race. And that's just, just the way it is. It is. Okay, you're prejudiced, right? Shut up about it. Don't harass anyone. Be respectful. Treat them nicely. And keep your opinion to yourself then. I don't I don't know. It's just, I think just respecting people, that's all. But this whole, we, we all love each other. We all know that's a bunch of horror shit. That, that's, that doesn't exist. We don't all love each other. We hate each other. We, we hate ourselves. Humans are fucking miserable. I mean, it's, they can be good, but, uh, you know, there's never going to be peace. You talk that dog is a pipe dream. It'll never happen. And, and, and Angela Merkel taking a flag from a guy is not going to save any lives. It's not going to do any good for humanity. She was just being a cunt. It's just the way it is. Let the guy fly his fucking German flag alone, you bitch. Yeah. And the same, same goes for everything. It's like everything is like that. You, 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 you don't like this game? What do you mean? What, what you, how can you not like this game? Is it, this is the greatest game ever made. How can you, how can you say something like that? Well, don't vote you on, on, on Reddit, you son of a bitch. It's like, <laughs> shut the fuck up, man. Shut, just shut the, just shut the fuck up, you know? Ah, la, 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 la. I'm a very calm person. I don't know. I, I, I'm a very calm person. That's a, that's a fucking lie. Well, I, yeah, I don't think I'm going to make it. You know, when it comes to the, deep, uh, the deeper issues, and you see me losing my head here with some games and stuff, when it comes to the deeper issues, I'm pretty chill. Pretty forgiven, you know? So I hit that fucking kind of random one tried to break our house and threw a fucking stone against the glass door. The fucking police didn't do shit. Even though I'm still here, very calm person. Yeah, I, I am. Is is weird. For example, here's the thing. My wife said that once. So I'm here. I'm okay. I'm angry with things, right? Yet I can get a solder and iron in a magnifying glass and just get lost in mod and try, try, well, attempt and try my best to mod a console with great calm. It's bizarre. My wife was surprised to see how much I have patience for some tasks, but some tasks I just. I, simple stuff that turns into nonsense. It is, you know. So I guess I'm not a calm. I'm not 100% calm, but there's some tasks that I do that I'm calm. It's, it's a bizarre. No, I'm not calm when I'm playing. No, definitely not. I'm pretty fucking far from that. I think that. I think that. I mean, what would be the point of me saying otherwise here? You, you're watching me live. But you know, it depends here. I'm not. You know, I'm not losing my mind yet. You know, I, I always say that, but then I, I do. I do, I, 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 it's more of an anger thing, as much as patience. I mean, I, cause I, I, guess, I guess it can get mixed up, having patience and being, so think about it, think about this. I think what I'm trying to say is patience then, not calm. Yeah, maybe that's that's what I'm, I'm making a mistake. Let's see, I'm yelling a lot about Outer World. Yeah, and losing my mind here, but, I did stream four four streams of it, and I did beat the game poorly, but I did. See, that's what I'm talking about. So I I don't have the temper, but I do have the patience, you know? 
the perseverance to, to, to do it. I'll do it. I'll, I'll bitch and moan. I'm the kind of guy who'll bitch and moan about things, but then, but doing. Do them when I can. You know, I'll do my best to, to get them done. I'm not saying I'm, I'm a fucking hero here. I'm saying that just trying to analyze, do some self analyzing here today. You know? I just realized that self and. <laughs> Self anal. <laughs> Even. Come on, get up there. Mm. <laughs> Everyone testing a microphone. What? <laughs> I just, I just read that. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I guess the best of me it does. It's fun to think sometimes. Sometimes even I, I get it. Sometimes uh, I go. You know, edit the audio on my video and I go, you know, testing the audio. So see if they are, what, what's happening? I'm, I'm getting dizzier now. Yeah. Okay. So testing the audio and I go like clicking random parts. And then sometimes it's funny. I go clicking parts like that, 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 that. <laughs> It's like, holy shit. Calm the fuck down, dude. <laughs> But you know, if I come here and try to be like fucking Arcus, I, I can't do it. I'm not. I'm not that calm. That type of calm person. Oh no. Okay, do it again. Do it again. Yep. Okay. There's one of. There's one of your videos starting like that. You literally test the auto say fuck. <laughs> I I lose my temper so much that I I forget. And the thing, you know, you know, there was no stop. Do what the? F I don't know what's going. I'm gonna die. Okay. Nah. Yeah, it is crazy. <laughs> but look, today I'm I'm okay, and I think the heat is getting to me here. I'm on an on an easy mood for for now. So like you know, there'll be some games I guess that I could be calm. Was there? I'm sure. Oh come on. I'm sure there was that. <laughs> you didn't lose your temper just testing the audio. <laughs> I I think probably I was testing the screaming maybe, or was I screaming? No. Okay, this, oh, this level, sh mm. dude, fucking hell! This CRT writer says this. this game is fun. This one is fun. It's fun. I know it's it's hard at points here. I think that the limit can. Damn it! It's so. What are you? What are you freaking out, dude? Come on, come on. It's so weird, this one. This one, he goes sometimes. What are you doing? Yeah, maybe I was testing to see how loud it was and I couldn't think of a better word and it's yelling fuck, because that's what I usually do when I, whenever I open my mouth, at least 50% of the time. I wonder, there was a person one time that came on, on oh. what are you? Of all my videos that came in, I'll never forget that comment because came in my Castlevania video on this YouTube that was censored. I I went through the trouble. Ah! I went through the trouble of trouble of uh, censoring the video, all cussing, because at the time YouTube had rolled out that bullshit policy that they had that cussing was like in the first seconds or cussing at all, demonetizing everyone, oh deleting your video and shit. They went nuts, and they it was one of the rare instances that YouTube backtracked and retracted their policy and eased up on it right so right, right around that time when i was sort of rebranding the channel putting a little bit more effort and trying to capture card stuff and all that and right around that time it was it was news everywhere so i decided to not lose my channel to censor that video that all the cussing and that was quite a, a task that was at the end of it all i was on the dope premiere I don't think I even had a dope premiere. No, I had a dope premiere. I was uh, hating myself because I cussed so much. I had to beep everything, bleep or beep, whatever you call it. 
and all that beep. And, uh, and I did all that. And Mr. Lip is back, welcome back. And I did all that and then a lot of work. And after I was done with it, uploaded a video, most, most folks liked it. But yet there was a person that went there and says, do you eat with that mouth? That really upset me when I read that. A tiny bit, to be honest. I wanted to reply, I ate your mama's asshole, you piece of shit. But that doesn't help the case, and the comment will probably be deleted. There should be a time, believe it or not, you could cuss on YouTube, and now you can't even do that. Uh, but I, I put, I've said the same thing, but a little bit classier. I said, yes, sometimes even food. And yeah, and then, and then later on, I got so annoyed with it that with that comment existing there. And, I, and take, trust me, I've been on YouTube for a long time, not with this account, with a different account. Uh, used to it. It doesn't get me in that regard, but but I found it annoying as fuck, you know. It, it's just that particular one because of all the work I put in. So that after that, I, I never, I never retracted. I never uh, censored any video, and I, I cuss freely. If you don't like it, I'm not for you. That simple as that, you know. But it's funny. Go to a trouble somebody that that. Uh, Cussing that a censor would bother someone. Go back to Nickelodeon. Get the fuck off my videos. Just get the fuck out of here. I will fucking cuss. Oh, one, one, one time I say the set. It shows you have low education. And I was like, who the fuck told you I have high education? I am lowly educated and poor. Not pretending. <laughs> In what? In what planet was it said that I'm not those things? Be careful here. I am those things, and don't I deserve a spot in the sun as well? Fuck! Look at this guy. And see, your Regent says the person like that is not happy with their life and that they're moving on, on video. Yeah, there's some people that are just negative no matter what. I always had like religiously two cunts that come into my video and dislike them immediately. Like, wow, okay. There's more people that like it, so who cares? I don't like the whole like and dislike, and it's stupid. Oh, it, it, not, not, okay, it's not. So, this here just. I'm gonna give up on you. Yeah, a lot of people get angry with it. I guess they just don't hear it live, maybe. Some people are very calm though. They actually unnerve me. Like I go back to Arcus because it does this fucking impossible shit and that man is just humming alone. What are you doing, man? What are you doing? No, I said I was gonna give up. Stop, bitch, fucking stop. Look at this, there's no, what are you doing? Fuck. This stage is ass. How many continues? Continues. Three. Some persons maybe get too frustrated too quickly. I think so for myself. Some people eat poop, Mr. Leifer. There's, there's uh, all sorts of people out there. Some people literally eat feces. So. How can you even top top that fucking analogy? <laughs> even though I'm not shot like mine, but I can even do that here. Yeah, some people are not shouters. Like I said, that Arcus guy, he just... He plays, like, horrific challenges, right? And the man, i never seen him break a sweat or cuss or shout or anything. I'm not saying it's right or wrong, it's better or anything, but I find it... It's different because I'm a I'm very different. Per we have different, very different personalities. That's what I'm trying to say, and I find it is interesting to see other people. Or then, then there's other people. Mike Mate is similar to me. Not that I watch his his shouts. <laughs> so it's a lost cause. Is that what you're saying? Why are you freaking out? Can you go up? He did that again. Yeah, people that never get mad at a game is crazy. I do, f <laughs> I, I do feel yeah a bit 
somebody never loses their temper. I don't know. I or never cusses or anything. I feel mm, I don't know. I'm not used to it, to be quite frank with you. Didn't grow up around that sort of environment. It was just cussing and hollering and being low life, redneck trash. There we go. I'm, I'm used to the. I'm in the sphere, as Seth Rogen would say. And I'm fine. I've been happy my whole life. There's no problem there. That's the way it is. But, uh, you know, and then sometimes I get in a uh, calm streak here like I am now. I'm not, you know, I'm not, sh oh, I'm not shouting for now. I get. I don't think I am, at least in my own head compared to the usual stuff. And then he goes on and do stuff like, like what are you doing? There we go. I'm gonna raise the volume a tiny bit more here. I I want to, I have two ears, so I would like to have sound in two ears. Is that unreasonable? I don't think so. Thank you. Go. This here. What the? Where are you going, sir? Where are you going? Stage is this way. <laughs> Jesus, man, take it, take down a notch. Drama. I think this one you have to be very quick. I think I'm already fucked here. <coughs> Sorry. You gotta be quick on this. <laughs> Fuck off. Damn it. Don't do the turbo shit, I'll kill you. He went nuts one time here, just caught on fire or something. Don't look at the time, just do your thing. Don't look at the fucking timer. Just do your fucking thing. No, there's no timer, only zoo. Just keep doing what you're doing. Shut the fuck up. And then this guy. No time for that banana. Thank you. I like your lit. So what is a? There's more than one. Oh, so you mean it can keep going? Is that it? So you ignore a go here and get the other one. Is that what's going on? I hope I don't lose a container for this shit. You get more points or something? Because when you go through the first one, is it's over, so it moves on. So I think. I think I'm an idiot. That's what I think. We got the real thing here, Mr. Leaper. It's a bit overripe for me. Uh, it's my favorite fruit of all time. I'm a bit of a monkey myself. The way I behave here, like a gorilla with a with a hardware. Okay, I think. No, I want to. I want to try the other one. At least the second one. I won't. I won't settle for second base. Well, I'll settle for second base. No, I think I'm fucking around here. Should. Okay, I know I. I know I fell here, so we we slow it down a tiny bit. Kimosabi, there we go. There's no way I'm gonna catch that other one. This one is as good as it gets. There you go. It's kind of kind of mid, as they say these days. Mr. Leifer, so the banana is your favorite berry? Yeah, you're not impressing me. I already know it's a berry. I read a lot of, I read a lot of you, would, you wouldn't think so, but I do. I read a lot about vegetables for some fucking reason. Vegetables, fruits, where they come from. Take so off, you know banana then, uh, where and from what region did the banana came from in the world? <clears throat> Without looking it up. Where's it native, fuck off. Where's it native from? And they still have seeds, by the way. What part of the world did the banana originate from? Exactly, I'll read it here, but then I know nothing. Eh? Come on. Yeah, it is a barrier. You're right. Uh, no, Chase. Well, at least Chase tried Mexico. Yeah, guess, Mr. Liffer. Say, uh, give me a region. It can be like, a, it's a sub-region from a continent. 
I mean, and then you look up uh, to see how wrong I am. But uh, from the top of my head here. The Mexico, a lot of stuff came from Mexico. A lot of stuff. You got your corn, you got your, what is it, tomatoes? Oh, avocado, of course. Nope, Southeast Asia. They have a gigantic variety of bananas there. Did you know that the bananas we get out? Oh, whoa, whoa. The bananas you get, we get now are not the same bananas we should get. Here's something curious about bananas. Fuck off! There's something curious about bananas. Um, I got it right here. When you get artificially flavored banana, you know, banana flavors, and you notice how a lot stronger it is than the actual bananas. So the bananas we get, uh, we get in the West. Yeah, they're all in, in, in imports. So they're the Cavendish bananas. And the uh, the bananas that we used to have, have, and I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it correctly, but Michelle Gross, right? And uh, there was a there was a plague that wiped them off and and pretty much destroyed them. They still exist in parts of the world, but it never recovered as an import, and it was replaced with the banana we know now, the dessert banana, that one I'm holding right there, the white Cavendish, right? And uh, it's not the same. It's a lot weaker. It's not. It's, it's less than ideal. So the old bananas from, I think it was up to the 60s, they actually tasted like the artificial flavors that, that you we, we enjoy in, you know, like you chew a banana bubble gum or something. And a tomato is great. Tomato, well, tomato is officially a vegetable in America and they did it for tax purposes. And it makes sense. We do use it as a vegetable. Because it's kind of like, a, actually, it is. Because it is never used as a fruit. Uh, I mean, it, even though it is. Uh, so I think I think I agree with the with the idea of the, the vegetable. Sometimes they do nonsense like that, yeah? like uh, vape. Oh come on, man! What are you doing? Like vape is what the fuck are you up to? Uh, oh my god! And then do that. It's like vape is very regulated like tobacco because of it, but it doesn't have tobacco in it, you know. But it is so this uh, as far as taxes go and the regulation of it, because it's so similar, you know, it's used the same way. I mean, you could make a case that the nicotine comes from the, the tobacco plant, but it's a bit of a stretch, you know. Ah, might make it. Can you move the top hats here? How am I doing on time? Can I? There we go. Tomato's awesome. I couldn't live without tomato. I eat tomato all the time. My wife also loves it. Tomato and garlic. Those are the... Oh, man, this looks fucked. And there's ripples here. Yeah, tomato. I love garlic, too, but it makes me sick. Raw garlic makes me very sick. I still eat it, though. Oh, you want me to... I don't know what's down there. I don't... Just death? Okay, let me, maybe I should pay attention when the, yeah, garlic makes everything better. There you go, mister. Oh, it's on that side. What the hell was I doing here? So this is a, uh, uh, risque. I think I need some, no, no, clever, clever. Okay, we got, fuck off. Shut the fuck up. There we go. I love garlic. Garlic is awesome. And I love uh, spice, hot sauce, Tabasco, uh, Carolina Reaper, that kind of stuff. I love Carolina Reaper. I think it's actually a taste. It's not just eat like a lunatic and then, you know, if I'd nibble on it. I haven't done it in a long time, but I usually buy the dry ones. In the south, it's from the south, southern. Obviously, it's from Carolina. Uh, some guy once was arguing with me about the, he was anti-American. He hated America with a passion. And he's arguing with me about the, oh my God. Mm. He was South African. Hated guns, so made my case to tell me that every time he saw me. So, he, uh, whoa, whoa, there's a bunch in here. Don't fuck around. No, I'm not gonna go down. 
He was arguing with me about the, uh, what's it called, the ghost pepper being the hottest pepper in the world, but by then it has been passed by the Carolina Reaper, which is again is gonna be passed by Pepper X. Oh, 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 I see it, I see it, I see it. Yeah, and this guy uh, wouldn't accept that the, uh, there was a pepper that was American, because the pepper was American. So, <laughs> but it is, Carolina Reaper. I don't know, did they release Pepper X? I wonder. At some point it gets kind of ludicrous there with it. I think Carolina Reaper is the, it's got a good balance there on the flavor and uh, spice. It's very spicy though. It is, uh, that it is. Fuck you up, you know. Oh, fuck, what the? F I'm hotter. Eh. You, you ain't that hot, Mr. Liver. You ain't, you ain't that hot. That's zero continues, but I made further. So that's funny. When I went to the second go, it sent me to a different place that I happen to like more. So I think I'm gonna stick with this here. Way. Nah, you fuck. You, you f f fuck you then. Time sticking here. Okay, what is this shit? I didn't even have. I didn't even have time to turn around. Look at this. If I could have seen what the hell was happening, can you move? What is this? Move, asshole! What are you doing? What is this? Ah, fuck off. Okay, I'm disturbed. I, I'm, I got distracted by a disturbing comment, Mr. Lefer. Okay, let me see if I can... I don't think men should be cute anyways. Should... <laughs> You're cute. Nope. I'm gonna have to go ahead and uh, give you a big negatory on that one. Definitely not that. Ah! Yeah, if I was a lady, I wouldn't like cute men. But a, man, a man that looked like a man. That's just my taste, my good sir. Ah, uh, wonderful. Stop in the middle. Get up there. What are you... I don't have time for this shit. Get up there. What are you doing? That's the goal right there. And you're fucking around. Nah. Nah, you ain't jump too high. All my exes said cute is better. Well, I'm not cute. And all my exes said that they're better. Well, no shit. If, you, if you're if cute and they get girlfriends, then obviously... Uh, they, but, but you're not cute, though. I saw you. I mean, I don't think you're cute. My, my opinion, not putting you, not putting you down, but again, if I say that I'm cute, that you're cute, it'd be kind of awkward, wouldn't it? So I guess, I guess this whole conversation has no meaning. I don't. Why, why are we talking about your appearance here? Okay. Yeah, my wife got you there. So that's why they relax. <laughs> they laughed you for a real man. <laughs> that's, oh man, easy. And a game over. You've outgrown your cuteness, Mr. Liver. You've become a man forging iron and sweat. It was after you drank your first beer. So, uh, yeah, kind of fucked here. Kind of fucked. <laughs> kind of fucked here, man. First ex of best friend nowadays, and still never had a new one. I could never be friends with a, with a lady. It'd be tough, the dynamic. Um, but again, I don't. I'm not friends with anyone. So, but uh, but I think that just because you broke up, you don't have to be mortal enemies. I don't have a lot of bad things to say about my exes. One of them shot me. That wasn't good. But uh, even I learned it. Just, you know, maybe she was, she was, she had mental problems, so, you know, I don't, I don't think I hate any of my exes. I, I've been fucked over many times, but, uh, 
beware the person that goes like all my axes are shit because they're not then you're shit you know if beware the person that is it goes like everyone is an asshole but me uh i know i think then if that's the case then that, that, that means most likely you're the asshole so we really well we never argue or something like that well that's the thing though uh, mr lieber couples argue you know people argue and that don't, don't make him not get along there are a lot of people that don't argue and then their relationship goes to shit anyways what is the point let's say i'm not saying it happened to you obviously let's say you have a girlfriend she never argue with and i come home she's sucking some guy's dick how how is not arguing to help you there so it, it's good i prefer not to argue make no mistake of that arguing is annoying and it's tiring and i hate it i can't stand it i don't have the fucking energy but just because you don't argue I means sometimes people a lot of relationships people go go they grow distant and and that happens if you're not arguing i'm not saying arguing you should argue but at least talk about your problems which sometimes leads to arguments i mean i've been around buddy with with you know with the latest and uh Sometimes when you don't argue, it's it, it can be detrimental if you're not talking about things that are bothering you and you're just uh, bothering you and you're just bottling it up inside. And then, and then when you blow, and then when you have an argument, you can't handle it because you never argue. A person will go like, "How dare you talk to me that way?" And the, the relationship is damaged. Again, not saying is your relationship. I'm saying that that has happened. You know that sometimes it's not um, it's not for the best. Just not argue at all or talk about his stuff and then there's of course there's people that don't argue and talk about their things anyways and that's the best obviously that was what happened so yeah ah. It's a good game, but I, I, I gotta say that, hmm, the, the limited content, but I, I guess incentivates you to get better. I mean, I'm talking about the containers, but it, it, really careful with this jackass here. It just pushes you out. I think I'm gonna take the route that I've been taking. Now, taking again. Fuck off. Fuck! You know, it doesn't stop when it starts with this nonsense. No, 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 no. There we go. R gives a storm, but it will always have a rainbow come after. Just in case the love went away and she broke. Yeah, that's the thing. There's a, there's a, sometimes the love goes away. You know, it happens. I had uh, my ex before my wife. She was, she's a lovely person. I don't have any problems with her, uh, very little. And uh, I just went, you know, just. And you know, it worked out for her. She found a good guy. You know, but we just, it, it just wasn't there. Ah, fuck me. Come on. Yeah, it just wasn't there. And I'll tell you briefly, she was threatened suicide. She had a, a 38 all up point. So there you go. So, uh, I'll go back uh, back a little bit with a, with a, a tiny bit. Uh, no, no, it's not pol politics, but kind of with a guy to South Africa. The guy, and he was like, that's. All fun and games until it happens to you or somebody in your family. Somebody in your family. It's not happened to me. My ex shot me, and it's, it's, I had the gun before. It's, it's not the fucking gun, man. You know, she could have poured hot oil in my head when I'm asleep or something. With the gun, and she had a gun, she had an array of mental problems. Uh, I think she was bipolar. Uh, arguing a lot and uh she had suicidal tendencies she took a bunch of pills one time we had to go to the hospital i was fucked and then one time uh she threatened suicide with a, with a gun right and threatened to shoot me as well but then she threatened suicide which she had done before it was a whole it was a very toxic relationship that we had uh and i i, I said N -n -n that's enough give me the gun and then she refused to give me the gun and she crouched and then she just charged the gun. I don't think she, I don't think she wanted to hit me, but I don't think she cared at a particular time. But that's how those people are when you're not, you know, all there. And uh, 
God, um, uh, before I go on with the, with the, with telling you, because you asked me, God, thanks, God, thanks, I never try shit like that. What, what did you try? Getting shot? I'm not understanding what you tried. It was not like I went, hmm. I, uh, I heard about this getting shot thing. I think I want to, I want to try that out. I'm not sure what you mean by that. Please explain yourself what you mean, because, uh, before I continue, because I don't know what that means. Try shit like the what shit. Ooh, ooh. Okay, I was a little bit too eager last time, and that's that fucked me up. There we go. Yeah, we're moving. We're going places here. A man try to hurt yourself. All right, I got you now. Uh, yeah. She was in a dad, and she got me worried a couple of times, and, uh... Ah, uh, she crouched with the gun, and then dis discharged the gun. And then it hit me... I mean, it hit me in the knee. It's a 38 hollow point, so there was a lot of damage. When it happened, it was like I got... I, you know, I read, uh... I watched a video today, uh, the other day, the Ballistic X Resistant, and some people talking about, oh, the movies and how we get shot and they will go back and the Mythbusters. Yeah, but, but I recall very vividly, because I lived it, uh, when I got sh shot, it was like somebody on my knee, I was this way, I spun around, it was like somebody hit me with a sledgehammer and my, my fucking leg went that way. So maybe they're talking about non hollow point bullets, because a hollow point bullet will hit you like a fucking sledgehammer. Uh, you know, a 38 hollow point, uh, point blank. And when that happened, I crawled outside and I, I tried to get away from her because I, I didn't know what the fuck was going on. If she shot me on purpose, she was going to shoot me. And we had neighbors. And then uh, I crawled outside and I felt nothing. It was just at that point, it later home we came. Uh, and I just... And then I noticed she was freaking out, so I knew then she was not, like, going to shoot me again or something. And then I told her to call my cousins who live down the road. That was in Mississippi. And she, uh, she called them up, and they came, and then the cops came. And I saved her ass. She had two kids. She was, uh, d divorced, right? We're in a process of divorce. She moved down there. She was from up north. And when the cops came, I don't... I don't deal with that shit. So I just said that I was cleaning a gun and I shot myself. So otherwise you'll be fucked, you know. I didn't want to do that. That's whatever problems you have is sort yourself. That's why how I always been. And uh, and yeah, then they brought me to the house. They didn't do shit at all, but they did send me a three thousand dollar bill that I never paid for the ambulance ride. Because the the deal she did break the deal she was supposed to pay. The, I was supposed to not tell the cops anything. But I did tell her you're paying the fucking bill because I was uninsured. And please don't, l let's not get into the fucking health care. I don't want to hear the fucking politics of health care of Europe and how much better in Canada is. Just forget about that shit. Talking about the, the shooting here incident. So, they sent me back. I didn't have enough painkillers and it was fucking horrible. It was, I never had some, my leg was twice the size and under, on the part, it was my, my right leg. He was fucking black. Not even fucking purple, right? Yeah, I don't want to hear about the fucking healthcare. Fuck your healthcare. I'm sorry. Don't want. Don't want to fucking hear it. So, anyways, back to the subject. Cause it gets tiring. It's like fucking shut up already. So yeah. You know. Meanwhile, the Canadians go to America to get their real treatment, surgeries, and let's not get into it. So, had to go back to the hospital. And uh, they gave me some powerful painkillers. Yeah. No, I don't even the small comment. No, no comments. I. I rather I don't know. I rather hear. Uh, I rather you. You tell me you eat feces than hear about the fucking bullshit healthcare crap again. Fucking nonsense politics. That's the thing. I know you. Have, you're very political, Sam. So that I. It's not. You ask me about being shot. So I don't want to. I don't want to be dry. Is I. Is a trigger fucking word. They mentioned healthcare. The bill was mine. It was mine for me to pay. So, yeah. <laughs> I put that a Canadian in my. Yeah. <laughs> Arguing Canadians are not even here. But yeah. 
Uh, the, the, the bill does expunge, as they say, for a while. It's not like a regular bill if you don't pay or don't have the means to pay. It's not like the other stuff. The health care in America is not like people say they are, unless you're a real bum and don't give a shit about anything. Uh, sort of like I was. Uh, there, there's many reasons for it. And let's not get into it. Uh, so yeah, they didn't do shit. I was bleeding profusely. It was fucking horrible. The nurses got me worried. I bleed a lot. I've had problems. Like, I've had injuries. I've been stabbed too. That's a whole nother can of worms I'm not gonna tie up. That's not even the worst. You think being shot is the worst thing. I got stabbed in Brazil. Have you ever seen your own fucking intestines? I have. As, as, you know, as clear as day while it was nighttime. I seem, I held my own guts inside my belt, my shirt. That has happened to me. You're talking to a guy that's been around and been through some fucking fucked up shit. I'm lucky to be alive here. I'm lucky you've seen, this is nothing shorter than a miracle here. And I rode bulls. I actually rode fucking bulls. I can, looking back, I can act well, I'm a kid. I would ride one now if I had a chance. I live dangerously and I live a real crazy fucking life. I, so I moved to the UK, my life settled down. It's my, you know, I met my wife and, and things have been settled. But before that, it was all craziness all the time, you know. But with the shooting, I came here about a few years later. I went, it bothered me a lot. You could actually grab the bullet because the stating hollow point doesn't go through you. So it just damages as much as possible. It fucks you completely. So it, I was lucky it shattered my femur. It, it shattered my femur. No, no, it didn't shatter my femur. It chipped my femur. I was very lucky. I could have, I could have lost my fucking kneecap. It could have been horrible. I don't know if I can. Nah, it's too, it's too light here, but I'll show my beautiful legs. See if it, I don't think it'd be possible to see that. Yeah, it's just a hole here, you can see. I don't know if you can see it. It's, it's, there's a fucking hole in there, so. My kids, oh, there you go, oh, there you go, there's a hole. See, ever seen a bullet hole? That's a bullet hole. See that? There's the. Tiny thing, yeah, you'll see it's a tiny fucking thing, but holy fucking shit, it caused a lot of fucking trouble. <laughs> it's just, you know, fucking hell, that was horrific. And after that, I was fucked up on the couch for months on fucking horrific painkillers. So I am terrified of pain. I don't take any medicine. I became traumatized by that. I was on the couch in and out, and the doctor gave me a year to fucking walk again. That was fucking horrible to be on the couch there sweating. I, I would dream of being uh, my my foot. I'm a barefoot kind of guy. I walk barefoot everywhere, even rocks. I can walk barefoot everywhere. My, I don't have feet, I have hooves. I can walk everywhere. Uh, and I, I, I'm there on the couch, you know? And that was, uh, that was, that was fucked up. Miss Rex Thames, you're already right, that's right. <laughs> she did. Yeah, I settled down here. Yeah, so I, I walked with six months. I came up with a way of walking. I couldn't bend my leg. It was unbendable. It was fucking, it was horrific. It was horrible. It was a, a, a six, like six months of torture. And it's never the same. It's not like the movies. You ever seen the movie, they get shot in the leg, it's nothing. Oh, you shot me like a, what, speed? You shot me in the leg to get her out of a house. No, you're, you're kind of fucked for life. I can't, I can't dance like I used to, you know? And, uh, yeah. I, uh, it was funny, I, I, I moved, so later I moved to Scotland. That's why I was interested. I ended up in England, but I was really interested in move, moving to Scotland. By the way, if you see my American flag tattoo, on my other arm, I have a, a salt tire. Oh, if I can. I must, there you go. I'm of Scottish and Dutch heritage. Uh, and I lived there for five years. And uh, I asked, I requested there with a healthcare that they have, right? And, uh, which takes forever. It does take forever, but it does happen. I uh, had the bullet removed, but it was fun. I went there and the nurse was like, so you think you have a pallet in your leg? No, I showed them the x-rays, like a massive bullet. And they were moving, no fucking wonder. It was like this big, and it was like Sputnik. You know, it was like full of, sh it was like, uh, like, the, the, like the coronavirus, like full of spikes, because it deformed. And so the idea with the hollow point is when it hits you, uh, it expands, it, it, sh it shatters, it, it, it mushrooms to cause maximum damage it's for stopping power. So if you have, if you have a, like a big guy coming, uh, like I talk to cops and I had cops in my family. 
So that shot people that are going after them with a knife or something. And it goes right through you if it was a regular bullet. A hollow point will fucking knock you the fuck back, you know, it stop you, it has stopping powers. So, but it stays in your body, so it does, it very rarely goes through it, that's the problem, so. When I got shot, I didn't know, because I shot, it was a Smith & Wesson uh, 38 snub nose. So I wasn't sure which bullets were in at the time. And it, when I knew there was no, it didn't come out the other way, then I knew it was a hollow point and I knew that I'll be in a lot of trouble. But if anything, I'm lucky. It's, it says, welcome to the chat room. Am I still on? Keeps, this fucking thing keeps saying, welcome to the chat room. That means, that means, that means the fucking thing dropped my internet. Satsun, it, Satsun said it's dropping it. Is it? Is it dropping then? It's been dropping my... So I got like a fucking thousand VODs again. Eh? Is that it? Okay, thank you. Fucking losing my train of thought here. Oh, oh, and then a message pop up for a recipe. A receipt for... what? The, get the fucking Windows. Get out of here. I don't want a fucking own notification. It's kind of streaming here, buddy. Fuck out of here. Fuck was those time. So yeah, they removed. Oh, it was a, a, a German doctor actually. He removed. It, did this surgery, and they, they couldn't remove the other parts. It was like it's like a big part, and then a tiny, a bunch of tiny other parts and parts of my femur. But for them to remove that, they have to cut you like uh, up completely or fuck up your nerves. Like, they can't do that. So I said I'll be happy if you remove the biggest bit. Like when I used to walk on stairs, right, climbing up stairs. I would feel the the bullet will move and it would and I, when I saw the bullet out of my body I was waking up from the uh, anesthesia I realized how fucked it was because it was very sharp on the x-ray it didn't look as menacing it looked kind of rounded but it was not it was like the x-ray the only image of the x-ray I have it got it sideways so it was fucking flat as fucking menacing as fuck so I'm glad it's out it, it did improve but sometimes I have pain and I have to you know but it's nothing debilitating it's just pain you, you learn to live, you get used to your body gets used to it, but I feel like right now I'm feeling it. It's constantly there. I'm very aware of it. And if I, that hole there in my leg, if I hit that, and a few times it happened, it's the worst pain I have ever had in my life. You send shockwaves. One, one time I hit a table, the pain was so much I threw up. I literally just threw up. So that's my, uh, my weak spot. So if you're ever in a fight and you punch me in my bullet fucking hole, I'll go down like a bag of, of shit. But that's it, you're, uh, you're watching a guy who, who you should have a crazy life, let me tell you. My life was anything but uneventful. And now it is, I'm here, since I moved here, I'm quiet and I got back into fucking games. And I, uh, you know, I never did drugs. I never uh, been in much trouble. It's just wrong company. I've, I've had a lot of issues in my life. I didn't grow up with parents. I uh, grew up with an abusive family, but I'm not, I don't like to be the victim, you know, I, I, I think it makes you stronger somehow. And, uh, yeah, I'm happy, I, I'm alive, I'm, I made it, to four, I'm 40 years old, I never, I, you know, if I had continued thinking of living the way I used to live, I don't think I would have made it, I, I'm, I'm lucky I even made it here. When I got stabbed, it was serious, it was, it was in Brazil, I've been around, you know, and, uh, yeah, the guy was in to kill me, it was, it, uh, when my family went there, they didn't think it was a Sears, but when a guy said he was, uh, what, what the word, he was a special word. Uh, when your guts come out of your belly. Mm, I forgot the fucking word, there's a word for it that he used. And I remember my, my aunt was there and she's like, she started to cry, you know. It was a fucked up recovery, recovery, I had tubes and I was very lucky to be alive. It was horrible, it was a horrible, I was 18 years old. It was a horrible thing to go. Eviscerated, thank you. It was eviscerated. I think that's the word he used. He was eviscerated. Yeah, I had my guts. Uh, the only reason he said he would have ran in the guts stay. I don't know if that's true, but that's what the doctor said. And I had, I've always had my shirt tucked in inside my belt. My belt. You know, I dress like cowboy style. You know, George Strait. If you look up George Strait, that's how I dress, except a cowboy hat. But back home, I had a cowboy hat all the time. And, uh, yeah. 18, yeah, would have. I thought I was that. I never, Chase, if you ask me if I'll be alive, it was in a field. I, I, you know why I made it to town? It was middle of the pasture, middle of nowhere. I had to make my way to town. I had to evade the guy first, and thank, thank God it was no moon in the sky that day. And I had to evade the guy, and I have a big mean scar on my belly. 
So I had to evade the guy first, and I managed. I threw my cowboy hat. I had a white cowboy hat on, and I hid in the grass. And I fell, and I said, quiet, this guy is looking around to kill me. And I hope you don't mind me sharing this. It's personal, but I don't mind. Those are stories, you know, I'm, things that happen. And I managed to make it to, to this town. This town is a small town in Brazil. Uh, and if you want to run Brazil, I was, I was a bull rider. He was a bull rider as well. We competed there. Brazil has bull riding, by the way. Some, in fact, they're, they're getting very good at it. And uh, we competed so every week in a, in a different town. And uh, it, it was over a girl, by the way. I'll tell you later. But I didn't even know. Like, I was going to die. I didn't even know. The guy, the guy gave me fucking supper at his house. He paid me drinks, trying to get me drunk. I didn't know. Thank God. See, if uh, uh, high tolerance of alcohol, I never say that. It saved me. If I was a lightweight, I would have been dead. He he paid me a lot. A drink they have in Brazil called pinga or cachaça, which is very strong. And I, I'm down on that, but it didn't affect me. But he was trying to get me drunk to to kill me easier, you know. And uh, uh, I uh, I got away from him. From, from this guy he, he went somewhere else some, some I don't know a deer or something made a sound and he went the other way and it was the sawgrass very very big sawgrass and uh, I made it to town but I'm like blood is coming out of my mouth I can feel my guts are out of my belly I can feel like squishy is a horrible disgusting terrible feeling and I'm falling over see you see horror movies when you're falling over that that's what happens in real life I never believe because I always like horror movies and I, yeah that happens you're panicked and I'm trying, and then at one point I laid down, and that was it for me. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm done. It was overwhelming. Like I was so tired, and I was so cold, and I just wanted to sleep. And I, I, I it's kind of vain, but the image I got in my mind was like they're gonna find me here in this fucking pasture, if they got full of fucking ants and eating. I say at least I can do is go home, go, go to the road if I can make it to the road. And I made it to the road, and I shouted as much as I could, as loud as I could, and I collapsed. Not passed out. I never passed out in my life. So I collapsed, laid down, and in the middle of the fucking road. And I later talked to some people there, and and they told me that they a guy was in a... Because some people came to visit me afterwards, eh? and a guy said he heard something and told him at the gas station to turn the light, the sorry, the music down. And when they came out, they thought I was ran over or something, that I got hit by a car because it was on the road. And then when they flipped me, and then fucking blood everywhere. And it stunk too, it was very bad because my stomach was open. I got stabbed in the stomach. My guts were not affected. They spill out because of an L shape. And if you go read about, it's funny, I read later on, I like reading about random things. I was reading about the Japanese, they have the seppuku, which really the suicide that they do of the samurai, and they cut an L shape or an X shape in their belly. I have an L shape because basically if you cut like this, your guts are going to stay in. But if you cut like this and this, it becomes a flap. So that's what, so the guy stabbed me one time. I didn't, I didn't know what was going on. And he, he cowardly stabbed him when I was pissing because it stopped to piss in the middle of nowhere on this dirt road. And while I was pissing, he hit me one time and I felt what the fuck happened? I don't know what happened. I thought he, he gave me a tiny punch. And then I fell uh, running things, motherfucker, you know. I fell running liquid down on my legs, you know, and I thought I was pissing myself. It's fucked, you know, come to think of it. And then he hit me again and pulled it up. And then I realized he was stabbing me. So that's when I ran. And, uh, you know, made my way out of there, man. It's a fucking horrible day. I made my way out of there and, uh, you know, and uh, got saved. That They called the ambulance and uh, they rescued me. And they brought me to the hospital and they didn't want to, the guy in there didn't want to operate at first. Didn't want to operate, I said I was a dead, I was dead already. And I had this other doctor that came, Dr. Andre. I was, I was lucid the whole time. I was, I was very deeply aware of what was going on. And um, I was cussing, actually. I was cussing. I called the doctor a bunch of names because he was like going to let me die there. It was Brazil, you know. Things were different in there. And another doctor called Andre. I never forget him. He came and he, he starts saying all the jargon. And you know, I heat this up, 30 ml of this and that. Then they brought me in and they, they operated on me. Uh, apparently it was three and a half hours uh, and I wake up I got tubes up my nose but I praise Jesus I'm alive 
you know, I'm, I was alive. I couldn't, I couldn't fucking believe it. I couldn't fucking believe it. Yeah, I cuss at them. I call them all kinds of names. I remember there was a cop in there, and he's telling me to slow down. And I was like, what are you going to do, arrest me? Fuck you, you motherfucker. I call him a bunch of fucking names. And even the, the doctor that operated on me, I call him, call him names. I, he, he was understand. I, was, I thought I was dying. So I was like, oh, I'm going to go to the guns blazing, take it out on those fucks. Because, uh, you know. And, uh, yeah, it was a long road of recovery after that. Uh, it's fucked, you know. Uh, but uh, I'm, I'm th every day I'm thankful to be alive. Now, as for the guy, he got away with it. This Brazil, nobody cares. Uh, I had a lot of hate for this guy for many years, and I stayed in the country. I wanted to get him. I won't lie to you. I bought a lot of guns, and uh, he fucked. Up. We both had to fuck off from that town because if I stay there, he would kill me. And if he stay there, well fill in the blank you know uh, after a while I learned to just uh, not forgive too much but forget uh, well and I learned three months later what happened because I, I at first I was confused I don't know what the fuck happened I thought we were pals you know and turns out I was dating this chick so I was popular there you know you're American guy they call me Americano and I was popular there I'm tall pale and different and uh, bull rider too is bull riders are popular in there as well and uh, so I started dating this girl and I told him about it. And it turns out he secretly loved this girl. He was obsessed with her. And he thought he wanted to kill me and another guy. So that night he asked a ride from another guy. And you know, he wanted to buy a gun with me. So the motherfucker would have shot me with a gun. <sighs> Piece of shit, you know. And uh, yeah, dude. Yeah, I was about to ask if you banged his girlfriend. No, that was not his girlfriend. That was mine. In fact, in fact, when I moved to that town, I was in love with this chick so much. A chick named Camila, I remember. She was she was a farm girl. She was fucking so cool, you know. And this other chick that they would say, oh, she's the hottest chick in town. I, I would, I'm a very loyal person. So when I moved there, there was a lot of a lot of chicks that wanted to be with me there. I'm not bragging about it. It's just the way it is, you know. I think probably because of the, the foreign thing and my appearance. And when... I wouldn't give them to, to a, a minute of my time. I was obsessed with this other girl, and I loved her, and I would not. I was not interested. So this other chick was interested in me, and they say, "Oh, she's the hottest chick in town. You, you won't, you won't pay attention to her." So no, I love this other chick. I, I used to have a dog tag with the chick's name. I used to be a romantic, you know. And then, uh, and then, this other girl f fucked me over. She, she was not into it. And uh, then I decided, why not? This other chick was really on my case and telling people, can you tell him to meet me? And, um, you know, and then I, I started to date this chick, you know. It was not a, a secret or anything. And then I told this guy, and then he went nuts internally. Remember what we talk about? The people that are very quiet and they're very, they don't talk. We're talking about arguments. People that don't talk about, they're not angry, they're not cussing. Beware, be, be very careful. This guy didn't say a fucking... Oh, no, I remember it was said. Bad idea, she's a whore. That's what it says. I remember that. So, that's all he said. Nothing else. And then after that, wouldn't you know, he became extra nice. Like, extra, he wanted to... He's inviting me to all those places. Little did I know that he was already trying to kill me. He made up his mind. I did, well, you put the dots together later on. You know, the motherfucker was trying to kill me. That's what that was. Try again, you piece of shit! <laughs> I'm still here, motherfucker. Never gonna die. So that's it. That's it. that's the story. Uh, something that happened. That is crazy. You know, murder hype. Get in a murder train. <laughs> uh, when I talk about uh, a tale of what got me emotional today, talking about it, I never do. It's just something that happened. It feels like a, a million lives in the past but when he stabbed me the coward way that he done it i think if i was in a bar fight or if i had banged somebody's girlfriend or something like that i could kind of see it you know but it's just the way he done it and the cause of it and not even fucking having a common courtesy of telling me as he was trying to kill me it's fucked this is a fucking horrible person i could see a, a crime of passion you know i i don't know man 
I don't know. It's just the way he done it that for me that gets me, you know. It, it really fucked up my trust in people. That's what it did. I say, I mean, you get strong now, but it, it fucks you. You fucked me up mentally for a long time on trusting people. I don't think my trust in people has ever returned fully. It is very tough for me. And, and yeah, no very fucking chick that I, I didn't, I wouldn't even enter her that much. I dated her more of like, a, you know, I, not that I'm wrong. I don't have to make excuses. I was, she, she's single, I'm single. But you know, it was not, it wasn't, it wasn't even that important. We probably wouldn't, you probably wouldn't have gone anywhere anyways. I mean, eventually I was going to move out anyways. I'm not going to fucking leave there forever. So yeah, that's, uh, that's life. Be careful. You, be careful who you, who you, who you make, who you make friends with sometimes. You got to be very careful because you never know who you, who you call them a friend sometimes. And I'm not saying don't trust people. There's good in people. There definitely is. But, uh, but it can be tough. You got to be careful. Some people, they are not what they seem to be, you know? Yeah. Keep an eye out though. That's it. All right, I think I talked your ears off long enough here, my nonsense. Monkey ball time, and at least this, nobody gets stabbed here on this one. <laughs> yeah, for a while, I couldn't even see, like, people getting stabbed, and, and, you know. But I did it, man. I pulled my fucking guts, and I, I got out of there. There was a guy in there that he high-fived me after I was good enough to recover. And I recovered surprisingly quickly. I mean, I was looking like a fucking cadaver. I was looking horrible. I lost all my weight that I didn't have already because I've always been so skinny, you know? Uh, and... Fuck! And... Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, and a guy said, Fucking hell, you got stabbed, picked up your guts, and left. <laughs> a real man. I was like, fuck yeah, man. Now that you say, Lafer says, now that you mention it, you just want to send me <laughs> the GPSC and have my address and visit me like I said some days ago. Ah, don't worry, I don't have the energy for that shit, man. You're not that important, Mr. Lafer. You're not even on my fucking radar, bro. <laughs> hey, more GPS control for me, man. You make up your mind. You got to really think about the Wi-Fi, though, there you have there, if it's going to work, because it might, you know, you might get a device that might be useless for you. No. All right, all right, I'm coming, Jesus. There we go. Hmm? Ready? Go. All right. This stage is fuck. You gotta balance it perfectly. Ah. I want to know what the hell is down there. Nah. Okay. Can't move the camera. Yeah, if you get a Wi-Fi router, that might work. Like I said, I got no problem sending you that stuff. There's a goal down there. Should we be bold and try? Okay, let me see. I think I should be when that thing is up. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try to get down there. I'm an adventurer. Well, that didn't... That didn't turn out as well as I planned in my head. It just didn't. <laughs> there we go. Take it easy, take it easy. Take it easy. Where's the goal? No, no, go before... No! You don't want to... You don't want to do when it's doing the whole crazy shit. You just fall like a bag of shit. There we go. Jerome gave me a tip here. Oh, CRT writers, bring, bring me a coffee now. About time to have a coffee here, if y'all don't mind. You know, I lost my Twitch stats here. I don't know what's... It's just a white fucking screen. That's weird. No, no, I get you to access the secret. Let me just get a coffee here. I'm not gonna stop playing. I'll just have a coffee here on the side. Let me just, my wife is coming with a coffee right now. So I'm just gonna, I'm a sucker for coffee. So pardon me, uh, chew, uh, just give me a second.
be right back. Yeah. I'm coming. Hey ho, you got a cage, bitch. We got some coffee here. Jerome, don't you even fucking dare tell me about a hobgoblin IPA. I ain't got no fucking beer. I ain't got no whiskey. I don't have a fucking goddamn cotton picking thing. Cup of Joe. Look up the, uh, cause we say that. I don't know if they say that here. Cup of Joe. Uh, because they couldn't serve alcohol on the ship or something on the ship that they were at and they, because of a guy named Joe and they say Joe is as good as it gets so they will call the coffee a cup of Joe. That's where the term comes from. Lack of alcohol. I love Hobgoblin. That's awesome. I stopped ordering beer here because they don't, if my whiskey don't last, imagine a beer. It just fucking goes. And it's not, I find myself buying all the time. It's like a fucking like an endless supply here. No coffee for me past noon on my own now. I, you know, it's some people, it's just people are different. Some people that get affected by caffeine, I don't. I can't, you know, not a hero here. It's just the way that our, our bodies work. Uh, some people can drink coffee and go to bed. I can drink a coffee literally before going to bed and just go to bed. Why am I might cheer in here? It's coffee. <laughs> ah, man. Fucking coffee. You should have no effect on me then I, I turn 30. Well, I'm 40 now. It didn't it didn't work as magic on me. Sometimes I wish it would. Sometimes you wanna you wanna be awake. I think I'm already, you know, crazy enough as it is. <laughs> Uh, is espresso? I like espresso. I don't drink. I used to like Folgers a lot. Big ass cup of Folgers. I do miss it sometimes. Sometimes it'd be nice to have a big old cup of Folgers. I think they sell it here, but it got imported. It's fucking expensive. So just uh, espresso from uh, Mocha Pot, the old fashioned way. The good news is the fucking temperature she, temperatures here have gone down. It is now 74. Is it? No. 84. That's not too bad. Or 20 something, 20 Celsius, 20, 28, I don't know. And if you wonder me stopping here at a time, all the time, I don't know if I'm going to be able to clear this, but uh, I'll, I'll stream at least eight, eight hours, so I'm at five right now. So I'll, let me see, six, seven, eight, nine, yeah, about eight hours for me today. I'm at 520 right now, so I'll be around here. Uh, says I drank two whole mugs every morning since I'm 14. I can possibly wake up and not drink coffee. I don't think that ever happened. If I don't, I get a migraine by 12. That's fucked. I can possibly not drink coffee when I wake up. Have to. And look, this here's a PlayStation mug. I don't know if it can be seen. Oh, thanks for opening this shit on my face. What the hell are you doing? It's faded by now, but it's a, it was a PlayStation at one point, a PS1. <laughs> we'll, we'll get back in the grind soon enough, if you're watching this. Ah, it's over already. The coffee. Yeah, darn it. I wonder what's going on. I open my Twitch and it's just a blank page. Am I uh, in the Twilight Zone here? Twitch is just a white page right now for me. Like, anything related to Twitch 
uh, if I try to open the docs here and which stats is a white. You're still here and kicking. Oh, good. I know the Twitch is white. I go to Twitch here, it's just a white page. Like the Oblivion. I don't know what, what gives. Is something going wrong with Twitch? Or that I'm not aware of? That's my internet here. Upload. Yeah, I'm not sure. No, the internet is good. Oh, look at that. Let's see here. Just doing an internet test here, boys. And we'll go back to the monkey ball monkey business 25.8 megabytes per second i wish the fucking internet was if this internet held up like this shit that's way more than i need yeah i'm getting that try with you uh is that because is that just my page created it yeah everything is white i mean I mean, band in the Shadow Realm? Hey, that'll, that'll be certain. Okay. That's kind of weird. Whatever. <clears throat> Typo Top says, Thanks, I want you to play Monkey Ball. Monkey Ball is, it's, it's fun. It is fun. It is a, it is a very pleasant game. Even the frustrate, you just, it's not the kind of game that you're frustrated. If anything here, if I don't clear this today, is, uh, you'll be doing just the time, because I started too fucking late today. Uh, and I don't want to fuck up with my time and go to bed late and start waking up late. I want to, I want to be able to stream earlier here like I've been doing, but a tiny bit earlier. So if I don't clear today, it's not because of uh, hate or lack of patience, it's just uh, the, the time, because this is the sort of game you really want to try again and again. But I guess, I guess hateful games have the same effect. Uh, Jerome says it gets hard later on. Yeah, they do have the, uh, what's it called? The, the other mode with the 50, I got to clear 50 stage. I heard about being, but it's like, it's a, I like this type of game, it's just, it's just very interesting. And it is like the, uh, the challenges progress in a, in a good way here. So they give up, yeah. Did you finish any, uh, did you finish the, this mode here though, Jerome, just out of curiosity? Like you say, get, get harder, is that the, uh, the expert? thing <laughs> no 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 dude what are you do jeez mm. turn around this there we go sometimes it's harder to turn around if you're scared because he's kind of all over the place there we go See, but that's what I'm talking about, the progression here. When I came here the first time, I was fucked. I was not... <sighs> don't get greedy. I was not being able to... I was having a hard time doing this challenge here, for sure. No, no, no. No, dude. Shut up. Shut the fuck up. There we go. I'm pretty sure I finished easy and normal. Just not 100% sure that we're regarding expert form. Well, if you finish normal, you beat the game, and I mean, the extra will be sort of completion, just, yeah. For me, any game you beat on normal is is beat, not complete, of course, but at least it's beat. You did beat it. I mean, if I, if I don't beat this here, I'll feel kind of bad, but... I, I can always go back to a game, you know? It doesn't have to be everything or nothing. I like get one fucking stream, I have to do everything. I mean, the GameCube will be here, along with the, with the game, you know, so... Damn it. No. Oh man, that was cool. Was that the last shoe one? I wonder. At this area here, I'm not like I'm sure somebody can do it, but I can't imagine going that way here. Like going there. I just keep losing my lives there. I don't 
I don't know. I I, I don't want to. I don't want to prove anything here. I'm just gonna take. Shut up. Look at it as a time assault tie, so you cannot take your time there. No, I, 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 this stage here, I don't want nothing to do with it. Just move, move to the next one. Yeah, if I was you, uh, if I be the normal mode here today, I'll be, I'll be happy with that. I'll call it a day. I mean, I'll take a look if I have time. I'll take a look at the expert. It'll be just see, just see what's in there. There we go. Oh, this is a weird one with the platforms. Well, uh, Mr. Leifer, if you were interested in a Castlevania, I'd probably seen it already, but I'll, I'll probably play, I'm craving Castlevania already again. Uh, so I'll, I'll probably uh, be playing that game here. This area is a bit <laughs> annoying. It's, it's just kind of awkward. I don't fully understand, like, stop what? If you touch them, they go nuts. It's just sort of awkward. Here, oh, whoa, whoa. Oh! I knew what you did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna avoid the uh, outer edges here, kind of be it. Can, if you stay near them, can, can you move? I don't fully understand. I don't. I don't know this. I don't like the stage. I feel like I feel like I'm in a, I'm in a subway and everybody's pushing me. Get away from me! I want to pass. I don't like this one. Get out of here! So weird. This is weird disturbing get out of my okay this oh what the fuck I'm... Get... get out of here yeah i'm trying you piece of shit get out what are you doing uh i don't know what the fuck look I don't know what that stage is. You know what? I lost interest in that stage. I'm gonna do, go just straight here. This is what? What am I looking at here? Get, get out! Fuck! It's uh, it's awkward. No, no, just get, get out! Get out! Get me out of! Get me out of here! Sets and sits. This is where I yell you. Fucking jerking me around. That's how I feel like a bunch of assholes pushing you or something. And Typo Top says good songs. Yeah, the songs are uh, the, the soundtrack is just amazing here. It's very good. It's very good. Ah, oh, this stage is a bit. Mm. No, no, no. I think it just got it. Fuck off. Just turn slowly here. There, no. And then he does a stop. Fuck you. And in there. Yeah. Shut up. I want to see that shit again. It's embarrassing. Let's go. Okay, don't lose control because you died one time. It's come off it. It's just like one time. And that was that one time. And that's it. Fucking hell. Okay. Do, do a quick turn here. There we go. Just... Come on. And here, he fucking jerked your... No. You motherfucker. No. 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 Come off it. No. Yeah, you did a fucking side... Come on, dude. What are you doing? Get in the... Get for crying... Oh. So I want to go on the second goal. And see how... How... How was this? This one is not too bad. I am ready. All right. There we go. Oh, yeah, prick. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. The hype is real. There you go. 
Oh my god, I have to, uh, I'm sweating here. It's not cool enough. What the fuck is going on? It's sweating here, man. God, I need a fucking shower tonight, don't tell me. Can you imagine just going to bed after this, like, not, not showering? Get in there. All right, then. So this one is a... Uh, oh, this one is a... Uh, oh, yeah, the time, baby. Don't you tell me not to worry about Bin Laden. Get in there. Uh. Okay, don't, don't... The sparks here. This guy go, goes nuts sometimes. Can't... Oh, come off it! We got it. We, we got it. All right. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, I uh, I saw the uh, we we're talking about this la yesterday. I uh, I did see the uh, Little Nightmare Street trailer. That was pretty awesome. Uh. The designs are different. Huh? They went, they went the bold way of not using six or mono again, which is, is okay. I don't know who those little kids are. They, they have weird masks. Uh, the baby one thing was the highlight of it. The fucked up baby, baby gigantic baby monster. That was quite something. Breaking, oh, whoa, breaking the beat. I'm looking forward to that. Whoa, whoa, dude, dude, stop. You can get it. Get shut up. There we go. See, I wonder if today's showcase has because there's another one. Oh, I'm looking forward to seeing that. I love that franchise. Really uh, made an impression on me. The second one especially is really amazing. So there's another... Oh, there's another trailer coming up today. No, I don't want this one. I want the, the second one. Get to it! There he is! Honiesta! Go, 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 and... There we go, 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 let's go. Fucking hell, dude. Speed up! There we go. I'm still hoping to see Stalker 2 because you can play a demo on game, Gamescom anyways. What is Gamescom? Now there's a, sh not a showcase in general, not for Little Nightmare Shoe 3, I mean. I don't know who Stalker is, never played it. A lot of new games, I have no idea. I but I like to check out when I don't know the better games. Like, oh, I don't know what a Stalker is. So if I can, I'll go and check. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I'll go and check what it is. Because I'm sure if you mention it must be something. Shut up. What the fuck am I to do here? Come on, man. Come on, man. It's right there. Goofing off here. Gamescom is one of the biggest game fairs and... I didn't even know they still had games. I thought it was over. There were no, 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 no. Well, that's cool. It's been kind of slowly. I think COVID kind of fucked things up a bit. Come on, don't, don't, don't be a jerk. Don't be a jerk. Don't be a jerk. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. there we go. We're getting there. Ah. No, 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 there's a banana right here. You get, get that fucking banana. There we go. If it was a Gamescom because an arrow, if it was an arrow, if there was a big festival game in here an hour away from me, I'll probably be inclined to. Well, not now because I don't have transport. But when I have my truck on the road. Ah. Uh. Why, why would I, why would I slow down just before that? Come on. No, I'm, shut up. God, this guy. 
good music. Okay, I think this is the last place I've been last time. How in the fuck? Oh no, there was a place I've been after that. You telling me I gotta rush here? No fucking way I'm getting that crap. Come off it. What? I'm here for nothing. Alright, gotta get out. Time is of the essence here. Is a fun level. No, time, time is running out. Sorry. <laughs> there we go. I got a one up out of it. That's good. So what did you see there, uh, Mr. Lee from Gamecom? That was uh, kind of cool when you went there. Ah! The f when you went that that one time. Ah, that's bullshit. You goofball. What game you remember seeing that one time? That was interesting there. Okay, I think it was here. Yeah, it was here. Da -da -da. Those fucking things. Come on, man. You goofing off! I want to fucking enters. Get him. I'm gonna be a coward with it, whatever thing I see here. Is that a submarine? That threw me off. Alright, what? All those things. Move. Move. How the fuck? What are you doing? Get out of here! Fucking hell. Shut up. No, no. Oh, the f get in there. So chaotic sometimes. Oh, Sekiro. Wow, uh, I want to play that game some point. Very cool. Now we'll showcase if you visit. If you visit more. You can actually play games if you line up for it. I went for meeting friends. Wow. Oh. Yes, this guy said, hurry up. Like, dude, I, I can't see the timer here. Yeah, will you give me a fucking second? Well, at least they have an arrow. Okay, you can't slow down here because slowing down means death. Right? And I sure hope I'm going... Am I going... I'm sure, no, it's going down. Okay. <clears throat> you can't slow down here. There's no way. Keep up. Keep up here. Not too much happy, jackass. Get up. Get up here. Oh, my God. No, slow the fuck... Dude. It's out of control. You're out of control! I gotta understand the hut here. Where... Okay, my lives are where? 84, 26... Lower 26, what does that mean? There's no way I clear 26 levels. Here, come on, real quick. Okay, at the end there, you gotta slow down a bit, champ. I I have to slow you down. I'm shutting your ass down. Okay, there we go. Let's go. Yeah, once you, go, you get your craze, I'm gonna shut your ass down. Now here, shut up, shut up, shut up! You're not doing that shit again. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Ah! Oh no! Oh, come in, please. No game over. Oh my god, I have four and three now. Oh, whatever. Yeah, I want to play Sekiro. And what's the other one that is similar? Ghost of Tsushima or something? One of them is kind of a sort of a spiritual secret, not spiritual secret, but it kind of reminds me of the one with the grappling uh, hook. 
reminds a lot of people of Panchu, which is a good thing. Slow down. Slow the fuck down, but not that much, you fuck. Okay, just skip. There we go. Ah! Oh, fuck off! Look at this! What? Oh, no, dude. No, that was cowardice. That was an, uh, that was treason. Come on. Come on, that fucking thing was right there. It's the end. This is the end, my beautiful friend. Where's that from? Oh, Shadow Man. Crazy. The crazy Southern guy. Okay, just let go instead of holding back, that's all. How come you fucked up the end there? This thing on my on the corner of my vision is pissing me off! Stop, stop! Oh my god! Okay, I think I'm I'm slowing down there, and that's what's fucking me up. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. There we go. Vamos dos. Agarrelo. Go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Let's go, man. Slow, slow, slow. But not at the end. At the end, you go ball shit a wall. Ball shit a fucking wall, dude. Ball shit a fucking wall, dude. Ball shit a fucking wall. You fuck! Mr. Lefer says, Secure is the one with the grappling. I really want to play that. Oh my god. I'm... They're dropping like flies. Nah. Ghost of Tsushima isn't similar at all. Ghost of Tsushima is not similar as Marvel Assassin's Creed in Japan. Well, pardon me, Lefer. I saw images of both, and they look very similar to me. My opinion. Sue me. They look fucking similar. If I told you they look similar, they look similar. In my opinion, in my eyes, my good sir, they did look similar. In fact, so similar that I mix them both. So much so that I don't know which one is who, proving that I ask which one is the one with a grappling hook. So I beg to differ uh, on that one, my friend. Why am I missing here? Am I going too fast? I'm going too... There we go. Looks maybe, yeah, why... If, okay. If I haven't played the game, what else do I have besides looks? To, to determine if a game looks similar or not. You know? I mean, I looked at them, I haven't played them. So... That's why I've been saying I would like to play them. So I'm implying I haven't played them yet. And I also never play Assassin's Creed. So uh, by that logic then that also means nothing to me. Because I never played a game. But I'm aware if you show me Assassin's Creed. It's a guy, I don't know, it's a guy with a hood. You go as a stealth game or something. No, I'm not in tune with modern gaming. I'm not joking. I, I, I really am out of touch with it, to be honest with you. I know a thing or two here and there, and don't forget that I spent many, many years without gaming at all. And when I got back to it, it was a lot of stuff went by. Like I never had played Resident Evil 4 until relatively recently. Where's the fucking place? Oh my god. What the fuck is this? Ah, oh, fuck your couch. I'm not ready. I don't know what you what you require here. Is that okay? Now I got you. <laughs> oh shit! There's banana. No, no, the time is too short. Where am I? There we go. I like some AC games, Assassin's Creed, because of their story. See, that's the thing, I'm not, I'm not really, if I, you know, is it, is the gameplay good, though? Uh, a sto story for me is not enough, because uh, we have movies. I mean, it can, it can definitely enhance a game. What the fuck is, what is this shit? What is this shit? What is this, what is this shit? Yeah, the gameplay is that if the gameplay is good, I'm by the story. If your story is good, but your gameplay is, is 
ass, you can fuck right off with your lore. Put it, put it, go to Hollywood. Oh, fuck. I like the gameplay, but it's simple. Sometimes simple is good, less is more. Oh my god, two continues. Okay. Two continues. What am I to do here? Do I have to take... Gotta go slow, is that it? Why can't I maintain this here? Why, why do we need to... Why do we need to fuck things up at the end? Can we... Can, see, look at that. that. Why? 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 Just fucking, you know, maintain. A lot of game, a lot of fucking modern games look similar. I, I look, is, is there like modern, oh my goodness, what the, what fresh hell is this? Okay, what, what am I look, what am I looking at here? I'm, I'm a bit, I'm confused and, and scared. Ah, ah! All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, we got it. Come on, man, control yourself. So, no, oh, no, 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 no. It's over, I'm not gonna make it. Oh my God, okay. Why oh, you lose control at the end, piece of shit. Why can't you fucking stay up there? Fucking make it already, mother fuck. Oh no, I don't think it might. Is this how many fucking replays you have? Okay, what the fuck? It's right there, dude. Maybe. Maybe it doesn't need to be in one go, does it? Let's try to. Let's see, can you maintain? What the fuck are you doing, you goofball? Yes, shut up! Shut your fucking mouth! No! <sighs> yeah, but it's my last fucking continuum. Right? Fucking hell. Holy dog shit. Okay, what in the fuck's name are we? What are we doing here? Where am I? No! Get away from me, you lunatic! No! No! It was right there! Oh my god, it was right there. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. Oh my god, I, it's game over. Was that the last one of the normal mode? Shut the fuck up with the vibe. Was that the last... Was that the last fucking level? Was it? Or no? Of the normal mode? Where's Ant? What the f what's going on, dude? I I'm wondering, was that the last level? Zero better. Thanks. Good evening. I think that was the last level, wasn't it? I mean, it said 30 here. What what do those numbers mean? I mean, it's 30. What what? I bet. No, in my fucking luck, that's the last fucking level. can't look it up because I don't have a keyboard here. I have it, but I'm not fucking connecting to shit. I need a bigger USB hub. It's fucked. No, I got fucked. That was a... No, sure, you forgot. It's me, man. That was the last level, I think, of the regular mode, which is at least... I, I won at least clear that today, and I died right, at, right literally at the end there. Uh, game over. Fuck! I think it was! Somebody tell me, please. I, I need to know. That was the last level, wasn't it? That, that, that door that I died right by, that was the last one. I mean, it said 30 in there. It has, it has got to be it. Oh, no. No, no, Shiro. You, 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 you're fine. It sends you all the, all the way back to the beginning. There's continues. You you don't have to. You don't get to try it again like that. No, all the way to the beginning. Hence my frustration. 
Ah! That was the last level. Come off it. But if I made it there, then I should... The problem is dying in the fucking... Dying in the beginning here. With that little fucking thing that pushed... Okay, you get better with this game, though. You constantly move forward. You drink some coke here. I want to say the shed is cooling off again, but I said that last time and then it got hot again. So I guess I'll stay quiet then. I don't upset the shed. Okay. Ah, fuck me. <laughs> Give me the fucking nigga thing. Alright, fuck off. This is a great game. It's a, uh, it's a vibe, as they say. <laughs> All right, fucking around here. Give me a drag, bitch. Wow, it says, what's wrong with the newer game scholar? No collar. Oh, yeah. No, I got it. What do you mean? Yeah, a lot of new games. They had a phase there. Joe from GameSec, I remember he mentioned that. And I was like, yeah, that's true. A lot of uh, games on the, what was it, 360 era and some other games, they, they think they think they have to remove the collar and make it draft and be realistic. You know? Now, you can still be a game not having a collar, like Resident Evil. I mean, that game is four. I love that game, but holy fucking shit with the browns, huh? How, how much brown can you feed in one in one screen? That is a brown game. Holy dog shit. Uh, and some, a lot of games are like that. One time they tried a Bomberman with uh, realistic people and it's like so drab and disgusting. Mortal Kombat, Mortal Kombat, uh, which one is it? 10, Mortal Kombat X. It's, they went for the overly serious and it's drab, the lack of color. See Mortal Kombat, Mortal Kombat 11, they came back with collars. I like collars. I don't like driving as depressing shit. I mean, my fits. I'm not even controlling here. What are you on about? Uh, yeah, some games like, uh, I don't know, like Silent Hill with fits, right? Uh, yeah. I don't want graphic realistic games. Exactly. Batman Well says, my friend, are you drinking whiskey today? I know it sounds like I'm always on the edge. Yeah, let's see the let's see the collection here that I'm in. I'm asking here. Empty. 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 It's gone. I'm I'm fucked. I, I don't have the cash right now. It's never a matter of uh it's a matter of money. <laughs> you know. God knows, sometime, like yesterday, what was yesterday? Oh yeah, of course, Odyssey. God damn it, I don't usually crave whiskey, but after that game, I wanted to sit down and drink a fucking whiskey. I wanted to, I wanted to drink a whiskey. Yeah, Hot World, that was an odd one. Love the ending though. I'll fap to that. Listen, whiskey, I need to get some. It's kind of fucked here. Life just ain't the same. But I can imagine uh, drinking whiskey in this sh hot shed. Uh, it's beer time. I think I need, but it's gonna cool off in a couple of days. When I run out, I go for lister and end up mouthwash. Works you out. Oh, well, I've seen people doing it, but I'm not, I'm not that. I'm not, I'm not addicted to alcohol, so. <laughs> and it wouldn't work because my, my wife got a brand of mouthwash, Co Colgate. It's it, it doesn't have alcohol and you can taste it. It's like, I don't like it, it's a bit lame. Not that I drink the fucking thing. I'm saying when you go, I like the feeling of cleanliness when you use Listerine, you know? Uh, got a fridge in the shed. 
there's buddy, there's three sheds. There's the big shed. This shed here is a shame I'm tied up here. Otherwise, I'll take the camera outside and show you. I have no problem with that. There's a, this big shed. It's a massive shed. Then there's a small shed where we used to have before, and that has a fridge in it, second fr a deep freezer. You had a freezer, but a fucking thing quit working. And then there's a third shed that is just nonsense. It's just junk. There was a guy here that issued the security on the other side of the field. He got kicked out of here, and then he left a shed behind, and the guys here, they had a tractor and asked, do you want the other shed? I'm saying, why the hell would I refuse a free shed? Of course I want to bring it over. And they brought the shed, and they left it. They actually, I remember, they left the shed in the fucking middle of the yard and would move it, kind of. I, I wanted to tell them where I wanted the shed. And they say they kept, they kept saying they are going to move the shed. They didn't. I moved the shed myself. I, I fucking literally pushed the shed myself. It was fucking hard, let me tell you, to the position next to the other shed. I had to move the shed like a, like a, a, a bulldozer and move the shed. But that's the power of sheds, you know? So, but there's no, yeah, but the, the listener, I don't do that. I'm not, I can go, I can go months. I think the last time, like six months, no alcohol, not caring. But I, then I go play those games and then all of a sudden I'm, I'm craving for some whiskey here. You know, get through the pain. Is it a container? How is the shed so strong? <laughs> well, it was a shed, I mean. You know, it was awkward. And plus the thing was wobbly, so I felt like I was gonna go right through it somehow when I'm pushing it, you know? It was not, it didn't feel solid. And it looks like a motherfucker, but I, I, I changed the roof, I put some felt, and then a wasp ma made a home there. You can't go there, the wasps are harassing you, full of wasps. They fucked off this, this summer. It was not that bad this summer. They're still around, uh, but not that bad. There was one time, and, and literally I, I went there in the winter time, and wouldn't you know, I was uh, fixing the shed and uh, fixing the, the nails and stuff, and off comes the queen from her slumber. Bash her fucking brains right in with a hammer. Because you see, the, the wasps, they all die but the queen, yeah? They go uh, hibernate or something. I don't know how. I'm not a wasp. I'm not I'm not in a wasp sphere. Don't know that much about it. Know a little about them. And I don't, you know. So, yeah. Staying in the shed there. But I wouldn't be able to move the shed now because it was empty. Yeah? But it has, uh, it has a fridge now in it. The other one just has nonsense. Battlemail says I can quit whenever I want. I just don't mind drinking mouthwash or take the edge off whenever I'm dry. I don't, I never felt like I would drink mouthwash. Cause see, I drink, I drink whiskey and rum and those things. I like the taste. Cause I've seen people they they do shots and they make like a nasty face. They're just interested in having the alcohol in them. I don't particularly enjoy being drunk. And I, if for me to be drunk, I have to drink copious amounts. Probably for me to get drunk, I would have to drink at least half a liter of whiskey to get fucked, like to get that problem. Drunk, even though I'm functional, but like to have a hangover, I would say, sometimes. But I have I have to really sit down and say, I deliberately go out of my way to, to do that, which I, I don't usually do, I don't like that. Yeah, I don't think you can quit whenever you want when you have to drink mouthwash. Yeah, it's a bit, that on my eyes a bit. Yeah, you, you do you, you know. You're not bothering me. So, you want to drink the mouthwash guzzle down, man? Shit is cheaper, no? Cheaper than... Not in a position to give health advice here, to be honest. But uh, if it takes the edge off, I don't know, you're not hurting anyone. You know, I'm not going to sit here and pretend I care about your health. I mean, the way it is, isn't it? Not being mean, just saying... Why, why would I preach it? You know, maybe... What can I do, you know? I personally, and I, I wouldn't indulge in... in, in and, and even if, like I said, even if I would, the, the, the damn thing doesn't have alcohol anyways. But I don't, I don't crave the alcohol per se. I crave the activity of drinking whiskey. Uh, oh, come on! Get that! I can't lose... I can't lose lives in the beginning here. Mm -mm. Uh, okay, oh, I gotta stop. I I do those nicotine pouches. I can see this one is getting to me. It's 
spit that shit out. You do those, you go overboard with those nicotine pouches. You can get, you get nicotine sickness. It happened to me one time here. I was gonna freaking out. Can do that with smoking or vaping, but if you do a lot of the nicotine pouches, yeah, definitely. Sometimes the state store don't open early enough. State store? What are you, like Finland? You know, in Finland they have, I'm obsessed with Finland, I like that country. But it's very weird their design on, on alcohol sales. They have a state that's owned by the state. So the state is in charge of selling alcohol. You can't just open a store like ABC Liquor. You can't do that out there. You have to, to go through the government. That's just, it's crazy. Don't push me, motherfucker. Don't fucking, don't touch me. Yeah, yeah as a government store called Alki. <laughs> I think something of that effect, shut up, shut up. Something of that effect, fuck. Something of that effect. All right, take it easy here. Don't bother me with a fucking timer. We're doing this. There we go. There we Shira says that's honestly pretty nice. What is nice, the government controlling alcohol? Is that what you're saying? That's nice. Yep, well, not really. This is not nice. It's terrible. I mean, I, I wouldn't miss it. Europeans do like the, the government stuff. I don't know. I, I, <laughs> a fucking redneck in here. We don't, we don't like government too much. I don't think government should tell you what you should drink or not drink or use, come off it. The control part, no, I don't like the control part. We, we're not babies. I mean, that's a difference, a big difference in Europe here that I see when I'm here. Uh, it's uh, very different. People here welcome, seems to me, they welcome government control and intrusion. I just, why the fuck would you want the government to tell adults what they should drink or not drink, you know? in my opinion in my humble opinion y you want to drink you drink is your fucking money I don't like government controlling anything fuck them somebody wants to drink or do drugs is their fucking prerogative that's what I, how I, I see things a government uh, they fail at everything they do with, with the control I don't like government control on anything fuck bugger off as the, as the Brits say I don't like none of that nanny state bullshit. You're an adult, you want to drink, you want to get fucked, you want to drink mouthwash, you want to do whatever you do, you're an adult. You're not, we're not children anymore, you know? You have the fucking big nanny state to do, to tell us what to do. Get the fuck out of here with, with the government. I don't like government telling me things. I tell you things. Uh, and, and plus it kills the competition now we have now like in Finland they, so they have the government has a so, so if the government decides to make a bottle of whiskey very expensive which they did by the way I read about it uh, there's no competition kill the free market kill everything you can't you can't just go oh, I'm gonna open a liquor store the government goes no you're not fuck your couch I'm not opening shit we tell you what to do you piece of shit and you're gonna do as you're told no, fuck the government. Fuck them. Fuck them. I'm fucking hard. Fuck you. Like the EU, everything they fucking pass is. <laughs> Gotta do this control over everything. Fuck off. And it's not like it's better here out of the YouTube Britain. It's the same shit. They kept all the fucking stuff. What's the point? I hate the government. That a mile says to hell with the government. I mean, I'm not an anarchist or anything. I mean, they do, they do have their place on a few things, but uh, they overreach sometimes. I like, I like small government. It's not, it's not, not even politics. It's just something that affects you on everything. If they, if they decided that tomorrow that fart is illegal and you'll be taxed, you would. You know, every time you have a, a bout of flatulence, you have to pay up. And look how, how they handle fucking COVID, huh? Fucking. I'm not saying it's their fault, but Jesus, everything failed. They fail at things. 
or like fucking regulating games. Like I get the like the ESRB is all right, but uh, I go banning fucking Mortal Kombat in Australia and shit. I come off it to, for for adults. Ugh. Take take it easy. You don't need there's plenty of time here. If I can make the normal mode, if I don't make the normal mode in this game, I don't I don't think I can quit streaming here. I know myself, if I can beat the normal mode, to this day burns me I didn't, I, I, to this day burns me I didn't beat Gimmick when I play Gimmick here. I mean, it was because of a crash and all, but in the back of my mind you did, I go like, you didn't beat Gimmick. You didn't do it. I ran out of time and the, the thing kept fucking with me. I went all the way to the end, very hard, and then the fucking, I don't know what happened, it sent me back like three fucking levels and then send me back one level once and then send me send me back another fucking three levels oh, what, what the fuck am I to do here I like some of the some level control but rules today are overkill well there is but that's it they give them a little control and there's more control more I I think it should be very small it should be big every government everywhere is just too fucking big now the IRS can kiss my ass too if they come around here I'll shoot first and let God sort them out <laughs> yeah, and they go after you, eh? See the celebrities, they, they get away with a lot of stuff, but uh, the IRS, man, that's not one of them. They'll get you. They will fucking get you. No, 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 This level was hard for me when I came here the first time. This was hellish, you know? I, I can see that. It's fucked. It's done. You might as well die. It's very funny that monkey part. So Okay, that went well. That was good. You did good, son. You did well. Ah da ba 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 Okay. No. God damn it. See I wanna turn around because the camera and I need to I need to turn around here, but Okay. Ah. My God, that was that gave me the chills. And be quiet here. You have no reason. You have no bit business going out there. Just have to wait and wait. Shut the fuck up. Shut up. There we go. We got this thing, man. I think. I don't know, it says 4, 9, 4, 10. I wonder, that has got to be the the last level. I think it was. It was difficult, but it could it could be it could have been done and I fucked up goofing off here. I goofed up it big time, goof off. Goofed off fucking learn to speak you piece of shit. Goofed off big time on that last level. Fuck. Can, it's a mess here with the fucking ripples in them. Nah. Could have gotten an extra life here. This ain't fucking with this. Just go straight. Easy way out. The coward. The coward's way. I don't know what the numbers mean, though. Be interested in all. No, no. We're not doing it. Uh, thank you for the, ban the bananas, but we're not doing this shit today. Whoa, whoa. The time is actually short here. You have to pick a way and just do well. I mean, the pros will be able to do it, not me. I just want to reach the goal. Oh, Shiro, Shiro, you're a saint. You checked it for me. How come none of y'all checked it for me? I wanted to know. Fuck's sake. <laughs> Shiro says, I checked it has 30 floors plus five. Extra if you don't lose a life. Well, that ship has sailed. So it's th it was the last level, huh? I'm okay with not doing perfect at the game, like fucking. I want my ideal stream here will be if I if I can beat the regular game at least at bare fucking minimal for crying out loud, and then bullshit around for a while with the expert just for fun, and uh, you know, but not beating the normal mode. What the fuck? No way. I need to beat the, come on, I need to beat the normal mode here. That's like the bare fucking minimum. 
What are you doing? What are you doing? What was out of control here sometimes. There we go. Oh, no, man. No. Fuck. God, this place. It's so weird. Move. Stop! Fucking like this shit. Get, get, get me out of here. Get, get, get the fuck out of here. No, no, no! No! I fucking refuse. Oh god. Okay, this, this one is tough. This one eats all my lives. I need to be very careful here. This is, I'm losing a lot of lives here and it's fucking me up later on. Fuck you then. This asshole here. Fucking banned so much. No! Fuck off! Fucking fuck! Damn it. No! I fucking lose all my lives here. Gotta stop. Stop! Go to the party there, you freak. Shut up. Oh my god. Get the fucking banana, you fuck. Come on, dude. Just do well. Do well. What are you doing? Maybe wait here a tiny bit more. What the f it's so fucking. No, no, no. You're not fucking rushing your way here and fucking me over again, you fuck. Come on, get up there! Get up there! Ah! My god! You fuck. Almost fell. This one is not too bad. Maybe, maybe this is this could be the the chosen one, the chosen run, the Messiah. Ah! What the fuck? Sometimes I don't know what the fuck are you doing. Can you? Fucking goes nuts. There we go. Ho ho! Okay, we're cooking here. We're kind of cooking. We're kind of cooking. Oh, this one. Well, this one you can fuck around too much with the time. It's pretty straight. Pretty, pretty straight. Let's go. Let's go. Slow down. Slow the fuck. Nope. I can't. I can't. Fuck off. I can't keep losing lives here. Oh my god, you greedy pig. pig. Oh. Ooh. No, you're not fucking rushing on the spark shit again. You fucked me up that one time. Ah, fuck off, fuck off. Ah. Come on. Come on, man, you fuck! Get the fuck out of here! I need to beat this sh Come on! You need Fucking forgetting you need a banana's butt. No, 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 don't. You're not losing other lives here. Oh, great. Now my mustache is itchy. Fucking. Leave me the fuck alone. Ah. Come on, man. It's the end. The, the last ah fuck no not doing that shit again you take it easy here okay don't fuck around just go slow fuck you now. fuck you shut up just get in there no shut up you motherfucker Shut the fuck up, buddy. Go get the banana. Get the banana now. Thank you. I want to go back because if this level is easier if you try to cheat. And CRT writer said you pass the floor 15. Yeah. So this level, thank you. This level is easier if you cheat. I saw Joe from GameSack doing all kinds of crazy shit. Uh, I'm not on that level yet. Because I do want to, I think, after I beat, 
I want, I have a, I'm a man on a mission here, a mission of mercy. I need to beat the regular mode. Then after that I can fuck around and I want to do some fuckery. You know, go around. But I definitely know what you mean, because I saw Joe from GameSack playing this and he's a... Uh, yeah, he's all, no, he does all kinds of very fun shit, like bouncing around and stuff. And then getting to the go shortcuts. But I want to do sort of like go through the, uh, the motions here. In a certain, like in a regular way, if that makes any sense. But yeah, I, I seen people like when you get used to this. No, no, what you, what? Fucking hell! Get in there. This one is good enough. Stick with this one here. Hey oh I do want to see people like I want to see. Well, I heard Joe from GameSec talking about the game and playing a tiny bit, but he does, he did actually stream it and is very good at, he's very good at this game, apparently. So, let's try to, don't hit the thing, man. Can you get an extra life? What happened? I'm disoriented. Uh, that's it. It's over. I lost my, I lost my mojo. Let's, fuck off. Fuck you. Don't communicate with me. Oh my god, what do you do? Yeah, no chance. Shut the fuck up. Better Mile says, I've been in the market for CRT for years. I can't get a good price on one. It was the one in garage sale, but the guy wanted too much. What are you looking for? Like a big CRT, a small 14 inch? Uh, 20 inch. What sort of CRT are you on the market for? I'm wondering. Get the banana! Oh my god. What are you doing, dude? You're losing it. You're losing it. There we go. Got a ball game here now. But this this corner here can be merciless. Don't, don't fucking lag behind. You need to be... Those things will... Oh my god. No, no! You're fucking rushing me! Oh, fuck off. Fucking rushing me here, man. What's the problem? What's the fuck? What's the fucking turn? What's the banana? Oh my god. You keep fucking around! That's the problem here! Grab the fucking bananas now! Can't lag behind, dude. Turn around quickly and get it, get it done. Don't, don't, don't fart around here. Don't fart around here. It's rushing me. Slow the fuck down. Oh my God. <laughs> get in there. I right, see you're looking for something that has a loose ass video 14 20 inch range would be cool i want to play silent hill one or three oh they're awesome games on a nice crt with good cables i know people dis dismiss it a lot but that's how i got most of mine have you checked ebay uh sometimes they have sellers that have some experience i know there's a lot of horror stories but sometimes you get sellers with uh, good experience packing and sometimes you can bug them to pack it well send them a link to a video showing how to pack a CRT. There's one on, on YouTube, uh, one minute, two minutes long, and showing the guy double box and how to pack. I, I tend to send a link to the seller and tell him, listen, this video show you how to pack it. I'd rather you take a longer time. Don't worry about shipping it quickly. Worry about shipping it good. And so far, most of it has been awesome. And if you stick with 14 inch, if you go past that, no, things get quite difficult. And uh, yes, video, yes, video is good. Ready? I'm ready. Are you? <laughs> no, no. Get that one. What the fuck? No, no. There we go. Yeah, Silent Hill on the CRT is where it's at, man. I'll be playing the second and the third one. I already did that stream on the first one. Got stuck in nowhere land there for, for a fucking gazillion years. Okay, so I think last time I went this way. 
Will you fuck off? Get in there. I'm not, I don't know. I, I, I wanna go. I wanna have a shot at that. No! No! What are you do? Oh my god, this asshole. Honestly, what the fuck are you? No! Damn it! Ah, oh, fuck off. Bad and Well says, I, I need those pure blacks, the motion clarity, that instantaneous re response time. Bingo. Uh, I was going to say that, Jerome, because, you know, people go on about the, uh, what's it called? Yeah, because all ads have come a long way to response that, but most sample and hold can never be overcome on, on the flat. Well, can never right now. It's motion cleared. I hate the fucking blur when I see modern games. It's, ah, the motion blur, right? The, yes, this, because sample and hold you just cannot, it's, a, it's inherent, in, is it inherently part of the technology. Just, you, there's nothing you can do about it. And CRTs, uh, they don't have that. CRTs are awesome. I mean, I'm happy, happy for y'all, old lads, and all that. I'm still stuck on a shitty LCD train, but uh, CRTs for me personally here, man, they are, they do. Oh man, I wish you could see what I'm saying in person here. This this monitor, I remember first time I turned on, I was don't fuck around, turned it on, and I was like, whoa, so nice. This is so nice. I, you know, it is very good. I mean, there's a reason I like it. Why, why the fuck would I like CRTs if they're garbage? The fuck would I... You know. I got a nice CRT monitor. It has black frame insertion, so nice motion clarity. But damn, the black levels suck. Backlight bleed. Yeah, the motion clarity, though, you have sample and hold, though. How, how you get overcome that? I, I noticed. That's, for me, that's the main thing when I play on flats. I need the lives. Can you please? Jesus. I thought. How about how about uh? Because he was talking about him well about the black frame insertions. Well, how do, how the black levels right suck? But I thought that all of them had good black levels now. How about an OLED? Is that an OLED? Isn't the OLED individually like sort of like a CRT? This, yeah, the year is 2000. I want an LCD. It's the future. The year is 2023. Wait a minute. CRT is used to rock. I got hyped to buy an inferior product. Pretty much. And because people go like, why would they, why would they change to, to, to flat panels if if they're worse? Of course, it's newer. Is better. No, you got to think about production. Have you seen like compared? Oh, this is insane here doing this. The technology. Have you seen the videos of Sony? how they, they manufacture this. It's insane. And LCD monitors are so much cheaper. They're lighter, way better to ship. Everything, and the customers like it because HD. HD has nothing to do with fucking being flat panels. Flat panels came out and they're like stuck on 720, 720 and 1080i forever until 1080p, big thing. CRTs were already doing 1440p, all kinds of fucking, because people say CRTs are thinking grandmother's zenith, right? But they had the VGA monitors already do a lot of that stuff. Already did. HD was alive and well. It was not new. It's not new with fucking flat panels. It was a win win, and the customers eat it up, and it was good, and uh, people moved on. You know? And now you go like, well, they're evolving a lot better, yeah, but look at how long it's taken for them as far as gaming, because that's what I care about, uh, to catch up with CRTs, you know, with the OLEDs now. Uh, but I, and, and then you have some problems, they have the sample and hold, they have it. There's guys who, this, the same way there's guys who are fucking toxic as fuck with the CRT and say, hey, flat panels are all garbage, that's all nonsense. I play my modern games. Listen to me, listen to what's gonna happen here, okay? What is this? Get out. Because uh, I was talking to a lifer the other day. Now, I got a PS5 here. Okay? So I... The only thing I have here, though, that will do in, in 
an acceptable 16 by 9 format b because of the mask is that BVM that I have. BVM D14HF-H5E, uh, right? But I honestly, as because I'm not a fanboy of CRTs like that, like you, you might think, I, I'm happy with the flat panels on HD. I usually play my game, my HD games on a flat panel. So, but because I'm streaming here all the time, I'm having a hard time to discover my PS5. I'm gonna have a couple of days off, but you know that's not enough. I want to dive into the consoles, right? But I don't want to do. Th so the only way doing it would be logical is be here on stream. I don't want to put. Put a, a flat panel here because I'm CRT racks. It doesn't make any fucking sense. You know, I, I don't want to do that. So, but at the same time, I don't want to be forever playing my very new, brand new games, PS5, on a tiny BVM. Maybe if I have a D24 or, God forbid, a D32 series, D series 30, 32, that is, or an FW900, I would be happy to do it. So what I'm thinking of doing here at the same time so I can play the games and still do my channel thing, and I don't care if you disapprove, uh, I'm gonna buy a 4K TV, as light as I, I can, maybe finally get an OLED, I don't think so, they're too expensive, I'll, I'll be happy with an LCD for now. So I'm gonna put a Viz amount here, which is like an arm, right? And I'm gonna have the, the flat screen on top here, a big one, oh, is the size. And then I'm, I'm studying right now how to downscale 4K to 1080p and then 10, 1080p to either 1080i or 720p so I can mirror on the CRT. So you'll be looking at me playing PS5 games or Xbox Series X games and all that for the first time here on the TV, which is the point of the channel. But then at the same time, I'll be buying on, on top of it. I'll, sorry, I'll be playing on top of it, buying on top of it. I'll be playing on top of it. Now I'll be playing here, the TV will be out of frame. See here? The flat panel will be here. I can sit and look at it just fine. And then I'll be mirroring it to the CRT here. So, but you'll be very aware, because I'm transparent. I'll be, I'm playing on a fucking 4K monitor here, the 4K TV, whatever. And the image is being mirrored to the CRT, which will look good. And I'll be ha I'm happy to play the game, but if I already played it, I don't like I don't want I don't like the idea of me playing PS5 on the BVM forever because I'm always streaming. No? So I don't I don't want to do that. I want to see I want to see the fucking 4K. Hey, I might, I might be a boomer, but I want to I want to see the future as well, you know. But I don't want to. This is a channel about CRTs. So I don't want to I don't want to throw out CRT start with the flat panels here because it's dumb. I don't want to do that. So that's the idea. I'm having a as they say, have your cake and eat it too, you know? And you, you get the content here on a CRT, what you sign up for, and but you'll be aware that I'm playing here, because I don't mean, you're playing on a flat pen, what kind of CRT fan? I'm not a CRT fanboy. I, I play flat pen. I'm excited about having an OLED someday. I really am, you know? Uh, so that's what I'm, what is in my head here to do. The problem I'm having right now is to, to go from this set, the 4K, because I don't want to do 1080p either. Or this, you know. then, if I have to do 1080p, then I, I'll be happy with the 1080i. It's fine on the on the CRT then. I want to see the 4K shit. It's 4K 60, right? And I want to mirror it here. So that, that anyway, that's what I have in mind. So it will be a while. I have I have the, I I haven't fucking so okay, I'm, I'm streaming here. I haven't fucking tested my PS5. I, I bought a PS5 on you know, monthly installments it, on on discount. So I'll be a fool not to. I don't I don't even know if I told Jerome, but I haven't had chance a chance to play the fucking thing. So if I was streaming here, if I had this thing set up, I'll be playing PS5 today. I'll be playing Astro Astrobot, whatever it's called. I wanna so. Right now, I'm gonna wait until it's my day off. I'm gonna be Monday and Tuesday. If, if I'm streaming here every day, the plan should be Monday and Tuesday off. I think this is a low day. So Monday and Tuesday. And, and then, you know, gives me time to sort those things out. I need to change the belt on my Famicom disk system. There's little mods here and there, give me some time. So I'll be off, but not really kind of working on hardware. Yeah. I bet if you do that, I'm very interested in I get, if you get to do that, I'm very interested in downscale. I, I downscale, listen, I, there's a, that GBS uh, control. GB, GBS control, that's what it's called. The name is, fucks me, I keep swapping the S and the C. Uh, you downscale one time, because uh, it downscales 480 to P to 240 P. So I play 
I play some modern uh, sort of, well, so for me they're modern, Xbox 360 games at 240p. I was expecting to be a very gimmicky thing to do. It was not. I played Left 4 Dead. It was 100% watchable, 100%. It, there was nothing weird about it. I think maybe if a game has very tiny text, that's a problem, you know? Uh, and also, I like to see flat panel and CRTs at the same time. It's something I like to do. So I have the hydro switcher. It has two outputs. I love it. I can compare things. And you got to be careful judging something. For example, we had the other day, what was the console? Fucking hell. Was it a GameCube? Oh, it was the N64. And was, uh, uh, but it was a 2D game. Some Warrior game my wife was playing. So I had it on a CRT. And, oh, because the N64 digital, so it's dual output. And it, it, it was plugged in on HDMI at the time, all the time. And we looked, she looked at the screen and it looked, it looked shit on the flat panel. She was like, nah. But then turns out the collar was wrong. The collar was all the way down or something. I put the collar, it looked nice. It looked okay, you know, it looked clear, sharp pixel art. So just so y'all know, I'm not, I don't have, I'm not a rabbit CRT because I don't like those people. I don't like people that go like, if it's not CRT shit and, and they go like, ah, oh, flat pen, the only way to do is like this. And I don't like the people on a flat pen that say CRTs are garbage, they're good for nothing. And, and they, cause they get fucked too with their arguments. It's just balance, you know, balance. I like my CRTs, man, I, obviously, fucking obviously. I'm obsessed with them, you know? But uh, I do like the flat panels here, so. And Shiro Bene, uh, I will be doing it. It will happen, that's a plan, because otherwise, when the fuck will I ever play those consoles, you know? Uh, so yeah, and Series X, Series S, whatever the fucking thing is called, I'm gonna, I wanna play Scorn, Scorn in there, but it's a very artistic game. I wanna see big, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna the whole show, you know? So that's the plan. Cause yeah, I plan, I, this is the, the idea that I had, but I was always bound by some shackles. Let's just stream regularly. I love it, I like it, I, I enjoy this. I, I don't enjoy the shed being hot, but it's part of the game, I guess. Please get that banana. So yeah, and then that way will be uh, will work nicely. I'll see. see if we, oh no, those things here, man, they're crazy. You're crazy, bitch. Fuck off. Ah. Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Don't fucking push me, motherfucker. All right. All right. Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Don't go too far! Don't go too far! Don't go too far! What the f <sighs> Okay, that was, come on. See, I love a small LED PC screen, 4K for stuff like that. Oh, I can even pay for a normal LED monitor. Scorn is wonderful, but for that you need a great screen. Yeah, I wanna play this because I'm a big a HR Giger fan. I like his work. Oh, let me just stretch my let me stretch my fucking legs. That was bull crap. Let it be known. Acknowledge it. What do you want from me there? Bouncing all over the place, you freak. Oh, you said I love a small OLED monitor. How does anybody know here that the OLED crowd? How small can an OLED be? What if, with 4K? Like with 4K, uh, is there like a like a like a 25 inch or something, something on the smaller side, or is everything fucking 50 inch, 40 inch? Is there anything on the smaller side, but not to the point that it's so small? Then in 4K it doesn't mean shit. I guess if it's very tiny, I don't know if it does mean. But uh, w can you get like is yeah? You'll be good if I don't have a gargantuan thing. I don't know if, how would I do a very big screen here. So I wonder how. What, what would a small OLED PC screen be for in 4K? How, how small do they get? Oh, that's right, Sony phones. So, but how about a monitor? I mean, I'm, I'm not, I'm not gonna play on a Sony fucking phone, that's for sure. Then I might as well go for the CRT, you know what I mean? What size 
you want if you could choose 32 inch that'll be my perfect size for me 32 inch is is my go-to maybe 36 but I don't think they do do those no more I have 32 and they'll be good for here that'll be that'll be perfect 32 they do exist it's not looked before maybe I used the wrong terms uh, 32 will be 32 will be awesome. If I could get a 32 4K OLED monitor, that'll be fucking fantastic. Yes, I did. What am I doing wrong that I can't find the fucking things? 27 is a bit smaller than what I would like, but it, it will do. I'll be happy with a 27. I'll look up if there's a big one. Thank you. Yeah, 36, and then I go to 40, I think they're pretty common, right? I've been seeing a lot of them. I think 32 or 27, yeah, 27 will be good. 20, I can put it right up here, you know, somewhere. I think 27, I could even work without the, oh yeah, because uh, another thing, my hands will be here. So I want the, mon the, the thing on top here or on the side here in a way that my hands are here. The, so it'll be no change to the format in any way, shape or form. It'll be what you've seen here, except my gaze will be, towards the and of course i'll be looking at the crt as well because i do enjoy it but my gaze will be towards that the aforementioned monitor the theoretical oled monitor so that'll be something that'll be cool then i'll be playing i'll be playing modern but hey here's the thing too that i want to make clear for whoever's watching this and you're into the games I'm, I'm playing lately here there'll be a time i'll come here to play the atari 2600 you're not going to be into it just so we're clear uh, and I'm gonna do it anyways. I will. I will watch the views plummet with great gusto because if I, I want, I don't want to ignore the older shit. I, I mostly, I am mostly into the NES, and then I would say the SNES, and then going up to the PS2. The PS1 is already kind of modern to me. It feels modern to me. Sorry, sorry if that doesn't go with the narrative. It's just the PS1. When I play the PS1, I'm not feeling really retro. It's it's kind of retro. Uh, not that it means anything, but I'm just saying what I'm feeling here. So, but I'm, I'm mostly like NES, but I want to give like, right, I'm starting a channel, I'm new. I want to do a, a huge variety of stuff to make sure that I'm not tied up to anything. So to make sure that when the people are here watching, the ones that stay there staying here, mainly because they're watching me and having fun somehow with my bullshit, you know? not just the content so you'll never be a day that i'll play a game let's say i play i don't fucking know i played S street fighter six or something I, I don't fucking know just an example and i got one dr evil amount of views and subs right followers whatever and then the next day i played some other game and nobody's into it yeah don't care like i'll never I'll never be a, uh, I'll never be like playing just one game. I seen YouTubers doing that. It's sad. It's sad. It's very sad. Like they're playing, they're playing, they're playing a game, and they have their regular viewers, right? A lot of viewers. The minute they get off the fucking game or franchise, the, because God forbid they want to try something, the views plummet, and they they coward. Not, not in a bad way. They they they, you know, maybe they need the cash. So. Then they go back, and then they wait a tiny bit, and they play something out, the views plummet, you can see, it's, it's forever there in his, and then they just go back and continue to play the same game forever. And then they get very fucking, look up, uh, what, uh, Wings of Redemption or something? Playing uh, Call of Duty, and he said he hates the game, he fucking hates, but he plays for the money, he said, if you pay out. It's a very toxic, I don't want none of that here. I wanna play, I wanna play different stuff. If I could play the Magnavox Odyssey here, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking about that one I showed. Ah, that one I showed you all yesterday. I will do it. I never want to be. I never want to be chasing fucking views on that shit. I want to be a rebel. Uh, the hipster of views. The the views are ah fuck. Jeez. Ah. Mother. Oh, I w if you're sentient, I will kill you. Look what you've done. Oh my god, you fucking... I, I don't understand.
I don't... Get out! I don't know what those things are. Move! Oh my god! It's like the piston thing. What? What is it? What, what the fuck is this shit? What are those things? Are they... Sentient? Are they... Aware? Do I need to be step away from them or... They become self-aware. I'm, I'm not... I'm not getting it! I'm too... Simple to get it. I'm not... I get there, I'm going... It's like those things from that other state. Like, look... What is that? Move. There's no pattern here? Look at this. What is this? What am I looking at? Oh, they move as I move? I got it. Well, too big brain for me. Fucking up. Okay. Move. I got it. Wow, that's that took me a while to get that. I got it. I got it. All right. Settle down. No, no. He di you did that last time! Motherfucker. Motherfucking monkey bastard. Get, get up there. No monkey business. There we go. I had to pick some beer from the corner. What I mean, it's not much. We're talking about old lads and things. I need motion clear to sample and hold. It makes me sick every time I pan the camera in. The game is so bad. It is. It is a bit of a problem. Yeah, the sample and hold thing. And there's no, there's no way to overcome it right now. I mean, they can do a lot with the other stuff. But I heard a lot of that black frame insertion. That's what that is. Address some of those issues. I'm not. I know the sample and hold cannot be physically overcome. That's what I, what I was led to believe in my many readings. I'm not, I'm not rooting for the demise of flat screens. I hope they get better and get to uh, address all those things. Yeah, I'm not gonna throw my CRTs in the trash. That's, that's not happening. Because there, yes, yes. Fuck. Oh, finally. There's a nostalgia factor too. Absolutely, absolutely. There's no sound. Some guy goes, like, so what if you have nostalgia? Not allowed to have nostalgia now. I have nostalgia for things. Are you kidding me? Crazy. Get down there and get some stuff. Get the... I don't know how the fire got to fall from upstairs. That's not happening. Look at the timer. Are you crazy? No, no, no. Ow! You mother... No. I got four, come on, come off it. You have to be able to do this now. It's just, it's, uh, never gonna happen with that speed, my good sir. No! Yeah, fuck, you tried. What, why, why you do shit like this? Fuck you! What is that? What was that? Fuck. Just get up there. That, the fuck you, bananas. Fucking shove them, you know where. Why are you doing this to me, you motherfucker? What'd I do to you? Get in there! Get in the fucking... What? What is happening? Slow down? Me. Oh my god. Fuck you. Holy shit. Can you see there? Black frame does help a lot. The UFO motion test online. Can you see every detail of the UFO, the alien movement? Now I know the alien thing, yeah. Oh, that's good. Well, if you're happy with that, with it, then you... Oh, yeah, if you're playing there. I said the thing that we... There's another thing. I was talking to a guy once. He said there's no need to, to, to have the CRT and blah, 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 and this and that. And I forgot the PS1. Even with the PS1 digital and stuff, I don't like the way the PS1 looks on a flat screen. It just... Uh, I don't know. It, it doesn't look right. It's, it doesn't look good to me. It just doesn't. Okay? I, I, it, very different. Like... 
What's that? Like, 2D games, I don't mind. Like, it's good. Like, it looks sharp. It looks clear. The colors are bright. You get your scalers in there. But I'll say uh, PS1 in particular. I even got, like, the um, the N64. I think, I, much of my surprise, the N64 digital. I thought that looked good. I, th I, I, I think it looked good. Uh, Splay Mario was very sharp and clear. It was nice. I liked it. Uh, the N64 digital and uh, but PlayStation 1 for some reason I just don't fucking like it. I hate the way it looks on the on the flap. Not we're not doing the banana. It's just straightforward here. If you grab a banana, so no fuckery, no fuckery. Control, maintain, maintain. You fuck. Don't start. Don't fuck around the last bit. There we go. Oh, this was the oh this place was hard oh man this is a oh no i realize you can't you can't you can't start up start a wait if you you don't need to go maybe don't wait that long ah no what the fuck <laughs> fuck you Fuck you, fuck you. Get in. Get in! Fuck beep, 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 beep. Alright, I need to beat this. It just this looks like the Amiga logo. Got the Amiga there. So here we come again, huh? You goofball! Oh my god, I could lose all my lives here, please. That would destroy me mentally. How oh, many continues? Three. Come on, you can't possibly. Oh, shut up! Don't jinx it. Don't jinx it. Where's the other one, you jackass? Fucking take forever. Okay, we'll go this way. This. Let's start here. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up, you fuck, you fuck, you mother. Ready? Stay the fuck away and try to avoid this asshole. Is that even possible? Look at this. Shut up, dude, shut up, don't touch it. I'm going. The time is going, dude, the time, motherfucker. Out of control here. Mm, fuck. Oh my god, my containers are all gone. Oh no, I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna fucking make it. I'm not gonna fuck. I can see it. This whole fucking place is gonna eat all my fucking lives. How the fuck am I? Okay, maybe this. Fuck off! This side. Start here. Oh my god, I did. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Ah, oh no, man, I'm gonna die here. I'm gonna lose everything. I'm gonna lose every fucking thing because of this. Whoa, whoa, what are you doing, dude? Calm down, man. Why you keep moving all the time? Calm down! I'm gonna, I'm not gonna make it. 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 This is insane. This is insane. This is insane. This is insane. Why are you moving so slowly? Shut up! Get up there! Oh my god, no! Shut the fuck up with a fucking goddamn mother. You fuck. Fuck off out of here. Fucking. F is my last continue? Right? It is! What the fuck am I looking at here? I don't mind any save. This one. What the fuck? What is this shit? What is this shit? Fuck you. Fuck you, bitch. Fuck you, bitch. Get up there. Get up there! Oh no, I don't want to repeat everything again because of one fucking stage. How can the, di the difficult went too crazy? Can you slow down? Fucker. 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 Slow down. Fucker! You fuck! Slow down! Shut up, shut up, shut up! How the fuck am I gonna make this? 
Look at him. Look at him. He's out of control. Shut up. Shut up. Quiet. Are you fucking slowly ninja? Fuck you. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Yeah. Fuck. You fucking nuts. This is nuts. I nearly fucking died in there. They're all my continues. Holy fucking shit, that was fucking stressful as fuck. I did it, I, I, I'm free. I can have fun with the game now. I did a challenge that I, I wanted to do, I can. Oh, fucking hell, that was fucking, that was high stakes. That was fucking crazy. <laughs> Where's my fucking whiskey though? Hey, we got it. Thanks everyone. Jeromba don't know. Shiro. I'm sitting here, 32 inch, 34. Didn't read more. Send me the link, please, Shiro. Thank you. Hey, yo, gotta stretch my legs here. You got 300 points. I, that was the last stage, right? Of the thing. And then it'll be the credits. Let me just stretch up. I really thought it will send you back to square one. I thought too. with the smallest options 42 inch monitors they're few or less 27 32 inch version that costs like 3k now if it costs 3k 3k fuck no ah uh, oh you see that far up uh, yeah about about like five messages scrolling is what is hard going scrolling yeah the mouthwash doesn't have alcohol battle mouth so even if I was that desperate, I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't, it, it doesn't taste good, you know, I, I like the, the, the taste of the whiskey, I don't like the taste of mouthwash. You can unlock one mini game, at least one, you can check it out. I'm happy because about, yeah, about seven hours, so I can fuck around here for a couple of hours and that'll be it, yeah. I'm not doing fucking expert, if you're here to watch expert, it's not gonna happen. Not, not tonight, I, I, how do I save this game? Is it auto save? Because I don't want I I want to return to it to do the uh, the expert, yeah. But uh, n not today. Maybe if I had started earlier, I will play a tiny bit and see how it, how it goes. It is very addictive. It is very stressful though. That that last one, that one, that one got me. Ah fuck! How the fuck am I gonna escape that one? Come off it. Ah, man. Oh, okay, I'll take... Can you stop? Thanks. There we go. See how many bananas. I'll look at the chat in a bit. I'll focus here and try to... Nah. Fuck! What I hate is that so many hits! Should be like... Fucking be bopping around here like a fucking pinball. Fuck off. Too much. Like you you got hit one you hit one. How the how many fucking times are gonna bounce up and down here in this mother? No, I don't like that. That last one was holy shit. Fucking hell man. That was something. Jerome says you're not, not real. No, I wouldn't. I was scared of going back. I hate repeating things over and over. I was very... I thought I was going to. There was no way. I thought that was it. It sort of breaks your spirit. Like, if you do well on everything but one level, like, it kind of gets me. Like, fucking hell, I did all this shit for nothing. Oh, did all this shit for nothing. <laughs> okay, a little bit more bananas here than the last time. And watch me lose everything immediately. Fuck you. Fucking hell, brutal. I hear you. Calm down. Fuck off. Alright. Nice and great in here. Come out. Can get to a 500 maybe somehow. Oh. Oh. Damn you! Holy fuck! Stop! I'm 
wanna see how many. Oh, what, what the? F <laughs> Fucking hell. Monkey voice. Wasn't there some monkey business with a voice actor? I remember something to do with a voice actor. I can't remember. There's some shenanigans. Come on, give me 500. Nah, fuck you! You avoided that. Ah, fuck, come on. Give me 500. I just, I don't know why I need. No. You fucking piece of shit. Holy fucking, that's a lot of letters. Come on! 500 here. Give me the fucking 500. Don't you take that away from me. <laughs> fucking cunt. Fucking cunt, cunt, cunt. Look, the go is here. You can leave me five fucking banana short. Yeah. Life is cool sometimes. Okay, let's see. Let's see here, and then I'll look at the chat. Hey, hey, hey. Woohoo! Woohoo, woohoo, yeah! Hey, bitch, yeah. Fucking hell, shut up. Okay, let me enter my name here, and then I'll look at what you're saying there, Shiro. Just a minute. C R Q. Oh, fuck off. Off the camera, dude. Jesus. Back off a bit. The Amiga logo. Thanks for playing. You're welcome, my good sir. It's been a pleasure. It's been real. All right, let's take a look what we got here in the chat. Hoop. You here? Okay, what do you got here? Uh. Okay, so you see the program? The extra in the credits. The screen on top would be about 1.5 arm lengths away from your eye. Yeah, be about here. Yeah. I use 42 antique motors here. Hey there. 42 LG OLED is the desktop monitor, and I need a deep desk for those two in your face. Yeah, that would. Oh, holy shit, the 42 inch, like right in front of you. I'll be some fucked up shit. I'll get I'll get fucking dizzy or something. So yeah, if it's an arms and maybe so what also what are you trying to trying to uh, determine there if it's uh you might be okay to be a smaller one, yeah. I don't want something that is redundant. Like if if because it's the size. For me that's the one thing the CRTs can most of them can touch. They they can touch it. Uh, the flats the size, the sheer fucking size of it. That's fucking I got a fifty five inch, yeah. There's no CRTs that are 55 inch. Fucking rear projectors. I don't want none of that. Uh, there's a 40 inch. Keep in mind that a 40 inch like would be bigger than a 40, the 4x3 because they're way taller. Uh, like I have a 36 inch widescreen CRT and a 34 inch uh, standard 4x3 CRT, and this, the standard is way higher, like bigger the screen, like going that way. Uh, bigger than a 36 even, but not this way, obviously. Uh, but yeah, because I don't, what I mean, I don't want something redundant. Is like, uh, I don't want something that'll be just slightly bigger than a CRT. So that the, my CRT is 14 inch, but with the mask, I think it would be even less. Yeah, so 14 inch widescreen that's quite small. If I had a D, a BVM D24 even, I think I would have been okay with it. Then you know, uh, the 32, then I'll definitely be okay with the 1080i or 720, 720p. I myself have a 32 inch, about, about one, one and a half arm lens away. Jerome says I have 325 LG 21.9, basically a wall of screens. I seen this big, his setup is pretty sweet. It's pretty cool. It is pretty cool and it helps you with your work, doesn't it? Just sitting back here, trying to bit and relax. I'm happy I got, I got the normal mode. If I, if I couldn't beat the normal mode in this game, I'll feel like a fucking failure. I don't think you'll see my face here yesterday, tomorrow. I'll probably hide somewhere and never come back. You know, cause <laughs> I like the character. This game is cool. Very, oh, the baby! Look at the baby! Oh my god! 
There's a baby in there. Huh? You gotta see my daughter. She's a baby. She's just turned one. The cutest thing. Babies are cool. Bit sad, I think, is my last baby. Nah. You sure says picture at? See his setup. He's got he's got the monitors. I'm gonna have a smoke here. Hoo! And then uh, fuck around. Fuck around here a bit uh, for an hour. I think eight hours a day is enough for me. Uh, so another hour here fucking and goofing off. Well, eight hours of the gameplay. Then I'll do the uh, I do the hardware showcase. It's not a lot, really. I mean, with this monitor show, it's not like the uh, Sony that had a gazillion fucking inputs of all sorts. But probably the GameCube is sort of interesting if you haven't seen it before. Uh... Which you haven't, because I have never streamed with the GameCube, so only, I think maybe I showed them one. I used it once for Resident Evil 4, which was a very different style. I had a bunch of crap everywhere. It didn't really work out for me. So the, the GameCube is interesting, that's for sure. The, the, the monitor here is pretty basic. It's a VGA monitor. It's a VGA on the back. I mean, it's cool what it can do here. It's fucking awesome. That's what I love it. You can, look at this. It's shit that you're doing a, a consumer TV is a pain in the Even BBMs, you gotta go to a fucking menu. That's annoying as fuck. That's why I love the the BVM 2011P slash 19 BVM 1911. It's fucking awesome because all, all the controls. Oh, look, you can even change languages. Huh? English, Espanol, Francois, Deutsch, Italiano. Yeah, very cool. I love VGA monitors, they're awesome. I don't know how the hype is for them now because they've been, everybody's losing over the Twin Neutrons and you can get some very good VGA monitors. And before I had a, before I had a PVM in the thing, I uh, would have those, those VGA monitors and I use an OSSC and just double it. You don't need to go past it. You, you really don't, 480p. And, and it's optimal. And if, but the fake scan lines that people don't even like, but they work very well on a on a VGA monitor. It looks it looks like a BVM. It really does. They're very sharp. Okay, so Shear said, like I said, 42 inch at that distance, I feel like is a bit too big. But for slower games, or if you can find some somehow, I myself use a 30. No, I'll be I'll be happy with a 32 inch if it's this close here. I don't, yeah, 42 inch, I'll be, yeah, I don't think I want that here. And if I get, if I get a, if I get a big TV here that I have just see, if, put it away, then what's the fucking point, you know? No, I want something here right on my face. I don't, yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't, it just, again, I could sit close here to this set and have a gigantic screen, I mean, attacking it, like, here, I'm gonna get that anal about it, so I, I think 32 inch is, I have a 32 inch CRT in action me here, it's covered up, but I can see the size is perfect. So. Mr. Davis, I didn't even arrive since an hour ago. <laughs> see? It's not, it's not, see it now, give me a break. It's not just me that mixes up the names. I see what y'all doing there, you goofballs. Ah. See, I feel, I feel less bad now. This Monday and Tuesday, when I have the time off, I'm gonna clean up my living room. I'll take some pictures and send to y'all, like I promise. It's a fucking mess from hell in there. It's horrific. It needs to be changed immediately playing that that one does see this on full screen if it's holding up yeah looking good fellas looking good have a quick smoke and i'm gonna check what's are we doing this shit again second prep look the fucking box here Disgusting piece of shit.
Okay, having a quick, sm quick smoke. Smoking a pancake. Piping a crack. And then I'm gonna... What was my last nicotine pouch? Choose wisely. I think they're using the same emote, are they? Oh, the TV thing. Hmm. I have a boomer question here on Twitch for y'all. You see that there? Emote thing. So first your ROM is using one that says first. What what the hell is that? Okay, now the other one is while Jerome thinks about that the first thing. Was it not first? I don't know what that is that his own thing? So okay, so the, the little TV thing uh, that y'all have that I is the one that I, I said the badge. The badge called a badge. Uh, when I, the first time I, I because I'll say first is a badge when I subscribe. I think one the first subscribe was tier two. Okay, we get get the fucking headphones up. So I have a question here. When I went to uh, even before anybody subscribed, because it was after I became an affiliate and before I did my first stream as an affiliate, uh, I I did a pixel art of the TV quickly, right? And I didn't like the color, so. Twitch was not very clear about it. It said, I went to delete. I wanted to delete. And said, are you sure you want to delete this badge? And it was not telling me. It's like it, it, a, a, a message popped up and said, it will severely impact your, your subscribers if you delete this. <laughs> and, and it took me half an hour to build up the courage because I thought if I delete that, the badge will be gone. Like I have no slot for the badge anymore. So pardon me, but I think it should be a bit more clear. So I just wanted to change the image. I wasn't happy with the collars. So I changed that. So now, for example, uh, let's say I want to, I'm not happy with the, with the badge right there. And I, I, I go delete it. And if I just, I just want to re-upload an image, it should be, I just want to change, if I change the image, does that mean you lose the badge? Because Twitch gives me a very s stark warning saying that they will severely impact your channel. And Jerome has the number, the first there, is that from my channel? Because I didn't have time to do the, the other badge. I think I only had one badge I could do, I'm not sure. So if I if I was to change the badge, I'm not saying I'm going, I'm going to change the badge, but if I was to change the badge, that the badge there, the, the one you have now, uh, if I delete and upload a, a new, would it show up again? Oh, it says it just means that if you remove it, it don't have it because okay, you don't have one until you add a new one. So if I add a new one, because Twitch is giving fucking apocalyptic, uh, uh, like an apocalypse is about to happen. Like you're gonna, your subs are gonna be, they're gonna be angry. You know, they're gonna revolt against you. You you remove their. It's just, dude. I just wanted to change the image. That, that's all I wanted to do. I wasn't happy. The colors were wrong. It's not what I wanted. So if I. If I then replace it, it's not going to be like an apocalypse now. It'll be just you change immediately. So you have the new the badge, right? That's it. I can change it then if I if I needed to, if I needed to correct something, if I came up with a new system. So first is a badge I got when I subscribed. I think it was the first to subscribe to tier two. Okay. And. I wanted, a, so that badge I don't think I have control over. I think I can only change one badge. I think, I think Liffer was with me on that one when we were doing this whole thing. I can't remember, I think I can only do one badge. I can give Jerome a spec. See, I have a plan for the badges. I wanna, you see that there, it kinda sorta, it's very tiny. My is 18 pixel by 18 pixels. So I wanna do, I want to do it like a, it's like that's a consumer TV with a rabbit ears antennas, right? Right, antenna. So I wanted to do like going up, so you get like a sun until it's like the last one is like a fucking BVM or something. You can't change the first badge, but you, you can change the badges for all few months. So now I say you can't change the first badge. So 
So I cannot do it then. I thought I could do it. I thought I'd say I could just remove... If I remove it, it just until I put a new one. But I would say I can't change the first badge. I, I cannot. I thought I could. Am I dumb? Sometimes I feel like I'm stupid. Maybe, maybe the rumors are true. All right, me, uh, while I'm here. While y'all talk there, I'll go, uh, do some more playing here, why not? We already here. Check the expert. I'm not gonna fucking beat it. It's, uh, come off it. Not, not fucking happening, but, uh, unless, like, a, 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 a no, I just want to check it out. For all intents and purposes, I'm done here. That's what I wanted to do today. To the base game, you know, the re regular mode what else is here practice my competition mode i can play it oh i can't oh there's multiplayer here well this is definitely a game i want to play with it with my key on Let's see here can't play as for this is a baby but i'm the baby are they are they different or just aesthetics i wonder I'll play the baby. So I'm just checking. Don't get your hopes high here. Beating this. I wonder, I wonder if the baby is different. It's just I, I think it just looks. Is this faster? You can see it's already fucked up right in the beginning. That's just the first day. The Amiga logo. Holy shit. Okay. Just that. Why did? Why is there two? Ah! That's kind of fucked up to see the baby falling. I don't know why. Damn, this game is addictive. It is very good. It is very good, my good sir. This game is where it's at. This was a happy stream. I mean, I did lose a bit at the end. I, just, I always lose at a sign when you want from me. The, the, the last stage. Of it. There's always one that gets me. But everything else was like, wow. Okay, what is that fucking noise? The baby? Okay, well, that's... It's a baby, I guess. This one looks similar, but I guess maybe last time. It's interesting to see the stages here. I would definitely want to come back to this game. I hope it's... I, I guess saving don't matter, eh? What am I, what am I on about? No! Shit. Set, go. What am I look? Okay. Can I? It's easy, easy, man. Fuck. What are you doing? Sliding around here. No, fuck. Fuck that. Wow. All right. All right. I want to ask uh, y'all in the uh, Odd World. So the first Odd World in the uh, the first 3D one, right? On the Xbox, uh, the original, the OG. Uh, how, what game is similar to it? Like what we're we talking about, what, Mario 64, sort of like Banjo Kazooie. What? I haven't, I haven't had the time to look. I'm just wondering, what, what kind of game is similar to it? Like as far as the the mechanics, the game mechanics, like right, the feeling of it. Just wondering. Let's go, let's go. This game is excellent. This is... Whoa! Are you... No. Oh, ah! Fuck. Come on, come on, come on. 
Oh. And I... Oh, oh. It's, uh... Why is this leaper here, Dan? What are you doing there, Kimasabi? See... Why keep saying welcome to the chat room? Is this fucking stream dropping again? Keep saying welcome to the chat room for me here. That means that that is dropped, right? Check Twitch. Am I still on fucking Twilight Zone here on the Twitch? So many fucking problems. No, the game was fun, but let me tell you. The, the, the fucking pig farm is stinking again. All right, let me see here, because I know the time. No, it says seven hours. Why, why does it keep saying welcome to the chat room? And where's the stream elements? Why it didn't come in today? There was no stream elements. Yeah, no, I checked. Thank you, Jerome. So, so invisible us from my point of view. He keeps saying welcome to the chat room. I feel like I'm having a stroke here, a heat stroke. Just, okay, like how many times are you gonna say welcome to the chat room? And why are you telling me that? Okay, so Twitch. Which sometimes just randomly recognizes through the chat, or the chat just bugs. I keep, yeah, it keeps telling me welcome to the chat. The chat room is freaking me out here. You shut up with a welcome here. Thank you. There, there's a uh, there's politeness, and then there's madness. Just fucking welcome to the chat room for saying that. We get it. You, you're welcoming chat okay quick quick oh man so did the odd world master come to no it did so there you go so you did send a master about it i thought it was just uh, being a rude fucker and ignoring me so i, I i'm kidding so i no it didn't it went from the last master was that's a twitch emote that's the one that is when you're talking to your own and then after that it said he said, welcome to the chat room. No, like you say, I, I don't know what to compare it to, but not not like you said, Sekiro and the whatever the other fucking game is. The Shijiro, Nagasaki, I don't know. The other fucking game like there, that, that, that I said the same, I said, no, like broadly speaking. So, okay, so your chat was gone for a few minutes. It was then, I knew it. That's what I keep saying. So when it says welcome to your chat, it should say, fuck you, we dropped it. Instead of pretending to be polite here with, with me when you're fucking me over here. That's what's happening. Just fucking you over so you're welcome. It reminds me of an old movie I, I, I watched when I was a kid. I could never find out what the fucking movie it was. It was this alien guy. And he was saying, I come in peace and then kill people. So it's like, you'll be very polite about it, but then he'll kill you with a disc. I can't remember. I watched it while I was very young. He said, I come in peace. And he kept saying that and just shooting people with, with the thing. So for me, it would compare to with the art world, obviously, but I guess I mean, no, no. What do you mean compare to art? How can you compare the, a 3D game? No, I, I think, I don't know, maybe the chat bugged out when I said that. I mean, mechanics, so I, I mentioned mechanics. Like, like okay, like like Monkey Ball. If you replace Monkey Ball, I don't know, man, with, with whatever, but it's about Marble Madness, right? The, the aesthetics, but it's the same, it is a ball rolling and you gotta control it. So I mean the mechanics, mechanics wise, how does it feel playing the game? What is it 3D platforming? You have to jump a lot? It's like Banjo, cause there's like ukulele. What, Bubsy fucking 3D? Is it like Castlevania 6? Like, is is a 3D platform? It's more focused on platformer, platforming, or like Banjo Kazooie, more exploration. What what does the game entail? Like, Heart of Darkness. No, but I mean that's the original one, right? No, I mean the Odd World in the uh, because Heart, Heart uh, Pale Version. Welcome, by the way. Nice to see you. Is it Heart of Darkness? Uh, uh, no, yeah, no. I think you missed part of the conversation. Okay, <clears throat> no. I get that, that that has been established. I mean, the uh, good evening, my good sir. Now we're talking about the, uh, I'm curious about the first one on the Xbox that is uh, the, the, the 3D one. They went for 3D. Oh, there you go, more fighting. Yeah, that's what I mean. So just, cause yeah, like, so, okay. So more fighting. So like, uh, let me think here. Yeah. 
scorn will get a physical. Motherfucker, I knew it! I knew it. That's why I don't fucking buy. That's why I don't buy fucking digital. I would have been burned. I almost bought the fucking game. I didn't because I was like, I want physical. It's never gonna come out. That's what happened with me in Hollow Knight. When the game came out, the game came out, they say wouldn't there wouldn't be. There's no plans for it. And then I bought a digital, which I hate. I don't like it. I don't like fucking digital. I hate it. I don't fucking like it. So I so I bought it. And then before I got to even play the game, because it took me a while, they released the physical and I, I had to buy it. So with Scorn, because they're saying Scorn is coming physical, I was like, I don't want to buy it now. But I almost gave in. But then I start streaming here. I said, I guess there's no hurry for it, hurry for it, for it right now. But look at that. Dodge the bullet. Dodge the fucking bullet. Deluxe edi edition with soundtrack art. But look, look at that shit. That's that's it. I'm not buying fucking digital. Unless I'd like there's nothing else. Like literally, like the, the dig like physical is dead. I'm not buying digital anymore. I would have I would have gotten fucked there. Thank you for letting me know, Cheryl. I'm waiting then. I'm buying the I want the physical thing. I want the thing in my hand. Oh, you know, it's just a DRM line, and I don't fucking give a shit. I want the disc, and I want the, the box. I want it here, and I want it now. I'm not buying the digital. I'm, I avoided it. So, oh, well, here's here's the thing, though. Uh, that's curious. You said PS5. I thought, you know, the, the Xbox Series X, it's a good console, but I feel Spencer's out of his mind with the, the, the not having games for it. They're, they're, they're dropping the ball with the, with the games. They don't have, I think ex exclusives are sort of important for a console sales. I think so. So scoring, I, I always saw like, oh, they're, a tr I know, trying to justify the per purchase, right? I collect consoles, so whatever. I, I will buy both of them anyways. But I was like, I was kind of, Happy for the Xbox. I do wish consoles well. I don't want Xbox. Yet. I'm not a fanboy of PlayStation, so I'm, I am Sony TVs. I get that, the Trinitrons. But with with the consoles, I'm not. So I was wishing for the Xbox to have sun of its own. Yeah, but see, I thought it was. I thought that Scorn was an Xbox thing. You know, and in fact, I had an Xbox here. I just got the PS5 again. I haven't even used it yet. I haven't turned it on yet. So, I thought that it would be like an Xbox, but now it's coming out on the PS5 then. Which, which is, I guess is good in a way, but there goes the one thing I thought the Xbox uh, had that was like its own thing. Symphonia. It looks like Hollow Knight, then it's gonna be good. I love Hollow Knight, God damn it, I love Hollow Knight. That was, that, that fucking, man. You know what? Stay with me on that game. That little bug of the mind that is always happy and singing, and they come back. Look, I get I get chills talking about it. How can a game game affect you like this? You know, it's interesting to me. Stop! 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 Oh! Whoa! 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 Yeah! What the fuck! I hate that. Shit. I hate the bouncing up here. Okay. Fun, yeah. Well, yeah, Mr. Liffer, no, because hey, Mr. Liffer says Xbox barely get any physical in the stuff. You know why? Because they, their limit for physical is higher. They put a fucking limit that nobody can fucking reach. Very few developers can. So it ended up, that's why the Xbox has so many. They're dumb. What they're doing is dumb. They're literally trying to kill. They're pushing everyone. To the, that's what that is. They want to push everyone to the game pass. I am not buying another fucking digital. I don't care. And I don't care about Game Pass. I understand it's very cool for a lot of people and people love it. But for me, I don't have the interest in have a gazillion fucking games. I, I, don't, I don't like that. I prefer to have less games that I actually want, personally. You know? And the Xbox is usually if you got a good PC. That's true. But nah, kind of. Uh, you know... Even Charlie, the most critic, had a video. They, they're not optimizing the games on PC. Now, PC, you should be at top of the line and everything. The master race, right? But his original point, either crippling it with, with that fucking, what's the name of that thing that does the uh, check for piracy? Crippling the games, and then they're not optimizing the game. The games are fucking gigantic, unnecessarily gigantic, unnecessarily. They could have done better. I think the guy made, like, I read, like, two videos on it. But... 
the requirement. Gollum. Have you seen that fucking game Gollum? Go look it up now. Go on Google and look up the requirements for Gollum. I repeat, go look it up now, I, I beg of you. Go on YouTube and look up YouTube, no, Google, and look up the requirements for you for your PC to play Gollum. It's fucking ludicrous. Ludicrous. It's not as accessible as it once was. They're fucking it up. PC is is not is not is, is a has been. I'm sorry. The whole master race is 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 falling down. See, when you get a PS5, when you get an Xbox Series X, the advantage. You put in there, the game is made for you. don't have to do shit. You don't have to buy gigantic fucking expensive rigs of insanity. It works. Look, I watched Max, Maximilian dude play uh, Callisto Protocol on the PC and he ran like shit. He, he ran like fucking garbage, right? And he had, to get a, he had to get it on the PS5 and then he could stream. That's how fucked it was. PC, yeah, PC is fucking destroying itself for no reason. The sabotage is, I don't know, not optimizing the games. And then the fucking, I forgot the name, Noptua, what's the name? The, there's a thing that checks for uh, for piracy and it, it fucks up the games. It kind of fucks them up, you know? So. But it's true, but if the PCs weren't fucking around, yeah, there'll be very little reason to have an Xbox. If you have, if you have to have a fucking, some PC though now this. Gollum. Fucking Gollum. That shitty ass game that came out. That disgraceful game. Whoa! That disgraceful game that came out. Terrible. It's a goof. It looks terrible. I saw, I saw Charlie play it. You know, the, 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 not the stream. The, 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 what the fuck? I don't have time to watch the stream here. But uh, bit, bits and pieces of it, and it looked terrible. And then you need very high requirements. Very high requirements. Mr. Lewis says, "Mike, I love the that they like point and click games like the Pony because they're extremely good. So of course, I know Gollum. My heart bleeds so hard because it's so bad." It's, it looks so bad, man. I was like, I heard it was bad, but it's like, oh, they're exaggerating. It can't be that bad. No, holy shit. It looks, some of the textures, the Gollum himself, wow. That looks, man. And then it, it, on top of that, the game is fucking gigantic in size, ginormous, and has high requirements. Like, what the fuck? It's so bad. How the fuck did they fuck that up, you know? And, and it's a hell of a franchise. It could have had a, you know, a gold mine in there. They just, it's bad. It's like embarrassing, you know? It's sad. I feel sad for the developers. They probably, they probably work very hard and the timeline is probably, they always get fucked over and then they, they get the shit, but the company should get the shit. Whoever fucking had the timeline for that and approved. And, and then and the money they charge for it was like a very <laughs> full price, right? It's, uh, wow. Uh, I like point and clicks, Mr. Lefer, you won't be disappointed. And I think the CDI, I think, has a couple of uh, point and click. I love point and click. Uh, there was one that I play, I really hated it all, the Claymation one. I really like the art style, but the game itself, it, I didn't like it. I forgot the name of it. Came out in, came out in Japan only, but it's been translated. It was on a PS1, it was with a chicken. They have a sequel though. Check that out. But the first one, it, it made me go through some bullshit and it, I didn't like it. I, I, I didn't like the game. Ah! Uh, oh! Fucking hell. But I'm the baby. No! X Files. Those games are so good. And to be honest, I don't know why those games are so good to me. But... And a pal version, the X Files, is that related to the actual show? That like, it was just a coincidence. X Files, like, as in the, as in the X Files, like the the show, because I love that show. I have it on VHS. Uh, I mean, I'm not, not a gigantic fan of it or anything. I just like, I like the show. Come on, man, turn around. How am I supposed to go forward here? Huh. No, 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 you little prick. 
the truth is out there with the X-Files, Detective Point and Click. Oh, fuck, I remember now. Yes, I, I saw somebody reviewing it. Very interesting. And it's on the PS1, huh? Eh? Shit, I gotta, if I had a fucking keyboard, I'll write it down. I know I'll, damn it. Now I can scroll up, motherfucker. X-File, can't for, uh, okay, I'll tell you, my, my wife is, is in there. Uh, my dear love of mine, can you please write down X-Files, and while you're at it, X-Files and Heart of Darkness, I can't forget those two. And I'm aware the Heart of Darkness will have the Prince of Persia stuff, but I, I'm, I'm, I'll, I'm doing it. I did Odyssey, what's, you know? I keep saying Odyssey, it's Oddworld first, and Odyssey. Od Odyssey. Uh, x list X, sorry, x list what the fuck am I? Geriatric, fuck, x file Yeah, Heart of Darkness, that definitely something I wanna play, cause it gave me the Limbo vibes, you know? Fuck, and it's on the PS1, I love the PS1. I'm always looking for new games on the PS1. I'm sorry, baby. He's so cute, look at him. He's a tiny baby. Mm. Ready? Also, they're so endearing, all of that. Just reading what y'all saying to each other. I wonder if the baby control is different. That, it feels like, I don't know. It feels harder to control. This is kind of a fucked up uh, ramp here. <laughs> Trying to position myself here. Damn it, this is hard. I feel loose though, because I already did the uh, object, so it's more fucking around here, so I'm not. I think I'll come back to this game to do the expert. That's what I'll do. Someday. Like, uh, at some point. It is a very good game. Uh, no, I'll definitely do that. I think before moving on to playing this, uh, the second one, I want to. I feel like I need to do the expert someday. That'll be a hell of a stream. CRT Rex says, <laughs> "Don't don't forget to drink. I'll need a drink, definitely. I know this is gonna be. I would is the kind of stream that I'll go like. I need to start early for that shit." Shiro said, "Definitely Shiro. I do want to do though. I do enjoy relish the hell challenges. It's like a ghost and goblins. I'll do it some point soon here." Uh, again, uh, not again. I have never done. I've done in private. Ah. Um, that, I need to start earlier with that, there's no, I can't possibly come here late because that game is so fucking unpredictable. Like, you, you know, unless I, the, oh, you're kidding me. Oh, fuck. I should actually, what? Yeah. I need to turn my shit. The shed go off at least. I, ah! Mm. Monkey Island. Play the point and click if I'm stuck. Just I like to play those point and click games, and if I'm stuck, I just gotta help from the shed. It's good to have chat to help me out. I appreciate your help on uh, on Odd World. You were invaluable, definitely. It would have, oh, I, it would be. I mean, I, I would have been able to do it, but it would have been fucked. Even if that's even possible, more fucked than it already was. You know, and usually I don't like backseat gaming at all. But on on that ah fuck off. On that regard, that really helped me because uh, you know. The game was a little bit more complex than I, I thought it would be initially. I did have fun with it. I'm glad I played it. You know. I wonder if the baby feels different. I want to pick the regular guy here again. I get this in here. Holy shit. Come on. I want to pick the... Uh... There we go. Huh. 
pick the uh, pick the Rackler guy here. Just uh... thanks for playing. In the end, I did stop a bit with it, though. With it, you. Yeah, because in the end, I was like, I would like to. You know, it was more straightforward. You know, my favorite part of that game was though. You can tell that I'm kind of an NES kind of guy type of guy. I uh, the last bit, the one with the with the with the the one, the one the last part with the alarm and the bombs, that was my favorite part of the game. Uh, I like that challenge. I like that one. The last bit. Well, come to think of it, we didn't have time last time, but when I fell down, the right at the end there, I fell down because I was too fucking tired by then. I fell down. And I pulled the lever. What the fuck was that? Come to think, I haven't, I haven't asked you about it. What the fuck was that shit that I fell down? There's a lever, and they, they shot me or something. I understand it's a very bad ending, but I, I want to know that lever is that that I pulled right at the end there, the last screen. What the hell was that? That, that stuck with me. I, I didn't, I, I didn't fully understand what that was. Oh, you have to save the dude on the left before you go down. Oh, that oh that guy. Fuck, what a spot, no? What the fuck was he doing down there, dude? Oh, no fucking way, dude. I mean, yeah, way if I'm if I'm like out of my way doing it. I don't see myself ever ever ever. Um, I want to pick the, the I I here. Uh, I won't be 100% in that game. That's not like a game that I would like to 100% personally. Those, so okay, I'm gonna see here. Then you chant with that superpower and kill other room. Ah, oh, well, that would have been fun. Then you chant with a superpower. I, I don't know how in the fuck I would know about the superpower in there. The superpower was kind of weird, Mr. Lefer. It came and then it. I kind of never use it again. I, I kind of forgot it was even there. Now, I, I like literally forgot that power was in there because I think they could have used a little bit more often on some challenge or something. I don't know. Uh, I, I I forgot the fucking thing was even there. It became it was like this godlike power, and then I use it one time and then never again. So it fell. And then the ending, what you can do with without it, you have seen if you're fast enough. I, that was awkward. I. I think I saw, I saw pulling the lever. Did he pull it? It was a question mark for me. Did I pull the fucking lever or not? And that's, you know, I didn't think much at the time, but I'm just wondering if he meant, if he meant anything pulling the lever, or if I did, if he, did he complete the action of pulling the lever? And if he did, did he do something? Because it, it looked like the animation was there that I pulled the lever. But, uh, no, I just got shot instead. I mean, it always works, but it, it's not supposed to work. It was a, that was a glitch, I think, by, yeah. So it was a glitch that I was able to pull the lever, or is a bit, or is a glitch that... Ah! It was a glitch that I did, that I pulled the lever and nothing happened. Fucking hell, man, come off it. I want to go up there. Maybe just stop, huh? No limitations. I've been up there before, though. Since when I ran away from challenges? Get get the fuck back in there. I want to go. I want to go up there. Get the fuck up there. Fucking around here, you goofball. Mother. And Jerome says, I just checked, I had, uh, you did pull the lever fully, thank you. I, and Mr. Lefzer, yes, he did. Otherwise, the choose legs to knock him out, won't spawn, and he fails. Ah. So, so, yeah, I was wondering about that. So what was the glitch part then? What does the part that's not supposed to, to do? Because you mentioned a glitch. I just wonder what, what part, uh! You drunk? This guy's been on the fucking mouthwash. Come on, let's go, man. Just 
the hell's wrong with you here, anyways? Fuck off! Get up there! Look at this out of control, completely out of control. You, your, your behavior is unacceptable. Get in there. Because I'll miss you this. Well, he got. You get shot while they run to you and knock you out. So he technically can get knocked out from them and get into the end since you're already dead. So the glitch was that I. It was an awkward timing and I died, but the ending happened anyways. So you're telling me you do something on that screen if you're not quick enough with the lever, you don't get the ending, you have to repeat everything again? You're supposed to. I mean, I, 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 it was quick thinking there on my, uh, on, on the lever, if I may say so, if I may be so bold. But, uh, so if you don't pull the lever, you don't get the ending? Or the ending will be different. Better, perhaps? I'm curious about that. I'm interested in this. What the fuck? You motherfucker. You need a lever for the end. That's kind of fucked up. You get that? That was a real quick thing. And so I, I did the right thing by pulling the lever down. Oh, that's good. I don't know. I just saw the lever and I immediately had the urge to. Shoot, shoot, shoot. I fell there. I'm like, oh, what the fuck? Pull that shit. Because I saw this leak, right? So I thought. I thought it'd be something like that. Ah, oh, come off it. Fear says Leaper confuses me. He confuses us all, this boy. <laughs> Bamboozling his way here. Kind of bothers me this part here. Kind of. You fuck. Oh, fuck off. No, you're doing all right, Mr. Lipper. You're doing good. All right. Fuck! Keep this one here is weird. I don't know if it's tilting. Oh, uh, I don't know if I'll have... Uh, I don't know how to do it, but I might need help today. I'll be, let me think here. So nine o'clock, yeah, 9 p.m. here. So in a, see, I'll play for like 20, 25 more minutes. <laughs> been, been a while, so I need a CRT mode. You get a CRT, man. Uh, I need help today. I didn't have time to look it up. Is it, um, Sending a raid. Is that the hard thing to do? I would like to know if Feeder House has been sending raids here or, or anybody uh, anybody that I know here. If sending raids are uh, easy to know how people are if people are online that I know. And if that's okay. That's the way it works. I would like to I, I think that would be the polite thing to do, right? Too bad I haven't I haven't figured out how to do it. And if feeder house, maybe if he's streaming, send you out there. He does. Ah! I would host. So you mean Pavard? You you stream as well, and you. I would host any anyone the the raid. Is that what you mean? You know, people send raids here. I'm very grateful, so I would like to be able to do the same thing, but I'm, I'm too, I've been too stupid to do it. It's just, just out of time, man. Fucking, I did look into it, and then it got, it got fucking complicated. I learned, I like, the method that you type the name and raid, but then you don't know if the person's online. And the guy said it could be, oh, it could be awkward to send a raid to somebody who's not online. Ah, oh, man. You can technically raid even if you're offline. This shit again? Fucking stop. God, the audio's gone nuts. 
The audio's gone nuts. Fuck you. Sorry about that. Jesus fucking Christ. Sorry, is the audio is uh I don't know I uh, I it's something here I think is the, the the game the little box on my uh, headphones it, it it did that a fucking gazillion times today it did a gazillion times on like randomly doing digital farts here. the fucking digital <laughs> the digital audio farts say so, say so, so there's always a new thing with Twitch I don't know like with with the host function you could host someone's stream on your channel when you were offline they removed it you can host someone who's offline I don't want to do that. I don't. I, want, I, I don't know. I don't want to shoot count. Nothing to come. Just, just rage. Just send it. When I'm done, send it. Send it. Whoever's online. If there's nobody online, then forget it. I guess. But I would like to know what if the process is hard to do. Like to to. The way I, I imagine is like I can go on the actual Twitch, right? Start the browser, and look. Click on something. Ideally, it would be like raid, and click on something somebody was online and send people there. That's simple, but it's never that simple, is it? Or is it? Maybe it is, and I just don't know. I mean, the type of one, I have to go online and see who's online, I guess. Ideally, Feeder House is online. I would like to send it his way, or... I don't know, if you send... Ah! Somebody. No, see, that's the thing. Shiro Ben says, type raid name. But the, the, the raid name is like you can't see who is online here. So if you send the people and there, there's nobody online, it's kind of fucked. And there's a click raid and choose. So Twitch dashboard, that's the one I'm interested in. So, Cause you can see, if you go on the Twitch dashboard, on the dashboard and you see, you will see it. That's what I want. I don't want the, the I don't like the, ty the typing one. I don't like that. And the keyboard is fucked here anyways. So dashboard and you'll see it. All right, I want to, I want to try that. Once it's time, I'll try that. Send y'all somewhere. You don't have to stay with just one. Come on! I want to send, this, this is, I did a stage here before. No, I didn't, I'm full of shit. Come on, come on. Take it seriously, a little, little bit. Stop! This, this one is fucked. This light stream quick, and then stop. Stop! No! I'm, I'm gonna take a look at that real quick, because that shouldn't long. So, dashboard, parachute. I'll go here, Twitch. Just, just checking real quick. And then, come on, you fuck. Twitch, and then... Creator dashboard. And then parachute. I'm not. Where's the parachute? Motherfucking parachute, man. Don't. I don't see no parachute. I'm on a creator dashboard and I, I, I just don't see it. Wait. Nope. Whispers. Don't even know what that is. No. Don't see that there. The symbol of the parachute and quick actions. Nah, I don't. I, I need. I didn't like it. Okay, I'm on the dashboard. And quick actions. Where? Where's quick actions? That on the left, on the right, on top. I don't see fucking quick actions here. I mean, I can literally read it. Uh, uh, <clears throat> it gave me an access denied. I'm not allowed to. Go to this page. What are you on about? I own this motherfucking page. I own this motherfucking page. Eat the page. What was that bullshit? Said I didn't have permission. Fucking quick. I don't know. No. I mean, you told me dashboard. I mean, 
I thought I went creator dashboard. Stream manager, okay. Oh, now we're talking. Stream manager, yeah. I'm, I'm always on OBS. My browser's not open. So, parachute. Oh, I see a parachute. Ray channel. Okay, I see it. If I click on it now, it will be. A, it's not right away. I rate it and just go, right? I see the parachute. And then what? Do I, I click. I click on it once, or after I click on it, the uh, uh, channels will be shown. Click on a parachute and see people you follow that are online. So click on it. Okay. Why well, I, I got a I got a big bag of nothing. I mean I clicked there, but channels I follow there's nobody. I don't want to raid anybody big. Nothing came up. So if I click there and I don't see nobody online, then it's fine not to raid, right? How do you write? Can you raid random small channels? Is that a thing that people do? I just want to be polite here, that's all. I don't want to be, you know, because I already feel bad. I don't have time to watch other people's streams because I, I can't, I don't have the time. So at least I can do is is raid, raid, raid if I can, you know? I raid my friend. Now I would like to raid, yeah, you can raid. But you have to search them yourself. Uh, I, d I wouldn't even know how to do that. That's, that's tough. Mm. Okay. Ah. Fuck. Fucking hell. Whoa, whoa. Why is this one so. Like, stop here. Just stop. What are you doing, dude? Why you do shit like this? Fuck! No, I don't... I, like, I don't know about looking for random channels. Maybe if I learn how to do it quickly. I mean, it, it is nice, right? I mean, but... But at the same time, like, how does it... Oh, fuck! This thing is gonna open it. Come on, stop fucking goofing up! Jesus fucking Christ. You motherfucker, you're crazy. Oh, there you go. I ask the viewers they know something. That's a good solution. Yeah, I'll do that at the end if y'all want. You know? I gotta ask y'all. There you go. That's the best thing to do, I guess. Yes, just ask your chat. However, if Feeder House is on, then I'll send it to him. Uh, LOL Wolf Shoe, he, he raided me. Nah. So obviously, because they've done it first for me. And I like Theater House. Who did? Now, this is. What the fuck is this here? Oh, man. Satsun said I was gonna look for something. I didn't even know you was looking for something. What are you looking for, Satsun? <laughs> I, I, yeah, I think I have my fuel of monkey ball for today. Let me see the time here. Yep, that's uh, that's enough monkey ball for a while. I'll show, I'll do this the usual CR, uh, what's it called? I started too late today, but the hardware showcase thing. That's it. Oh wow, so you get a lot of points here even if you don't make on the expert mode. Thanks for playing. You're welcome. Yeah, I think that's uh, that's it for the monkey ball. We mon we're monkey balled here for, for about eight hours. I think that's a good amount of monkey ball stuff. And I'll show the uh, the usual. The the CRT is very 
I can start showing now some of the things that I like about VGA monitors. So okay, I don't, there's no need to save it. Why, why do you ask? Okay, this game asks, that's enough. It asks me for, for, a save, for a memory card. So what are you saving here? My high scores, is that it? Go to option here. Game data. Yeah. There you go. Save it. Yeah. Satchin, they said I was going to look for something. The chat, that again, the, the bullshit with the chat, the, the welcome to the chat crap. I'm wondering. When people go very quiet, I'm wondering if the, the, the chat is fucking up or something. Are y'all there? Is anybody there? Y'all still around? Okay, just check. So you said they were gonna look for something. What a channel? What are you, what are you on about? Sad zone. I rarely will find someone to raid. <coughs> I usually watch German streamers. I mean, and them are good in English. I was gonna look for a channel to raid, but I got distracted. It's <laughs> a funny one. <laughs> find that funny. All right, I want to start showing a tiny bit of the monitor before I turn it off here. Oh shit, I think I fucked up with one thing. Me... Alright, I need to, I think I need to physically get it. Back with some nice food. Yeah, Mr. Dave, we're talking about is enough monkey ball, the monkey ball stuff is done. So I'm gonna do the uh, hardware showcase a little bit. I'm just saying here, if I, I think I might have goof. Let me, let me think. Hmm, could it be more clear? Um, okay. Okay, I want to show the Swiss around. There we go. Get back in there. A bit of the Swiss stuff. Browser just crashed. So yeah, that's the Swiss. You can you can do a lot of stuff with it if you're not familiar with it. It's it's very good. Go around it here. Oh yeah, I was telling you the 240p test suite. I don't know if you'll build in 240p because if it does this monitor, it won't have none of it. There's this one here. There goes European is my Swiss. You know why they call it Swiss? Uh, is be I'll see. That's what happens. It's not okay. So, video two forty p. I can still see. See so if you go here, and you go to. This is kind of tripped. What are you doing? I need four eighty p. Oh, there we go. Four eighty p mix. Four eighty p scale. Four four eighty p. For fuck's sake. Okay, let's get the fuck out of here. The fuck is this? Yeah, because it's the Swiss Army Knife. That's pretty much what the name comes from, as far as I understand. Uh, this is a lot easier to do on the regular, not a regular, but the uh, 480p CRT I have here, because it also does 240p. Now, this VGA monitor doesn't do 15 kilohertz, so that means 480i and 240p, well, we saw what happens. It uh, It doesn't like it. Yeah, it does all sorts of stuff. Like you have, I don't know, let's see, cheats. You can put a cheat files here. I don't cheat in games, but I like that. That also includes widescreen hacks and stuff like this, which is primarily what I use uh, on the Swiss. I, I don't know what you're doing. Can you, you, you can change. You can go back to like a regular, the, the regular uh, GameCube screen 
like you can go here and change you can go to SD card your memory card your, your DVD the system it can have access to the system let's go back to the and then uh, some of the stuff I don't know I don't know I don't know what that is uh, yeah uh, I can run anymore it doesn't run very well but it can get let's see see I haven't touched this forever I have the actual thing you can run uh, why are you telling me I don't have any games here oh yeah they need they, they need to be on a SD card that's what's going on uh, you can play any ass you know and uh, but I don't have the ROMs here I don't I have an NES so there's no reason I did it for just because if there's something that can be done I tend to do it so can you run the NES on a GameCube and I wanted to do it you know to see what it what it looks like and then here you can go here and you choose your games and you have a wide array of options uh, you know my SD card is not too big so I just have a few games like I played this I put Metroid Prime 2 because I played the first one I never got to play this one Luigi's Mansion, I'll be playing that here some point soon. Kirby, I ride this for my daughter. She loves that stuff. She loves Kirby a lot. Uh, we got more parties. Sometimes I'll play as We haven't done it forever. Uh, this is something I'll do a very long time from now. Uh, this is solely here because of Mortal Kombat 2. So you can. Is that running? Uh, so you can go settings. I can't imagine playing Mortal Kombat with this. With this, yeah, it shows you the temp. It's fucking awesome. This program is is fucking is great. So I can go here and you load your games. It can go if you have cheats. You go here. You just have to have the file named the same way. But just just for a goof, I put this game here quickly. It's patching that many files because this is a collection of games. They're treated separately. See. Uh, I don't think that works. Where's Mortal Kombat here? What, what would that be? Now this one is a bit complicated. She's a game, I don't know, Cosmic. It's an old arcade like collection. I don't know, I never played this fucking game. What am I doing here? Is that the guy from the... That's uh, I never, <laughs> never played it. It looks weird. It's like, it's like pixel arts, and there's some pixel art, and there's some kind of like the, what the fuck you bitch. I'll be playing this type of game though, not this one in particular. If you let me, I'll play those retro games here. I just get it. I get entangled with them, even though this one I, I think it looks like shit a little bit. I, I can get past the uh, the pixel art being mixed with uh, the basic MS Paint looking stuff getting mixed up with a uh, with the 3D assets. But then again, if you if you leave me, I'll just go here because like uh, something is happening. The fuck? There's a black hole. Fuck you, man! Come on! Uh, Shiro Bana says a console. Where's Mortal Kombat? I think it's because I'm forcing at 480p, that's the problem. Uh, a console. Well, you like Dr. Evil with a co- a console? It is a console. It just comes with, it, with its own CRT. You don't need a quote console when you talk about the Vectrix. It, it's, a, it's a legitimate console. And they have flashcards for you that's cheap so you don't have to buy the games. Uh, the Vectrix is awesome and I really regret not getting one soon. I can't even imagine the prices. <laughs> you see, I started a few years ago and I there's some stuff that I didn't get and I kinda, yeah, kinda feel, I feel bad. Cause of like, you know, I didn't get the fucking thing, and the prices are going nuts. And now I just, okay, just trying to show around here. What else is in here? You know, 
But the Vector, yeah, the Vector is a full blown console. That's, uh, it has, actually, the controls have even analogs. You know, the Vector, actually, like the stick thing, is, is actually analog. Mike should show you his very old console. I don't want to get it now. It's uh, it's on the fourth part of the. Uh, oh, uh, if you really want to see it, just just go on YouTube. It's uh, the fourth, the last part, part four, and it is, it is chapter. I put, I made a joke even. I put Magnavox Odyssey. Get it like they spell Oddworld, Abe's Odyssey. Uh, and you can see it there. And I I will find a way to have it here. I need a 20 inch CRT it looks like by the overlays and uh, I need uh, it's it's it requires a very specific power adapter uh, 500 milliamps I will probably talk with Jerome before it is a very very valuable historical console it does have a lot of problems you have to tinker with it's from 1972 for crying out loud and uh, yeah, and the Nintendo ones I'll be doing a stream on it. I'll, I'll be doing a stream once I have all the Nintendo Pong consoles. I will raise awareness for it because a lot of people they think the Famicom is the first console and it's, it's not. And Nintendo hit the ground running because their Pong is not nothing. Because I seen people making videos on them. People don't know they. Do, I don't know what they do there. They just. I think if you're making a video about history of stuff, you should do some research to know what you're talking about, right? I've seen people say, ah, it's just a Pong console like uh, anybody else. No, it's not. Uh, Nintendo's Pong console was the most sold console of that generation. It was 3 million, 3 million units sold. By far, the second place was like a million. So it was actually very successful, the color TV game. And that's why the Famicom, if, if that wasn't successful, there would be no Nintendo as we know today. So, uh, the, the, the Vectrex is, is amazing, definitely. I do want to get one real bad. Uh, people love that console. I usually actually watch a German guy, he had a very heavy accent. And uh, Vectrex Vec, Rolly, I think is the name. He's top uploading, I think. And, uh, and here's the GBI. You know, I'll be, I play GameCube here, before, did I? I did Gargoyles Quest. I don't think that was a stream. I think that was a video. Okay, it was just a video on YouTube. So this GBI is amazing. It, when I play the Game Boy here, I'll show it. Uh, GBI speedrunning standard GHC firmware. You've been knowing what the GH, uh, GCHD is. Is this what Genesis? Yeah, but I don't have the ROMs here. So that's a, you need to have the ROMs on a on a on one of the, there's a there's like a memory card with a little SD card slot, and this is useful. This saved my ass today. I came here to play Monkey Ball and was actually this one here, uh, and you can you can back up your memory card, you know. But I don't have the I don't need it right now. So it needs it needs to work and you have a, a thing here. With uh, with a memory card you want to back up. Basically, I took all my Resident Evil 4 saves today and transferred to a memory card with an SD card here, and then formatted this this memory card so to be able to save Monkey Ball here. Retro arches in here. Patches. We 64. It says N64 emulator. Doesn't work very well though. And Virtua Virtua Boy. What if I click on it? Well, you need the ROMs anyways. So if you have the ROMs, then just here, just need to have the thing inserted. The directors are ready. I have it, and then it'll just show up here. Uh, what video will I find a console live for? Um, so if you go on my YouTube page, same name, CRT Rex, the last video, and just look in the chapter, you see it's very short. We had a whole talk about a little powwow here about the Magnavox Odyssey. It's basically the first console, the first video game console ever made. And I uh, happened to spontaneously just, I don't know how we came, came up in conversation, and, uh, but it did. And I, I went to the house, picked it up, and brought it here, and we had a talk about it. It was, was kind of cool, I guess. Yeah, found it, yeah. And that's, some, that's the first home console ever made. So it's the jewel of my collection because it's the first. Yeah, so without that, there would, there would be nothing. 
the movies don't really work. Look, I have Rick and Morty here. But I think it just errors out. I couldn't I couldn't fucking get this shit to work. Yeah, it didn't work. I was testing it. Event Horizon, look at that. Uh oh yeah, this one is connected. This will be the, I think the most interesting part will be this connected with VGA. Uh and let's get to it. Let's show it. I'm gonna go turn on the light. Yeah, Satchon, you wanna hang hang around here because I'm gonna show what I'm gonna show is very interesting. It is a way to have the GameCube. Well, technically, the cable is fucking rare. I, I bought it cheap. I came across as a Wii cable. But it, 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 it happened to fit the GameCube perfectly here for my application. And that's why I love the GCHD thing. Because people go, Carby, Carby, Carby. Carby is good, but it just worked for me. Very good. What game would come up next? Now, you know, I'm thinking, I... I I will definitely go back to this game. Fucking hell, I loved it. Uh, I played Castlevania before, the first one. So it's not, but it was not on stream. I'm thinking I'm, I have a Castlevania each right now. I think I want to play the Castlevania one again. I know it's like, you know, people on YouTube, me. <laughs> you already played this one. <laughs> Fuck you. Play whatever I want. I want to play the fucking game again. I think I want to play Castlevania, but it would be nice if I play the Famicom, but then I would like to play the Famicom this system, which I can do it now, but I was really hoping to wait is one of those very special games. I was actually, I can play it now in multiple ways in original hardware. I have something called FDS Stick, which is pretty much, you still have to use the RAM adapter and simulate. I might just use that. I was hoping to buy, the, I want to buy the disc, the actual Famicom disc system disc for the Castlevania because it's, it's, I love the franchise. That's the first game ever. That's how it came out. It came out on a floppy disc. And uh, I really wanted to, wanted to have that. So it would be nice if I could do that with that, the thing actually in because it's a special occasion. So what I'll be playing next, I, I'm not sure right this moment, uh, but uh, definitely older, you know, than this. Because I did play, you know, I did play the PS1 and the GameCube, so I would like to go back to retro stuff now, a tiny bit. So, show the ass end of this hardware. Yeah, let's do it. Let's, uh, let me go uh, turn on the lights here. Oh, let me just show this what's cool. So when, when I first came in here today, right, and that's what's cool about VGA, because before I turn this off. So, it's so okay, you go. So I came in today, I just, vertical, see here. The size. Fuck off, come on. What are you doing here? Oh, there we go. So yeah, this is a vertical size. So, so it was like this, I, I, I adjusted it perfectly, right? So this is what I was talking about, a four, you know, the 480p and so okay, so let's let's go here and I'll just start monkey ball, see what happens. Come on. And then so perfectly aligned here, right? So I go and then you go to the the games. Let's go to monkey ball here again. And then monkey ball, again, because most of you miss the beginning of the stream. Monkey ball is a powerhouse to show uh, demonstrate here. Because uh, with, with the power of modded consoles and all that, you can do on actual, or like unmodded, you know, the, the mods they have is not just playing backup games. It's all sorts of, that's the thing with Swiss. A Super Monkey Ball is 480i only. It never came out in 480p. But when you have Swiss, and of course you have the means, the component cable, or some kind of, uh, you know, the, the adapters they have now, HDMI, whatever, whatever the fuck you're using. So you can go here and go to settings and this, this is how it is, force video mode. And it's 480p. And that's it, that's the only reason Monkey Ball is played. So if I had a stock, uh, you know, GameCube, no mods to it, no nothing, and I had just a disc, the actual game, I wouldn't be able to play on this monitor, it's not possible. Because this monitor is 31 kilohertz only, no 480i, no, nothing below 480p. So the only other way it would be like with some fucking scaler or something. So yeah, so when, but it, yeah, and then when you, and then another thing is good about VGA mine. So when you play the game, boot. So it goes video mode, NTSC, thank you. No, none of that power shit, we already been through that. So there you go. There's a, it's, it's not full 480p, right? So then it, 
Then you simply go here. And that's what I love about those monitors. They're just vertical. And then there's no fixed pixels, eh? And then that's it. Adjust it. Okay, a little bit. No, down. Down this way. And there you go. Perfectly. And it's all native resolution, obviously, on the CRT. There you go. All right, I'm gonna go turn all the light on. We'll come back and we'll take a look at this here. Uh, what's going on here under the hood? Let's take a look at this uh, GameCube and monitor and everything. But I don't know, I'll see about the game to play next, or what, what's gonna be, I'm not sure. Uh, but definitely, I think that must have a little bit more retro than this. All right then, so let's, let's do this thing. Uh, right? Yep. The fuck was that sound? Love that sound. Okay. Why are you freaking out of here, dude? Come on. Okay, so this is the monitor. I uh, lost my folder that tells me all the... Getting quite warm here, buddy. So that's what it looks on the side. And it's very simple on the back. Here's a... Oh yeah, I wanna show that. Do you think that's enough splitters? Do you reckon? I think we could use more. I, I don't know. Splitting the splitter with the other splitter and then a split again. I think we need. To, I think we could do better, gentlemen. I don't think. I don't think this is acceptable. And of course, I have to have a yellow one that pisses me the fuck off. Yeah, definitely. There's something on the chain of command here, and and, tr and trust me, I actually need those things. I need, you know, I need the split because it's splitting here to my headphones. It's, it's a whole mess. Um, so the VGA comes here. So let's move this here. So I'm plug the VGA for now. You see? Mm-hmm. Sometimes I look at those cables here. My head wants to explode. I might have an extra on electronics RCA split. Oh my god, that would be so good. I'm so sick of this shit here. I'm trying my best to work to work what I got, man. But it's sometimes like and you're looking where the cables are going and holy fucking shit, my head is just gonna sometimes I wanna just run, run away from here, you know. Let's see. Like this here, what the f it's tied up everywhere. It's fucked. How the fuck did I start on the VGA cable and ended up on the power cable? That's what I want to fucking know. I started on a fucking VGA cable and somehow I'm grabbing a power cable. I'm off it. Again. Dude. What the fucking VGA? What are you on about? Ah, fuck off. Let me get this out. Damn it! Fucking start on the VGA and then I fall on the cable. All of a sudden, I'm I'm grabbing a power cable that's not related to anything that I'm doing here. So this here finally gets. I knew it because see, I looked it up. A model that looks just like this, and it's E 
this is a Dell E771P. There was one that's E772P, but I remember it was a one. Focus it. Oh, and I, I always fucking forget this shit. Once the CRT is off, I can put the lights up. There we go. <laughs> so it's not a splitter, it's a switcher, four input, one output. I'm still interested. Still, I, I do it because I have a, I have a, I have a splitter. I need a splitter in the living room. If you ever come here to visit, I hope you do. Uh, you'll see it's dog shit, and it's, it's not working out. So I, I would very much welcome a, a splitter as well. So for now, we unplug. Sorry about the mess. It's just the cables, man. They're is that hard? Bullshit. I I plug this here, you asshole. Them fucking make it look like you're hardwired in there. The VGA is hardwired, so. And there you go, so that's the end. So the, those computers, they're very basic, so they come out. Thank you very much, Jerome. One day I need to get a split or a switch or two, but for RGP, yeah, this, this card switch. Yeah, they get entangled, Palver, that's true. It's fucking, I, that's my life. I'm Mike the Cable Guy here. So yeah, this just has a, a VGA. I mean, what, what else is to talk about here? It's a VGA, a three pin power plug and you're done. You know, as long as they have uh, 31 kilohertz above, that will do fine. So for now, I'll put you... <sighs> see, I just had a power cable and so it's already lost here. I'll see if I don't even know if I'll be able to do the commercial thing today. I forgot completely. I got tangled up and... Uh, can turn this one off here. Fuck off, my good sir. Fuck the hell. Just write a fuck off. And, and I'll see if I'll be able to do the commercials like I usually do. Uh, I get in here. Your fucking British blogs are disgusting. Bring it out. Cancerous. It's toxic. It's poison to me. Fucking hell. Oh my god, just I wanna move past the cable part. Let's let's move past this for crying out loud. Enough is enough, yeah. Thank you. I appreciate the service. But let's Okay. Alright, finally. Your arm says see you later folks. I'm gonna eat. Good night. Have a good night. This shed is some sort of trading base, I swear. <laughs> I love like that. Everyone helps everyone if they can. And listen, Mr. Leaf, I'll send you the, the thing later about the, G, the GBCS, GB cunt. I don't know. Uh, I don't have it here right now, and it's, it's fucking some, it's a bunch of boxes. So it's not, I can't just go in the house and pick it up right now. Otherwise, I would, it crossed my mind to do it. I uh, can go ahead and unplug the power here. And we're gonna take a look at this here GameCube now. Sorry for the delay here. There's a lot of fucking cables and shit. Okay. There we go. Okay. But I, I, I it's hard for me to go like 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 on on uh, unplug this on uh, on what's it called red is not red is uh. I don't do it often. I mean I know I know we did the the, uh, the Discord yeah. I'm not, I don't, I don't usually chat a, a lot, I'm not a big chatter, and now that I'm streaming all the time, it's, it's a bit tough, but I definitely will show you there what's going on, and add your own good night. So yeah, that's a, it's a PSU, I mean, it's a fucking PSU. I find it funny, those things here, you know, oftentimes I forget, and I think they're vents, and I feel bad, like, is this touching something, like, I go, I go today, I, I want to put it there in a the corner, there in a corner. I went like this and I, oh, I'm covering the vents. There's no vents. It's just, what is this? I don't know what that is. I didn't ask for this. Don't, don't need vents. Vent, fake vents. I don't know what that is. So there you go. Controller. Everybody knows the GameCube controller, but now this is an awesome controller. I hate touching it with my bare hands, but I mean, the D-pad is not actually bad. It's a, it's, if you say D-pad is bad, 
okay well then what about the Game Boy Advance uh, it's, it's pretty much the Game Boy Advance Game Boy Micro it's, it's a good pad but it's, it's awkward it's too small that's the problem when you see on a controller you're like ah eh. uh, I should change the power cable of my Super Nintendo got a loose contact probably a loose soldering joint somewhere all right, Satsu, you ready? Let's go. So let's take a look. Take a look here. Let's go right above it. I'm moving this here a tiny bit. Get as close as possible in the frame here. God damn it! All right, there we go. Okay. So memory card, of course. Get out. Put it here. Okay. So under the hood, this is the GC loader. There you go. So I do have. So basically, I just love those ODs. I fucking love them. Put your uh, USD card in there, and you can put your Swiss. You can put so many. You can do back so many apps and things you can do. I don't know if they call apps. And I have a spare one here, just in case, you know, smaller one. And uh, that's it. This is a 3D mount. Before, like, it's awkward. It's in there. So, of course, you want the 3D mount. I try to get a purple. I mean, it kind of goes along. Yeah. And let's take a look at the back, what we have here. And there you go. This is the whole reason I can use the VGA. So, okay. Shiro says, uh, GameCube's a cool console. So, you're... Well, mine should buy one final fucking awesome console, a very good console. So this is the GCHD Mark II, and it has a few things going for it. I like first the first thing I like more than the other solutions like Carby and all is the dual output. So you have HDMI, real HDMI, right? It's digital, it's tapping digital, digital, and then because of digital, you need to have the digital port. For this to work, you can, some game cubes had that removed, and you cannot, uh, you cannot do it. Okay, and then uh, and here, and that's the thing. Here it has a port for uh, component cable, yeah, but not any component cable. The the Wii component cable. Now, I don't know if some of you are aware, the component cable for the uh, the game cube goes beyond fucking three hundred dollars sometimes it's ludicrous it's very expensive because it's a rare cable they didn't make many of them and but thankfully now we have modern solution now this here is for optical uh so you can have optical out the gamecube many of those other consoles that people don't realize have surround sound dolby and everything so this is because you can use toslink here it just needs this adapter you know uh so Thanks to this coincidence. So they made this here, the Wii, for the Wii component, for, in order for people to buy a Wii component cable, is a lot cheaper, it's very abundant. It's not like rare like the GameCube. And then that's why this happy little accident happened here. So I was searching eBay one time, and I came across this cable here. This beautiful specimen. It came in a bo box, and every, very professional, right? Uh, it's, I like the box, I don't forget, I have the box here somewhere, it goes, are you ready to play some Wii on VGA? It's like, fuck yeah, I'm ready. And then, there it goes, a VGA for the Wii, specifically for the Wii. Uh, and and then, you know, somebody who's knowledge will say, well, that's just a transcoder, it's transcoding component to, I don't fucking give a shit what it does, man. It is, this is, it's 480p and it goes there and it works on a VGA monitor, that's what the cable do I don't need any adapter and then turn out later I found found out I wonder I, I was so impressed by the cable I really like it and I put the Wii on, on VGA monitors before and uh, I went to look for it I couldn't fucking find it I kept looking and then I found threads saying how rare this cable is turned out the cable is rare and uh, it was a fluke and they're selling for expensive prices when they do sell but I got mine it was like 15 pounds or something it was if that it was very cheap and i would you know i just saw it while i was browsing and i decided why not buy it and i would be useful play i would like to play the wii i have vga monitors and then because this adapter here allows you to to use wii component cables i thought well 
by that logic, it should work. You make the GameCube work with the VGA, and it does. That's how we play today. So a beautiful, happy coincidence right there. Okay. And that's the Wii cable. I love this cable. It is awesome. And uh, there you go. The I don't have anything on right now, but there's a your Game Boy player. You can put your. Uh, I have the disc. It's useless now. From you know, it's not useless and it's not useless. I have a few GameCubes that are not, they don't have ODs, they have disc readers, so the Game Boy Player disc is still fucking useful as fuck, because that's the expensive bit, apparently. Uh, I usually remove it if I'm just playing the GameCube, but I, I've decided who, who I'm at, I'm doing that for who, you know, just uh, keep keep the, I don't like to plug and unplug my fucking hardware. Uh, it has a chip here, unfortunately, don't know where that come from, no, definitely not me. I have kids, I'll catch the little shits, I swear to God. So the fan here, and um, well, that, that's pretty much it. Uh, I have the same one PAL Platinum Silver, and it has the same GameCube loader, uh, the GC loader. A uh, wide remove if you can brag about it, yeah. It, was, it wasn't expensive when I got it, to be honest. It was uh, quite reasonable. Like I said, things are just going insane here with the, with the price. It was actually not, not that special when I bought it. I mean, I had a hard time with the disc, and at the time I needed it, I didn't have the GC loader. I had Swiss, and I had a chip GameCube. I still have it, it's my daughter's now. And, uh, but the the disc was the thing, yeah? Uh, so yeah, I have the Platinum Game Game Boy Player as well. It's insane, here it says insane, and it says pretty cool cable thing, why remove it? Yeah, that's right. No such thing as a GameCube does not even go purple. Uh, you f there is, the Platinum. The, the pump. You you hear the same thing for the people like the pumpkin spice one. Uh, I like the purple the best. Mm, I don't know. I'm torn. I don't. I, I I I refuse. I'm not. I'm not picking one. I like the platinum as well. Uh, he says insane prices of old game and it's is going insane. Yes, it's absolutely cuckoo. All the old cars are gone. Fucking. I'll never sell my Dodge Ram. Uh, and the classic antique cars are even worse. Yeah, that's it. That's 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 it for the GameCube, you know. And of course, the coolest shit is you can carry it like this, and it's fucking awesome. Oh, the only guy like the purple one. No, there's plenty of people that like the purple one. It's quite common. A lot of people like the purple one. Usually, people like it's the stock one, is the original one. So a lot of people like the original stuff, you know. <clears throat> Word about Manhunt for seven dollars four years ago, and now a hundred fifty. And it's hard to buy games. Yeah, fucking ODs, flashcards for me. I have zero fucking in because of that. I have zero fucking interest in buying games anymore. Hard uh, new games, I'll get it. Uh, retro games, no fucking way. I move completely a hundred percent of flashcards, ODs, hacks, uh, completely. My, it's my favorite color is the reason for you see for me it's hard because I, I say purple is my favorite but silver is my favorite color but then some people go, hey, silver is not a color it's it doesn't count and then okay the purple then so because I like silver and purple I like the silver better I guess because I really like silver yeah uh, okay and today today the uh, where's the fucking what's happening Today I'm playing the commercials here with the Xbox 360 because I that uh, the little v VCR thing, VCR, the little uh, DVD thing does not play. I'll go out of frame just in case there's my account or something. Uh, let's see, I'll turn this thing on. Is it on? Are you on, bitch? Ah, there we go. Okay, just give me a second. There you go. Yep, just give me a second here. Test. No, I'm I'm here. Uh, I'm I'm here. Just putting out a frame because I don't know if my accounts are showing or something. Okay, I don't think so. Yeah, it does. It does show the thing. That's so the three C. Obviously, you recognize the sound, right? 
Uh, five second delay. See what I see? Talk about manhunt too. I do need to find a better way to. Ah, is that the bass we have? Okay. Let me let me just go ahead and mute it. Just give me a second here, gentlemen. Uh, they ban at Germany. I like to ban everything. Fucking weird. Let's just make sure this works because I want to do my sign out. I don't like to break the the routine here. Just give me a second. Yeah, it will do. It will do, my good sir. Okay, now we're gonna put the collar bar in there. Yeah, so that's uh put in a frame here. That's the CRT there with the collar bars. And that's some more array I keep talking about. Nowadays we have way more uncut games in other places. Like what other places? Just Japan. Japan has cut things. No, nobody else is cutting anything. And by the way, I looked it up. Germany still cuts things. Uh, it's terrible. Germany is fucking terrible. It's a horrible thing. It's embarrassing. You, you cut things. I'll swear that's it. But there's no other place. And and. And Germany still cuts things. I seen a modern game, and I wasn't even looking for it. I said I looked it up. I didn't. I seen that somebody mentioned a, a game. Like, I'll, I'll find out later. But they're cutting like a lot of stuff. Yeah. Good game. You shouldn't have zero. You should have zero cuts. Cutting games is, is terrible. It's a terrible thing. I hate it. I fucking hate it. It's just, you know. But the rating system is already in place. There's no fucking need, like zero need to cut anything. You know? Thought Apescape, it got German on a version. I bought, yeah. Gotta be careful buying PAL. I think you shouldn't buy it at all, but it's your money. Okay. <laughs> I avoid a whole thing, so I don't have that problem. <laughs> you see, she pay me to uh, to have your pal things, and I probably wouldn't do it still. That's how I roll I'm on the the pal hate train. Right? <laughs> okay. All right, I think uh, that that's harsh. Not just me polite. I mean, if I was to talk what I really think about Pal, I would just probably, I would probably explode here in a in a like a, the burning bush. Like I, uh, you know, I'd rather burn everything Pal in his collect. Mike would rather burn and sell it, sell it to him. Imagine being me. Living in a kind of four language one which I understand one. Ah, fuck that. That's palish. Can't stand it. I wish he had never existed. Or I wish I wish that guy, I forgot his name, that, that he just made a 60 hertz. Just like, I don't know what the, what, what goes through your head. Like, the 60 hertz was good enough. Everybody was, come off it. Just fucking do it. You know. 60 hertz, it would be fine. Pal 60 from the get-go. I'll never have a problem with Pal if it was that. Never. It's the 50 hertz, I guess. Not, not, not really the Pal. Give me Pal 60. I, I love it. I have no, no difference for me. It's, it's great. You get the stability uh, of the collars of Pal with the 60 hertz as it should be. So, so yeah. Okay. Okay, I think that's about it. I'll put the GameCube here in the frame when I sign out. Anyways, that's a GameCube. Good old GameCube. And yeah, I see the difference. I have a uh, okay. This other GameCube here, right? See, it looks uh, considerably taller. Fuck off. So this other GameCube here is a. Uh, so yeah, if you have like a fuck, 
come on and yeah look at that it looks very different you know when one is a i guess so you should see in this when i see it here it feels naked you know when you look at the gamecube it's such a difference on the well this one is actually open you can see the inside oh that's what the gamecube looks like inside huh? if you haven't seen it just in case I've opened game cubes before and cleaned them up and did things. So, yeah. Careful. Yeah, just go in here then for now. Give me trouble here. Romanche. R O M A N S C H. From Switzerland, yes, Romanche, the Alpine language. I only, I only know that because, you know, I'm, I'm into geography. My mom lived in there. So, so I knew even when I was a kid because she'd talk about. She lived in Switzerland. She'll, she'll talk about the Romanche. She'll talk about, like, the mountain folks and all that. Sounds romantic. <laughs> it does. Romance. It's fancy, yeah. It sounds fancy, it really does. This kind of makes a tad in German some mountain stuff. Yes. Yeah, it's very interesting. It's very interesting country, that's for sure. It's very there's nothing quite like it have a four different languages and everybody gets along. I, I really admire Switzerland. That's, uh, I, have a, I have a very good opinion on it about the country. Definitely. Switzerland is beautiful. It's very beautiful too. It's very beautiful. It's got everything. The only thing is downside is it's very expensive. But uh, I think when you work there you'll probably earn more. So, you know. Yeah, it is very beautiful. It is extremely beautiful, that's for sure. It's a very beautiful country. Yeah, no doubt about it. All right, what time? Uh, 8.44? All right, uh, let me, oh, let me check the uh, the raid thing. Huh? Oh, I don't think I'll be able to do anything with it, though. Let's see here, but I remember where to go. Oh, I got tired now. Let me see. Uh, I go to just a minute. Uh, and I go to what now? It's not. Oh, a uh, stream manager, right? Ah, uh, so many places you go here. Video producer channel. All right, I forgot. I, I fucking I can't. Where was the parachute? Stream manager. Now, I, I mean, stream. Well, where is stream manager? Come in, stream manager. Where are you? Stream manager. Ah, uh, I'm too old for this shit, man. Oh, there we go. Fucking hell. Stream manager parachute there's nobody here there's nobody online that I know fuck it and I, I don't I can raid I don't I, I'm, I do does anybody have anything to raid I'll play my anthem here play the outro or whatever and uh, no I found it uh, anybody wants to raid anything because if not I'm gonna sign out I mean it's 930 I I usually am in bad by 10 Final Fantasy 15 speedruns. Okay, so, so okay, so um, I have a friend. His school runs F. Okay, give me the. Uh, so is he online right now? Okay, so. Let me cut the keyboard in here.
So what? Give me the name of the channel without. So it's you know. So it's rat. So it's dash raid. Yeah. Sorry, it's slash raid and then channel, and no space. Is there a space between a channel? Do I need to use brackets? It says channel ma management start a goal. I don't want to start a goal. Never, never tell me to start a goal again. So, space between the raid and channel. Well, if it doesn't work, I'll be here still. I'll mute the mic and the channel is OA, at OA, is that it? So, slash raid at OA, is that it? Come on. Where are you? I think the chat is that, is it? I won't be I won't be able to raid if I don't have the name here. I'm not I'm not hundred percent. Just the name at OA. I'll raid okay, thank you. But the other way around. Okay, so I put so the other way around, put the name and then slash raid. Why is everything so fucking complicated here? Fucking hell. So other way around. I'm very confused and I'm, I'm very old and alone and, and sad. I just want you. This is. I'm not liking this. I don't I don't like the dash other way around. Okay. Oh, thank you. Did that well? Okay, got you. Okay. Raid. Okay. While well, you. Okay, it's fine. That's it. All right, I'm signing out. I'm doing my thing, though. You're sitting through the fucking anthem. If you want to go on the raid. It's part of the deal, and and then that's it. And then I'm out. I press enter, but I'll wait a tiny bit to see that y'all gone. Uh, tell Maddie, because uh, usually I know it's the protocol, the etiquette, whatever. You go in there and said talk to the rate. I'm too fucking tired, so just tell Maddie that I said hi, and uh, wish him the best. Okay. All right. Are we cool. Are we we happy, Vincent? Good shit, good shit. So, all right, play my outro. I am out of here like yesterday's beer. Thank you very much for y'all that watched today. I hope you enjoyed the stream somewhat. And uh, and that's it, you know. So, muting the mic, thank you very much. And I hope you uh, see you next time here. Have a good night. talking again with a muted mic sorry uh okay with that we conclude our broadcast thank you very much and i appreciate your politeness you've been awesome thank you so after this I
and between you and me here, not that everybody has left, just a lunatic of the shed, the raid worked. So, awesome stuff. They're happy. I'm glad I was able to be nice and polite. So, good night. Thank you.